Hello everyone, welcome back to Rob's Gaming Table. I'm Rob. I'm Mel. And we're here to play some more Harry Potter. Hogwarts Battle. The deck building game. Published by the Op Games. This time, we're playing with the Monsters Box of Monsters Monster Edition Monster Expansion. You think it has monsters in it? Monsters. No, it has creatures. Seriously. There's no cards in here called monster cards, and it's the Monsters Box of Monsters. Garbage! Oh. Throw garbage it expansion, out. throw it Send in the it garbage. Back. Garbage. Garbage, garbage, garbage. I needed monster cards. Y yeah, I know. Yeah, it's the creature dead. cards. No, no, it just adds creature cards. Oh, so it should have been called the creature box expansion. Yeah. Yeah, the creature box of creatures. Yeah. Or the monster box of creatures. Or the creature box of monsters. Yeah, so automatically it gets a 2 out of 10. <laughs> Haven't even played it yet. 2 out of 10. Done. <laughs> There's your review. Thanks for watching. That's that's your answer to need to buy it. No, don't buy this silly, silly mismatch of names. <laughs> Hello, Yogi. Hello, oh. Sean. Game afternoon, says Sean. Oh, I like gaming it. Gaming family. Ha a gaming game afternoon. Gaming family. Ha ha. Good <laughs> to see you, Yogi. We did have some serious fun gaming with Rob and the chat. No doubt, board gaming did take a back seat. Ha ha. Yesterday. Uh, yeah, maybe I would have streamed a solo game yesterday, maybe, but I, don't I was know. still painting the one you probably would have yeah, played. Yeah, I so. know. So it's like, sorry, it's my fault. People always assume if I if I play a digital game, and I get complaints even on digital board games. If I play a digital game, like a video game or a game that's like the same theme or related to board games we're playing, people are like, "Oh, why aren't you streaming board games?" It's like, well, I wouldn't have been streaming at all right now, so it's like. Either I'm streaming this video game all day long, or I'm not streaming anything. So it's like, it's not like it takes away, but I probably, probably would have streamed the solo game on like Friday, maybe, instead of playing the game. But again, the game came out, it's that, it's that time of year when, when a big game comes out, I'm going to play it. And that's what I'm going to do. But yeah, the Monster Book is in the movies too. It's a play on the Monster Book of Monsters from book. Oh, and the movies. Okay, I see. I figured it's something in there, but like... We're know. just, yeah, we're just but then I was trying like, to be funny, but we're not Yeah, funny. yeah. And I was like, oh, it's all <laughs> villains and creatures. Where's the monsters? Uh, but yeah. Yogi says, so good. Oh, the game. Video game or, or this expansion? Yeah, Yogi, what are you talking yeah, about? Yeah, Yogi, what are you talking about? Remember, there's a delay. So when you're like replying to me, it's like, could be something I said like, I don't know, 20 seconds ago. I don't even know. You're in Australia. It's probably something I said 30 minutes ago. I don't oh. even know. Both? Oh, okay. <laughs> Makes sense. Nice, nice. I am excited for this. Yes, and Sean says yes, that I am. I am looking forward to this today. Yeah, nice. Cool. Thank you to all our Patreon and YouTube members. Uh, thank you for supporting the channel. Thanks to everyone dropping super chats in the streams and stuff. We appreciate you supporting this. Full disclosure, uh, the expansion we're playing today, just like the base set we were playing with the expansion, we're purchased from our local game stores. Two different stores, but still purchased from local game stores. Um, so thank you to the support of these awesome folks and others uh, for supporting the channel. Okay, thank you. And uh, funding the games, the equipment, the traveling to conventions, and all said shenanigans involved around the channel. Painting supplies. I always forget to say that one. I know. I don't. I mean, I do. I, I bought the airbrush thingy, the airbrush like hood thingy. I bought all of the bottles of primer instead of the cans we buy primer still in yeah. cans like and yeah if i miss if i run out of paint i'll <laughs> tell him to throw them on order yeah yeah that, yeah putting paint balls of paint on orders to get free shipping mm -hmm. uh that's a new thing yeah uh, for us uh and it's uh helpful yeah but this thank you for supporting the channel we're gamers just like you guys uh we appreciate all the support uh to help fund the hobby and uh yeah we'll keep rolling uh, Zolt here says, hello, I found your channel today. Awesome, welcome. What? Welcome. Just today, that's cool. I love Harry Potter Hogwarts Battle. I have played it through several times. I am so excited for the stream. Just watch your very first episode of game one to three. Awesome. Well, uh, I'm so glad you're here. Yes, thank you for joining. Uh, we are playing this blind today, so that reminds me. Uh, we're playing this for the first time, the monster stuff. I did read through the rules quickly this morning. Doesn't seem too bad, but I don't know what any of the cards do. Uh, I did sleeve up. Oh, I did sleeve up some cards already. So I opened some stuff out of the box just to leave it up to speed up that point so you guys aren't watching the sleeve cards. We still might if I change my character, but I don't think I'm going to. Based on what I've read she does here, uh, she could be cool, but I don't know. I don't think so. Anyways. 
Um, Sean says you'll have plenty of free time tomorrow, seeing a Super Bowl day. I bet you'll hit up Harry Potter Legacy or Hogwarts Legacy during the Super Bowl game. I was debating it, but Sean, related to that, if you guys are interested, I've been playing through the Hogwarts Legacy video game that launched earlier this week. Um, been streaming some of that, just trying to like myself discover more of the Harry Potter world, which I'm like very noob. I'm very like learning in the same way with the Lovecraft, the Arkham Horror universe. Before we had the books and things, I was able to use the video games based in those worlds to like understand things better, like interacting with the medium in the world and stuff. I find that's like my best way of like getting into an IP usually, unless they have like really good shows, movies, all that kind of stuff. And I know the Harry Potter's movies is all I've seen. I have not read the books. I know I'm a criminal. I know I'm a criminal. At one point, I probably will read them. Um, but anyways, that game is teaching me about the wizarding world more than I'm sure any movie or multiple movies or books would for me personally, because I'm actually in there physically interacting, reading things like missions and houses and story and all that stuff. It's just the way you're like involved in it. It's I, I'm way more invested than I would be if I was just like filling my face with popcorn watching a movie, if that makes sense to you. Uh, but I've been playing through that, having a, having a good time. So if you want to watch along, there's a playlist for that. I'll probably be playing it Monday again, maybe. Um, but I don't think I'll play tomorrow unless I figure some stuff out. Um, I wouldn't say never, but um, I was troubleshooting again this morning, trying to get rid of the hitching and stuff. There's some new fixes. People came out uh, adjusting some files in the game um, to make it properly use the VRAM and stuff on NVIDIA cards and things. So I tried some of that this morning. I got it running pretty good and actually using... All of my GPU. I know a lot of you don't care about this, but some of you who are watching it all week with me while I'm streaming like 20 something hours, 30 hours of this game. Um, 20 something hours, I believe it was. Yeah, I think Kate said halfway through your stream yesterday, you were at 24 hours stream time. Oh my God. So you're probably by the end of the day, you were probably at close to 30 hours stream time. Oh, wow. Okay. Anyways, uh, yeah, so I'm having fun that game. Um, but what I want to do, I want to do some troubleshooting. Um, and see if I can get my other computer that's a little better running the game better and set up my stream on the other computer. And it's going to take me like half a day. I might even be repasting uh, my laptop CPU, which I've not done for this laptop yet. And I usually like getting it and putting some industrial non-consumer grade thermal pads um, on them that I used to use back in, uh, back in my industry work. Um, but I like putting those on my laptop to like drop the... Uh, drop the thermals down so I can overclock and do some crazy stuff. So uh, I might be doing some of that tonight and tomorrow instead of streaming it, trying to improve the stream quality um, and my sanity of the unoptimized quality in that game's PC port. But yeah, we'll work on that later. You will also have to fight our daughter to get off of the game so you can play it again. That's the thing. Because <laughs> she I know is she's loving all day today. it. I, I, this morning. Kate. Last night too. Yeah, yeah. So after you got off. I explained it on stream. I'm getting off because my daughter I know wants to play. I could hear her breathing over top of me as I was <laughs> at, when she got home from school. I could see her like peeking over while I was like playing on stream. I don't think you guys saw her in the background, but I could feel her. And She uh, was. And then she would ask me like, do you know what time daddy's streaming till? I have no idea. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So she got a taste of it and she like wants it, right? We're using the family sharing on Steam to like she plays it when I'm not playing it kind of thing, when I'm not streaming it. But this morning I woke up and I found all the all the 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 any file changes and I was like, okay, I'm gonna go downstairs, run some tests, you know, change some things, run some tests. So I was up seven o'clock this morning, changing settings, running stuff, pitch black, house is quiet, Mel's sleeping. I thought my daughter was sleeping. Nope, here she comes down, barely can speak, can't even get her eyes open properly, and she's like, Daddy, can I play? And I was like, honey, <laughs> I just need like 20 more minutes of troubleshooting. And I and I can I can determine if this is a fix for me or not. Um, I wanted to test for another like hour or so uh, on my other PC, but I, I decided I'll save that for later. Um, but I was like, sure, honey, sure. So of course, as soon as I was done, I I sent her a little message because I know she's upstairs, and she's like, boom! I hear her just get up, run to the computer, boot it up, and she's on the game. I checked on her a couple of times. She's like in the game, asking, like showing me things she's earned that I have not even seen, and going places I've not been and stuff. She's like crazy. Yeah, she is loving it. Yeah, yeah. She's like cooked. Look, the game got her. Um, but yeah, it does run very well on her computer, which is a 1660 Super. 
and like an old processor from like 2012 or something, man. It's like it just runs good on old hardware. I don't know. I don't know. But anyways, yeah. I know, Yogi, I'm telling you, it's an RTX thing. Doesn't matter what RTX you have. 2060 all the way to 4090. Any RTX card is having issues with the game. It's crazy. People with $2,000 graphics cards that literally are like the highest end of high end. 24 gigs of VRAM are like, skip, skip, skippity doo da. So yeah. So we'll just wait for the fix on that. But some people have been fixing it with some, some of these tweaks. So we'll see. Anyways. I'll, I'll give more updates on that next time, next time I stream the game. Uh, is everyone here yet? Uh, Jeffrey says, you have the base game. Looking forward to catching you live and play this expansion. Jeffrey, welcome. Perfect, perfect. Uh, so it also says, also found you today because I searched the game's name to maybe find a video I haven't seen about the game yet, <laughs> and yours showed up. Yeah, because awesome. we, we just awesome. started playing the game like a, a like, month ago Yeah, or not, not long ago. Yeah, we, on, we only bought, like, we've been bugged to play Harry Potter Hogwarts Battle on the channel for, like, years. Mm -hmm. Ever since it was released, I've been asked about it by people who watch the channel. And it's something always been on my, my mind is, like, if I ever find it on sale, and it, it, there was a few times it was on sale on, like, Amazon yes. Canada. Yes, And I saw a posting for it, and I was like, oh, yeah, yeah, I'll just go grab that, throw it in the back catalog, and we'll play it later. And then I go to buy, and it's gone. And I'm like, oh. Okay, well, I'll just wait. It goes on sale a couple times a year. I, I can find it on sale. So, and I know it's in print. They keep printing it. People love it. But then we were just with a friend at a, his local game store, a store we'd never been to before, and they had it. Reasonable price. Looked it up. Yep, price is good. And uh, we were like, yeah, let's just buy that and a couple other games and threw it, on, threw it on the order and left with it. And it just kind of sat there for a little bit until we worked it in the schedule. But, yeah. Uh, yeah, this is weird timing. But, yeah, we just, just got it. I don't know. It was a few months ago. We bought it maybe like November or something. Yeah, it was before the holidays. Yeah, That's yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Uh, congratulations on 17K, is the chat is saying. Thank you so much. 17,000 subscribers. Thank, thank, you. thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank everybody. You. Thank to you. Yes, thank you so much. Much appreciated. Yes. We appreciate all of you. Yeah. Well, there's a couple in there that I don't. Oh yeah. No, they're jerks. But uh, <laughs> you know, I can't. I can't love everyone in the family. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Just kidding. Sort of. Um. <laughs> and now we can unsubscribe. No, don't. No, we're trying we to get. We need that buffer. We need that yeah. one buffer. We'll lose one or two, so yeah, we yeah. need a couple extra. Yeah. Every week we lose a couple, so it just happens. Yeah. We're not playing the things they want us to play, or you know. We, yeah, we don't have happens. our frost haven yet. <laughs> we don't have our frost haven yet. They're like, I'm out. I'm unsubscribing. Yeah. You suck. Yep. Which I saw some retail stores in Canada are now advertising they have their copies. Oh, no. A little pissed about that. Oh, no. Yep. So, yeah. Yep. yep. Hopefully sooner than later. I saw there's some stores in the U.S. that were showing like a month ago that they had it for sale. And I saw people in the U.S. getting pissed that they don't have their copies yet. So, yeah. That's fun. It's always fun. So, yeah. Next time, not backing... Frost Haven, Gloom Haven, Warm Haven, whatever, Water, well, we water Haven, whatever they end up calling the next one. Uh, no, I'll just wait for it to show up at retail, e even if it's a little more money. Because with the shipping costs on Kickstarters and everything, it's like, nah, I'll just buy it at retail, support my local game store. Even if it's a little extra money, because then I, I just get it on time with everyone else, if not earlier than everyone else. But it's cheaper. Wasn't it cheaper even with the shipping than they're selling it for? Yeah. So I'm mean, But I guess that doesn't always happen. Yeah, that, that was that a rare was a rare thing. That, that was but... a big fluke, yeah. Was a Every now fluke. and again. But yeah. But again, paying two hundred dollars versus three hundred and fifty or whatever it ends up being, that hundred extra dollars there divided over the sixty oh, seconds yeah. will play. Peanuts. Or more. It's all <laughs> peanuts. Like it's fine. Yeah, yeah. When, um, yeah, when you think I, about it like that. Unless I play it, like, the least I would play it before I, I like, I'm, I'm, I'm out would be probably, like, five to ten sessions. So then I gotta, like, math that out in there, so it's, like, whatever. And then it would have to be, like, real garbage to stop playing it at five or ten. Yeah, like, I already know I like that formula, even yeah. when we dabbled with the digital not too long ago, and obviously Jaws the Line, I was like, yeah, I, I'm not done with this. Yeah. I do get sick of it after a while, if that's the only thing we're playing it can you can get kind of a little bored of it sometimes but i do not uh, i want to see the new stuff they added in we'll see but yeah 
But yeah, when we played like, you know, twice on a Friday, then woke up Saturday, played like three games again of Gloomhaven, then played again on Sunday, and then Justin would leave. Yeah, I was good taking a break from it for like a week or two. <laughs> that's a little much, but that's me. All right. Are we going to... Are we good? Is everyone here? I think we're going to do this. I think... Is everyone here now? I don't know. I, I think most of the people who be watching right now are busy playing the... I haven't seen... Uh, Hogwarts Legacy video game, so I totally understand. I haven't seen Kate You can Kate watch yet, this later. But maybe, maybe she's here and lurking. She might be working. Or working. It's also like 8... No, it's 9.16 for oh, her. Oh, okay. Right? Okay. Nope, she's two hours. It's 10, 16, so it's not that early. Um, but no, it's okay. Oh, Dragon's here. Okay, we can oh, start. Dra oh, Dragon's finally, here. okay. We are waiting for Dragon. Dragon, Oh, finally. Dean Miller's here. We're good. We're good. All right, all right. <laughs> Quit rubbing in that you got Frosthaven. I see you, I see you Dean Miller. <laughs> yeah, there's a couple of them in there that are saying they got it. I will we're not reading those on purpose, okay? I will start banning people <laughs> from the chat. I will turn this car around. <laughs> all right, anyways. <laughs> Okay. But yes, fans of this game, I'm assuming you're fans that would also play the Hogwarts Legacy video game. And I bet there's a bunch of people who just got it yesterday on release and are playing it all weekend again. Oh, yeah. I can't be mad. I can't be mad. I'm playing it. It's fun. Enjoy it. I'll see. Hello to you watching a month from now after finishing your Hogwarts Legacy. Uh, thanks for joining us. <laughs> Leave a comment down below. Tell me how, how long it took you to beat it. Uh, and, and did you enjoy it? <laughs> and join me for my other streams. Oh, wait. I'm probably still playing because I'm slow in that game, but that's fine. <laughs> um, but yeah. <laughs> Tim says they'll be watching Harry Potter 5 later with the family. That's awesome. Awesome. That's cool. All right. So this doesn't have a number. What do you mean? Num what number? Like uh, it's an expansion. They so don't. They, they don't, don't do rank. that for expansion. No. Oh, okay. No, expansions don't get ranked with normal, like regular games. That doesn't make sense. But I thought some do. No, but this okay. is the expansion we're playing. Okay. No expansions don't. Uh, unless it was standalone. Ah. This is what we're playing. Just FYI, Harry Potter Hogwarts Battle the Monster Box of Monsters expansion, which requires the base game to play. It's a 2.62 complexity according to the fans who have rated it here on BoardGameGeek.com. And we are playing through it blind today. I cracked it open, I sleeved some cards, I read some cards, not really though. Oh, I read the rules, sorry, I read the rules. Uh, I think the whole thing. Yeah, I did, I did. Um, for box one or whatever, um, which we'll go over. I have the PDF here um so we can discuss actually i'll do it right now just so you understand what we're oh this is ugly oh no this is the pdf on their website oh no this was from official right here op games i went game one rules oh no and it's like a disgusting photocop photocopy from 1992 yeah well this is the best i got to show it good on camera right now then um Epic fail. So, uh, awkward. <laughs> awkward. <laughs> All right. Uh, so we're going to be playing. They, they give you box one. We're going to start with that. They give us 12 more influence tokens because influence becomes a new thing. Uh, and this harp token, which I think works with a card, a harp card of some kind, which I believe is right here on the top of this pile of cards in front of me. Uh, we get some more dark arts cards to shuffle in. We get some box one locations. We get something called encounters, which we'll talk about on the next page, which are new. We get creatures and two villain dash creature cards to replace some creature creature villain cards in the first game that now need to have the creature slash villain traits to work with other cards in the game. So we'll replace those. Um, we're going to play with the game five Voldemort, not the game six, not the game seven. They want you to play with the game five to start. I'm sure as the game ramps up, they'll probably ask us to play with the game six and seven, maybe as we go through the four boxes of this mini campaign here. Um, we also get these new, uh, these are kind of like, we've seen this, this is like deck building one-on-one, like this is like deck building one-on-one stuff. So we're going to have a pile of bad cards that'll go in our deck. Um, they're detention cards and they read on them. You can't see, you'd normally be able to see on the PDF there, but you know, since we've went back to 1992, uh, photocopy quality, uh, we'll be reading it off of the actual card here. Uh, I don't know if I can show such things. Bear with me. Bear with me. I need to do this. I should have done this a long time ago. Hold on. One second. One second. Let's see. 
Mm. Should be good. Yeah, it looks okay, I think. All right, one second, one second, one second. Ready? Oh, magic. All right. Uh, well, now they're in sleeves, so it's going to be annoying. Um, but yeah, uh, if you discard this, you'll lose two health. So you do not lose two health when you place this in your discard pile at the end of your turn. So you can, it's a dead card. This is a dead card, but an annoying card. You're going to get these in your deck. They come from a separate pile. Um, we've seen this in games where they give you like trash cards, you know, like gar garbage cards that just clog up your hand and break up your engine. You got to get rid of them. Uh, so you can discard this to like the villain, dark arts, whatever, discarding it for a cost. If you do that, you lose two health, though. So it's like, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so there's a whole bunch of those that'll be in a pile, so we can get plenty of them in our deck, because there's like 20 of them in the game. Oh, wow. Uh, uh, oh, yeah, 20. Yeah, place 20 detention. Yeah, I just guessed, based on the size of the deck. But uh, five hero cards and one game six proficiency. Oh, so we get I a new proficiency, which we'll look at. Yeah, yeah, we'll look at that. Uh, we also get a new hero or character, but uh, Luna, love good. Still doesn't make it a five player game, though. She's just a fifth option to replace in and mix in and play with the game. Um, but you still can only play up to four players, supposedly. But again, we all know you can dabble with some house rules and I'm sure tweak the game so that it works with five players if you really wanted to. Um, but it gives you a whole new starter deck for Luna. Luna's uh, card to use. And then uh, here's a creature card. Very similar to a villain card. They just have the creature trait because some cards work on creatures, some cards work on villains. But they have a new, um, a new mechanic in here. Uh, is it here? No. Oh, yeah, they have these encounter cards, which remind me of... I don't know if that's what they were called in the last one. These ones with the snake on the back. They were the Horcrux. Oh, Horcrux cards. Yeah, these remind me of the Horcrux, Horcrux cards. Uh, bless you. Um, <laughs> they have uh, an ability that's ongoing. They have a way to defeat them, and then they have a reward when you defeat them. Okay, so they're they're similar. Okay, and they are worked into the rules. We do not win in game one if unless we clear all these. Just like in game seven, we had to clear the whole Horcrux cards um, from the base box. This we have to clear all these and all the villains. Okay. Okay. Also, please note for setup here. Um, there is something here with the villains and, and the creatures. You have to shuffle together with five the, the villains that come the villains and creatures that come in the box one of the monster box of monsters expansion. You have to mix with five randomly chosen villain cards from Harry Potter Hogwarts Battle, which I assume doesn't include any of the Voldemorts. Right. And then you take version five of Voldemort. So I've already removed okay. the other Voldemorts out. We'll do random draw from the other deck, but that will spice it up and change it up. Obviously, certain villain combos could, Worse than others. might or might not be involved based on your, your random shuffle, which is neat. Interesting. Yeah, so we got to remember that. So how many extra? Five. Five, Five randomly chosen villains. Remember okay. that, because uh, I'll forget. Okay, I got that. Uh, okay, so the gameplay steps have slightly changed. We need to reveal and resolve Dark Arts event and then read the encounter, because it could apply right then could apply in the next steps and all that, just like those Horcrux cards did, right? Same thing. Okay. Okay. Resolve any villain and creature abilities, same thing. Now, when you take actions, you have the ability to banish cards, okay? Trashing. Okay? Trashing is in the game, removing stuff from your deck. Um, so a new term introduced on some cards. Some cards is banish, okay? When a hero banishes a card, it is removed from their deck for the rest of the game. Okay, this gets... Crap has the cards out of your deck. But the problem is, I already see the issue. I don't know how many cards add the word banish on it, but there's not many cards added that will be shuffling in the deck, and the deck is just getting bigger. Yeah, so it'll be rare to see, probably. Super rare. And not only are they allowing us to trash cards, they're giving us crappy cards to put in that you want to waste that trash mechanic on instead of trashing the early garbage cards that you start the game with. I guess it depends how we get these cards. Yes, 100%. 100% depends. Um, but maybe there's trashing happening on the encounters. Maybe there's trashing happening on the new bosses, uh, villains. I don't know. But if it's just on cards that go into the deck, I sleeved them up. There's not many. Oh, I think it did say that it can happen not just that it can happen in multiple ways. The banish. Oh, okay. I thought I read something. I don't know. But anyways, if you banish a card, you don't get the effect on the card. 
So you're like banishing it as a cost kind of thing. And you just put it in a discard pile uh, in the center of the deck, it says, but you will put it on the side to keep it with the other card. Okay. Uh, so now there's a new way to use money to defeat villains. Makes sense. Use the other resource in the game to get rid of problems. The only problem is there is a rule they basically can only take one money per turn. So this Norbert villain, for example, has a six money health. Um, but that means it's six player turns to defeat it if you were literally putting one money on it every turn. And some turns I'm sure you won't. Which I guess makes sense, right? Because sometimes you can have six to eight money in one turn and that would be too easy, sometimes right? Sometimes you could have nine to 17 attack in that one turn. That is true, but rare. <laughs> more rare than the influence, I guess. <laughs> Don't tell me I can't have more attack than That's true, money. sorry. Uh, I guess I'm speaking for myself. <laughs> yes. Don't you tell me. All right, uh, and then it says here, at the end of your turn, the first encounter, Piscipiski, Piscipiski, Pastronomy. Bless you. <laughs> no, I like that deli meat. Uh, that's one of my favorite deli meats to put on a nice, uh, you know, submarine sandwich. Some Piscipiski, Pastronomy, Pastronomy. Uh, yeah, a little spicy, but I, I like it. Uh, limits the number of cards a hero can draw at the end of their turn if they have four or less health. However, if the active hero was stunned, their health would first reset to 10, then they would be able to draw a new hand of five cards. Okay. So remember that. It's going to check that stuff. So just pay attention. These these encounter cards are, are like passive, need to be checked in certain phases and stuff. Um, but yeah, and then it says, before replacing cards at the end of the turn, check to see if you completed the encounter. If you did, claim the card. You may use the reward on a subsequent turn. Oh, and I think this is something we were doing for the Horcrux cards. I think it's at the end of your turn. I think we were taking them right yeah, yeah. away. So we will try to do that in the correct yeah, order because yeah, it might make a difference. Uh, and it just reminds us here we have to get rid of all the creatures, villains, encounters before we can damage Voldemort. Okay. And then there's the rule. Additional rules, villains versus creatures, basically says it matters the type of creature it is. And they give us some new cards to replace the old ones, like I said, which we'll do. So it's the Basilisk, Basilisk and the Dementor are supposed to be creatures. but they're now going to be villain dash creatures. So anything with the word villain on it will impact them. Anything with the word creature on it will also impact them. And then it says when setting up any game from the monsters box of monsters expansion, first select the creature and villains referenced at the top of the encounter cards. I don't know if this matters for the setup during the campaign or this is just saying later when you're playing them like one off. I'm not sure. But it says it's basically to bring the total stack of villains to 12, including Voldemort. So it says just go grab the matching, but I'm sure they're going to give us the matching ones in each box. Yeah. So this is just if you're playing it later, I think. Because I'm sure the villains match up with the encounters and need to be there for thematic reasons and for gameplay mechanic reasons. Oh yeah, here's where I read the banishing. All instances either from rewards from defeating creatures. So I figured there's other ways that we're going to be able to banish cards. Okay. We talk about that new hero, uh, Luna Lovegood has. We'll look at her cards, I guess. Uh, I know. I don't think I want to play her. Did you? Or no, you I, I don't think her? so. I want to look at her stuff though. Yeah, I, I could. I could play her and probably make her work, but I don't know. I'll just I know, probably I like, roll with the run. Yeah, I like what we were doing. Before. Um, we'll just continue our campaign, quote unquote. Uh, Hogwarts cards is an optional rule. Once per game, any one hero may forgo acquiring cards to place all six available cards in the market on the bottom of the Hogwarts deck or place them with six new cards. This is helpful if you find you're stuck on encounter or cannot acquire cards that are too expensive. So there were points at the end of some of our games where we're already winning, where we could have used this to win more. Right. When we're just like, ah, we don't want to buy anything in the market. So we just left it sitting there for half the game. We're like, we have our engines, we're good. But we could have, like, easily at that point, just been like, yeah, wipe it. And then, boom, could have seen another card, like the dice cards, if we're looking mm -hmm. for those and we're struggling. We just wipe them to try to get some dice cards to show up in that last um, game seven we had last time that required that, right? Yeah, or now if you're looking for banished cards. If you see nothing and you just want to dig deeper. We'll see. Uh, and then it talks about increasing difficulty. And then you we're can, just playing regular, right? We're not can, increasing. No, no, okay. yeah, we're just playing yeah. regular. And then you can store the game. They give you um, new dividers and stuff to use if you want to store everything in the base game box, which I, I appreciate. So you can toss this expansion box out, and they give you the dividers to use the stuff from this game, the old game, whatever, put them all in. Um, and you guys are asking if there's an FAQ link on here. Let's see. 
There's a bunch of wasted space on the back of the rule book. Uh -huh. mm. No. Mm. I guess just their website, but... Uh, no, I, I don't think there's anything that says read the FAQ for updated fixes and... None of that I saw. Let's check the cover. Maybe on the front cover. No. No. No, no, no. No. It was the save, I guess. Yeah, I don't think ours is any different. No. Oh well. Oh well. Hello, Matthew. Matthew, how are you feeling after your birthday yesterday? Did you have a fun night? Yogi says this game is perfect. I don't need enough no FAQ. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so uh, I've pulled out the deck holder here uh, that you guys have seen us use for many games, uh, and it's not even enough to hold the base game fully sleeved in Dragon Shield sleeves. Uh, so if I put the base game deck in there, obviously before dealing out six market cards, I, mean... I, I have like 20 cards I'm hanging over top. Okay, so uh, yeah. <laughs> and now they want us to shuffle in some new cards. Uh, yeah. Okay. Stop it. Stop adding new cards to this already disgusting size deck, all right? Here. <laughs> what do you think you are? Ark Nova? Terraforming Mars? What's going on here? Stop it. Wingspan? No. Stop. All right, so some new cards we have. This, I think, what's works with the harp. This is going to get shuffled in the deck. I'm showing you now because we'll probably never, ever see some of these cards because oh. they're, they're going in a deck of 4,000 cards. True. This is similar to the spell version where you put the harp on it yeah. and that... So, doesn't trigger. so yours probably says the one you were using says villain on it, which won't work on creatures. This one works oh, on creatures, but you're not villains. Probably right. Okay, get it? Yep, get it. Oh, an old sock. An old sock, of course. If you if you're trying to battle against some demonic creatures and some horrible villains, what is the one item you would love to have? An old sock, of course. If it's filled with pennies, maybe. Well, it gains you money, so that must be the pennies spilling out as you're swinging it around. And then uh, if another hero has a health house elf in hand. Situational AF. <laughs> oh, no. Gain to attack. Yeah, like that's going to happen. And then if you discard this, though, you gain two money. So. This item might work with your uh, ability. And of course, have. there's two oh, of there's them. Oh, there's two old socks. Okay, they give us a new ally. Argus Filch and Mrs. Norris. Draw two cards and choose one. Discard any one card or banish a card in your hand. Okay, that's okay. awesome sauce. But again, one card out of a thousand. Yeah. Um, then we have Fang. Anyone here who gains money and two health, okay. We have two a couple health. of these spells. Finite incantate, Incantatum. Remove a control, villain control from location. If it's in your hand, only reveal one Dark Arts event on your turn. If this is in your hand. Oh, that is kind of neat. I like that. I like it, especially if this is more challenging and more Dark Arts are revealed from the beginning. And then they throw in six copies of this spell are getting shuffled in the deck. This is our banish. You may okay. banish a card in your hand. If it's an item, draw a card. Cool. And uh, I'm and assuming... And those are items. Yes, right what I was about okay. to say, if you let me finish. <laughs> Sorry, we're just on the same page. Uh, yeah. This is an item. Okay. This, this is the detention card cool. that I was showing you earlier. So a whole stack of these off to the side. We'll throw them over here. Sounds good. Okay. And these are going to get shuffled into this ginormous stack of cards. I don't know. Close for Dobby. Stock. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Do you want me to just drop shuffle them over here? I don't know. I, I've played with some big decks at tournaments, like, you know, uh, when there's some weird kind of game-changing card that makes deck-building rule that you can put a ton of cards in your deck, but you're allowed to do something, you know, it's a balance thing to ruin consistency. But this, I've never shuffled a deck that's this big before. I can't even, like, do it Luckily, with you have one hand, hands. like, uh, or <laughs> two hands even. Yeah, this is crazy. It's stupid. <laughs> Who told me People to are yelling me? at their screens yeah. right now. <laughs> if I could find, if I could go back and find who was telling me how dare you in the first episode was telling me I need to sleeve these cards and uh, wear out and all that. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, I want to know who that was. <laughs> and what are you doing to solve this problem? 
drop shuffling probably yeah yeah i i did i did a little bit earlier but yeah you can do it but i'm just showing you like okay now you add more to setup time by adding sleeves to cards weak 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 it's supposed to speed up setup time because you can shuffle like really fast and really well and not worry about damaging the cards but when it's like makes shuffling impossible because the deck just got too huge uh yeah not not a thing not a thing it hurts hurts setup I guess it's the cost of cost of protecting the cards. There you go. Okay, so this is expansion. FYI, it's a little, little smaller box, but uh, box nonetheless. Then it comes with the same kind of insert as the first one. We got some extra tokens, some more monies. And then we have a little harp token to silence the creatures. Okay. And spoiler, I'm assuming we come with an extra die in here. So, somewhere in one of these boxes is an extra die. And then oh. underneath here, I'm assuming, I don't know, but. Uh, and then here's like the uh, dividers, maybe a whole whack ton of dividers hiding under here. But yeah. So yeah, there you go. There you go. Uh, box one. Oh, yeah, that's good. Okay. Uh, so here's Luna's cards. She has the classic uh, whole bunch of junk spells. Oh. There's the level one locked door opening spell. Oh, okay. I think Edgar made a joke when you were playing around with this in the thing, saying gain one influence. Like when you did the spell or whatever. It was like, I no, gain one influence. I don't memorize the spells. <laughs> I don't remember. I can't even I think, yeah, them. I don't think you realize that. This is that just it the one money junk card. I don't know what the title of the card is, but now, now it makes yeah, sense. Yeah, I remember. Because <laughs> <Edgar, laughs> makes... I got it, but he didn't. I was watching and he didn't say anything. So I'm like, I don't think he got yeah. what you were saying there. See what the video game's doing, though? It's teaching me these spells and what they're for better than the movies did. And then now I see them in the game and I understand the game more. This is how, how I learn. I use, like, another medium to, like, help me appreciate the theme in another medium, uh, which is what how I learn. Uh, spec, Spectre Specs. Look at these sunglasses. Gain an influence. You may reveal a top card of the Dark Arts event. Uh, a top Dark Arts event card. Choose one. Put it back on top or discard it. A lion hat, gain one influence. If another hero has a broom or Quidditch gear in hand, also gain an attack. Hmm. Yeah, player, not the best. Yeah, two-player game if you don't have the brooms or stuff in the play, like, yeah, if the right characters aren't in play. And her allies, a Grumplehorn Snorkak, which is a standard attack oh, or yeah. heal too. So yeah, just this item is kind of, uh, kind of lets me down compared to the items that Ron has, so... Yeah, I don't, I'm not interested. Instantly, I was like, whatever, man, but... Let's see her ability. The first time you draw an extra card on your turn, any one hero heals two. So it is... She's like a supporty character, I would guess. It's better... No, it's better to my playstyle than, than Mr. Weasley is. Because Mr. Weasley, I don't always get three attack going as quickly. This is an alternate version, by the way. It does come with alternate versions of heroes. So this is the bad example. Um, where's the old Ron? I don't know where I put him. Anyways, the old Ron, if you assign three or more attack on a turn, you know, any one hero gains two health or all heroes gain two health, whatever. But this ability, like, is going to happen more often if you get the extra card draw stuff going faster. You know, like, I was getting card draw going, I think, almost every single turn. I wasn't always getting three attack going every single turn, I feel. Um, so this could be a more consistent heal effect than this is. But this is, I'm going to use the new Ron. I'm going to use this new Ron, which I don't know if that makes him worse. Because it's only attack, but it's end, end influence. So if I put like two damage on one villain and one influence on a guy, a villain that needs it or a creature that needs it, uh, it's still good. 
But uh, it's only one health. I feel like he was two health before. He was. Right? Yeah. I feel like he was, yeah. I still don't know where. Where did I put all those cards? He's oh. not in that. Oh. Oh, right here. Yeah, here's the Ron I was last playing with. But you can play with whoever you want. Like, you don't have to. But I'm going to just play with the box one. I'm going to play with the new one just for fun. Like, whatever. Um, but it, I think it's optional. I don't, I don't think you have to play with these ones. But we'll do it just for fun. All right. And then there's your Hermione. If you play four or more spells oh. on your turn, any two heroes each gain one attack. Huh. So I like this because I'm usually low on attack, especially in the beginning. But I, I did like being able to give you money. But, okay, I can make this work. Yeah. All right, so we're not doing the Luna. I don't know where Luna went. Um. What did I do? Okay, here's the other proficiency card. Care of magical creatures. The first time you assign one or more attack or influence to a creature, any one hero gains two health. If you defeat a creature, also remove hmm. one control from location. So obviously I wouldn't play with this one in the base game without all the creature stuff. It just doesn't make sense, but oh, there's Luna. But yeah. Okay. Cool. Uh, so yeah, I'm not gonna. I'm not that. changing. Yeah, no thanks. Um, but okay. <laughs> All right. So here are our box one creature slash villains, and if you want to shuffle this and take five out, whatever. Yeah. I have I have the game five Voltimore already there, so for sure these are the villains plus five more. Dark arts cards. We have some new ones, and we also have our encounters, and they are listed in order. So we have a one, a two, and a three. Okay, we have to get through these. So here's that first one again. And at the end of each turn, if a hero has four health or less, so it makes having low health a bad thing even worse, uh, they only draw four cards instead of five. So healing is more valuable here at the beginning. To complete, play two cards with an even influence value in one turn. Oh, I would wow. assume zero does not count. I would assume so as well. So that we'll, would we'll play it that way, but... Again, uh, if I guess if they're zero, they don't even have an influence value, we will say. So, okay. yeah. So it has to be two or four or six or whatever. Um, but they don't have to be the same number. They just both have to be an even. even number. Right. Okay. But, Interesting. But only one player has to do this. So you could have one player just buying two and four cost cards to try to get the combo to line up. And then another player is buying like ones, threes, and fives, you know, whatever. Yeah. Um, to do that. Because otherwise we're stuck. If we can't get that to happen at the same time, yeah. And, and also, if these stupid uh, cards start coming into play, then that makes it even harder. And the reward is each time you play a card with an even value. So you want to be the player who's doing this in the deck and to then, then get this reward for the rest of the game. Yeah. Any one hero gains a health. So it's like it, it kind of could tweak your whole engine building strategy based on this one card. And I don't even know what the next ones do. We'll just see. We're gonna, we're going to see them blind. All right, I'm not going to look at these. One, two, three, four, five. These are off to the side and shuffle these into the into this pile now. Yep. And then we have even more Dark Arts cards, which I'm not even going to look at. These are going to be shuffled into here. You can pile shuffle that while I continue to talk. I'll reveal those in a second. I guess we're still revealing three, right? It didn't say otherwise, or in the, in the. Oh yeah. Are we doing one or three? I think in the setup it showed three. Okay. Oh yeah. Okay. I'll pull them up in a second. We'll look through them. Yeah. Uh, it says. Uh... Place Voldemort face up on the bottom of the stack. Reveal the top three cards. Tony, thank you. Tony Robbins Guilds. Thank you. Thank you so thank much. You for the donation. I think that was on thank Patreon, you. right? Patreon. 
Thank you, Tony. Thank you. I'll see. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for supporting the channel. Okay. Do you mind if I put these closer to me? I don't know if we need them. Oh yeah, you're right. Those are for a different mechanic. I oh, just threw right. them there. Okay. But... I'll just throw them to the side. Yeah. Okay. It might introduce that stuff later, but I, I don't I don't think we need them. One, two, three. Here's our three villains. Oh, we got a new one. Or the Viking, hello. Uh, we have a you're... troll. This is a creature. Active hero chooses one, lose two health, or put a detention in your discard pile. All heroes gain one health and may banish an item from their hand or discard pile as a reward. Seven health. Okay, he looks like he's from Shrek. Yep, it is Shrek. Oh, we've seen him. Oh, yeah. Peter, he's a villain. Uh, we have to reveal the top card. He's not terrible at the beginning because all of our cards right now are zero. This is true. Oh, yeah, still need to go over locations. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, yeah, sorry. Oh, no. I guess it's actually not the worst either if we can get rid of him first. Well, it's a new version. Oh, yeah, did you oh. replace? Did you replace? Um, the new two new copies with the ones you're shuffling in? No. Yes, yeah, so you might have duplicates. Oh. We need a fix. Oh. Yep, so we need to redo. Redo Sorry. what we did. Okay, yep. let's just redo the whole thing. Sorry. I knew I had to get to other stuff. Yeah, see, you had the regular basilisk in there also. Oh, I had to take them out. Double I didn't trouble. even, I just assumed. Sorry. Uh, so who no, else? What was the other one? Uh, Dementor. Dementor. So, yeah, you had regular Dementor in there too. Oh. You, you were about to do this to us twice, Ooh. plus no card draw. Mel, what are you? Okay. Traitor. Sorry. We found the traitor at the table. You're right. I didn't finish. Okay, so then these are going to get. So, this is a new one. Yep. This is a new one. Our, oh, the oh, new, oh ones? new ones are these. Um, the ones that have the symbol mm -hmm. here. New. New. And then we're going to shuffle these. Old. Oh. What are you doing? Okay, I need yep. to shuffle these and pick five again. Yeah. And then shuffle them with okay. these ones because there should be seven ish. Yeah, there's this guy plus six. Yeah. Sorry, we tried to break the game. Technically, I thought you'd though. already taken them out. I'm so sorry. Yeah. I don't know. It's my bad. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Old and busted, new <laughs> hotness. Yes, that's right. Okay. Yeah, it does talk about switching them out in the rule book. I just went over it very fast. You know what? I'm sorry. They I also do have thought... different traits. They have different colors, different symbols on them. All right. But yeah, you have to know to like swap them all out. So there it is. Tony, thank you for becoming a member on YouTube and clicking the join button. Thank you so much. Thank you. So thank, you thank you. Thank you. Appreciate the support. Thank you. Oh, look at this. He's back. <laughs> so it was meant to be. Okay, so we still have that same troll. Uh, okay. He's just a villain. Uh, active hero loses one health. Not bad. Oh, look at this little guy. So cute. Cornish Pixies is a creature. For each card in hand with an even value, influence value, active hero loses two health. Oh, okay. This is not terrible, I guess. Oh, I just shuffled the top card, top half of the deck. And this was the first card we draw off the top. Which we can't afford. But it's Seven. still a card that's a one of in the deck that we okay. saw added in recently. I'll just put them like this for now. Oh, we got the die rolling book. Okay. Don't know if we're going to need. Uh, Butterbeer. Oh, we remember this from oh, our yeah. games. Uh, a little, little, Two of those you had, right? A little dirty combo going with that, but it's another seven cost card, though. Okay. Uh, this is an expensive market. Yeah, six cost Horus Slughorn and. An essence of Dittany. So there's also only a couple even cards. Yeah. Two, four, and a six. I mean, it is possible to get those going. Okay. Okay, our location. Oh, yeah. I'll just look at the top one, but there's three of them. Uh, we're just revealing one Dark Hearts card, but it's only five control on it, though. Yeah, that's low. Okay. Oh, Tony, our newest producer, also says, I love your content, and UML make my day. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> you just made our day. Thank, thank you for you. Uh, clicking the join button down below and supporting the channel. Thank Let's you, thank it. you. That's so sweet. Thank you for the kind words. Yes. Pixie should go fast. Uh, I guess once we start buying even cards. All right. 
I'm gonna shuffle and draw my five oh, cards. Yeah. But the troll is pretty bad because he's either making you lose health <laughs> or putting a detention card in. One, two. All right, well, are you going first or me? I, I haven't even looked at my hand yet. I, I don't know, whatever you wanna do. Uh, I can't really. I would like you to go first, actually. Okay. okay. Cause you could possibly give me money and card draw like on your turn, right? Yeah. If you wanted to, you don't need to. Yeah, I can. But selfishly, I would like you to go first. That's fair. Okay. So, start here. He can be kept to the end, you think? I mean, he's not the worst, losing one health. This guy, I think, is bad. Well, it sucks right now because of this, but... Is yeah, because this, I don't want to fill junk in my deck, but I don't yeah. want to be using two health a turn. I he's think like, he's, he's like first. Dementor. Yeah. He's basically a Dementor to us. Okay. Active hero chooses another hero to lose two health. That's you. I'm so sorry. And then Obviously. reveal... Obviously. Oh, no. The back. C -c 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 -combo. I'm so sorry. Down to six health. I haven't even started playing the game yet. <laughs> uh, active hero loses one health and discards a card. Okay. That's me. Discards a card. I guess we're just going to get rid of one of the, uh, get rid of this. Uh, that can give me two money. So let's do this. That can give me an attack. Okay, let's do this. Okay. Uh, I don't want to worry about that one. Uh, I don't have any even cards. Active hero loses one and choose to either lose two health, which I will do, or put a detention. I'll just lose two health. Um, I need, that'll give me four. Okay, so let's, uh, once per turn, I may discard two spells. If you do, all heroes gain one influence and draw a card. <laughs> Nothing says we can't draw, right? Nope. Nope. Did you, Ijin? Okay, uh, gain one influence. Gain one influence. And all heroes gain one influence. Spells also may be put on the top of my deck, but I don't think any of the spell additional spells. So I'll spend four and I'll buy the book, I guess. Ooh, not that I want, but yeah. it's roll dice. They're the... so good. No, I know, but I would I would rather start with something else. One, two, oh, three, four. I have a big big coster hitting the hitting the market. But again, remember you can decide not to buy anything and clear the whole thing if you want. I don't think we need to right now because there are some cheaper cards we could buy, like healing for two on a turn right now. It's probably pretty good. Yeah. But or this one, any two hero. This one's a good one. Any two heroes gain an influence. Yeah, we're just trying to buy the even cards to get rid of that. I know, I know. But uh, one, two, three, four, five. Maybe I stick with the odds. I don't know. Or well, I'm gonna choose I, I mean, that. But yeah, see what happens. I guess. All right, here we go. My turn. Dark arts. Yep. Add a control to the location. The end of each turn if the active hero has four less health, not happening. For each card in hand with an even, now I have a zero cost, right? Uh, active hero loses a health, and then a five. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Did I even get? No. I'll lose two health from the troll. All right. So, uh, Hidgewigen, hmm, I think it might be heal, but I feel like attack would be good too. Hmm, I don't know. Yeah, and then I'll gain five influence. Oh, you have good influence then with the money that I give yeah, you. Yeah, well. that's what I was saying. Okay. So I can buy this already for seven. I think I'd rather do this one because it's more flexible. I could draw cards, gain money if I need, or attack or heal if I need. I like this better than this one, which is like two attack and then like random die roll. Right. Come on, man. Obviously this one's better. And it's an item, which I don't think I'd ever toss it to search for another one, but, um, you know, I could get other item tech that would work with it, maybe. We'll see. We'll see what shows so then up. So you only get to draw to four cards. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that part. Unless you don't want to do yeah, that. Yeah, let's not do that. Let's not do that. Let's instead I'll heal off my ally. Yeah, I okay. forgot about that part of it. Then you get to draw five. And I'll draw. Oh, yeah, but you made me draw, so I get yeah. to shuffle. And then we'll replace. 
Wingardium Leviosa. Oh, not bad because it's a two. Just getting a couple of those twos might help. No, it is bad, but yeah. Because this, put... this generates two money and two health. This only generates with one. And then if you buy an item, like maybe you can put it on the top, like... No, like, I know, I know. It's like so sucky. This is like just like putting another one cost spell in your deck. It's like, unless you need spells to be really... I do use spells for other things, and I can yeah. discard spells to draw additional cards and stuff. So it would just... I don't know. I don't know, but... Okay. Uh, active hero loses one health and adds a control to the location. Okay, we'll worry about this at the end. Uh, I don't have any even cards yet. Still good. Active hero loses one health. Ugh. Well, we're gonna go down. Is it, it's four or less, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's not even gonna help me. That's fine. I'm only gonna be able to draw four, but that's fine, I think. Um. Yeah, sorry, Zolt. I just saw that now. I just saw your comment. Yeah, yeah, the poor, the poor heel. Mel caught it. Or Mel read the, you read the yes. comment? Oh, okay. Yes. Was not looking at chat there. I should have. Um. And yes, the troll is the worst. This guy's the worst. I think I should just let myself get, oh, but then I'm going to only draw four. Oh, that's annoying. I'm going to draw four cards. Then I'm going to get stunned. Then I'm only going to have two cards on my turn. Oh, that's annoying. Just roll with it. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. Like, All right, I guess we're, we're going to... We're getting a bigger challenge, which is kind of cool. I'm down. Me I'm too. down. Let's... Gain one influence. Let's discard two spells. We both get one influence and draw a card. Gain two influence. John, I'll answer your question in a sec. Or, or answer your dilemma. I'll, I'll solve it for you. Okay, I'm just going to spend two on this one, which spells go on the top of my deck. Yeah. Which, hopefully this will line up. And then the last two will go on this one, which will go here. Because... Oh, I have five cards. I have more than... Anyways, we'll see what happens. Now I only draw four cards, but I know one of them is... The two, and I'm hoping the other one is the book. One, two, three, four. Quidditch gear. Oh, I did it. Okay. Quidditch oh, God, gear. And then... Oliver Wood. Oh. Now see, it says if you defeat a villain, now he becomes weaker because we have creatures diluting the deck, so this guy automatically becomes suckier. Um... <laughs> Tony, thank you for the super chat. Thank Good you. luck for you both. Sean, your dilemma. Oh, yeah, I didn't read it. Sean's yet. dilemma is, and if anyone in the chat has answers for Sean, serious or not serious, I'd love to hear him. Uh, Sean has a dilemma. Wife is gone. Do I play Hogwarts Legacy or watch Harry Potter Hogwarts Battle board game with you guys? LOL, what to do? I can sneak in gameplay, and she will not say I'm wasting time. So here's what you do. To continue supporting us uh, during the stream, um, <laughs> you would... Put our stream on in the background, and so you can focus on the game. It depends how much you get distracted. Like like me, I would put the stream on mute, but leave it running, and then I would play the game. And then you can come back and watch this later, because the beauty of YouTube, it will archive it, and you can just watch it later. You can even remember where you are in the stream, kind of write it down or something. I don't. It will, I think it remembers sometimes, if you're watching the stream, and the stream is finished when you come back, it will remember where you are, but it won't remember where you are if you come back and the stream's still live. But you can mark it down, and then you can watch again later. So it's like double watch minutes for us. So <laughs> win win over here, and uh, just make sure to click the like button, and then we're all good. Um, that's the way you can do it. So your dilemma, if I'm reading this right, is that if you're playing a game, she will not say you're wasting time. But if you're watching a stream, she will. So you're saying she's gone. So you should be watching because you can play later and she won't care? Is that kind of where we're no, getting? No, I, I think it's more like his wife will know if he's playing the game, he's getting the game more finished so he can finally be oh, done with it. Oh, he'll be done it. sooner. Yeah, he'll be done sooner so oh, he can progress you. towards a goal line. Right. But if he's watching us, it never ends. We're always going to have another stream <laughs> and more to watch. So Great. always, there's the, the goal line. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Greg's, Greg's solution is... Uh, I don't know that that's something that Sean wants to take up. <laughs> Greg's just cutting out any of the BS, telling you straight up, get a new wife. 
Solves both problems. <laughs> <laughs> but it's, we don't know the rest of the story. There could be some huge benefits that it's like, you know. Yeah. She could be the coolest wife ever and like plays board games with him. Paints his miniatures, cuts his hair. Who even knows what else she does? You know, some wives out there are like way up here, you know. I, I know one. I I'm not going to say who. I, I don't want to make anyone else feel bad, but I know a cool wife like that. But yeah. <laughs> New life goals, says Spencer. <laughs> Sean, I got it. I'll watch on my phone and play at the same time. <laughs> he says, get a new wife, lol. <laughs> Shh, don't say that out loud. Don't say that out loud. <laughs> It's a yeah, no, good the name. It's a sugar mama. <laughs> okay, all right. Back John to... says though, if we all had a wife like Mel, things would be easy going. <laughs> Someone even said like, oh, I, I don't even remember who said it yesterday when you were playing. They're like, uh oh, Rob's been playing a really long time. He's gonna be on the couch tonight. I'm like, and then I respond. I'm like, Rob can play as long as he wants. That's I don't not how care. It works. No, no. <laughs> See, the cool part is when when she signed the agreement to be my girlfriend or whatever in the beginning, it all on there was listed like, you have to put up with my whining, my rants, my bitching, my video gaming, my mm -hmm. my gaming in general. You, mm -hmm. you have to put up with my up days, my down days, my raining headache days. You have to put up with it all. I'm not changing. I'm not changing. <laughs> so you're signing up for this. Yeah, I'm fine with it. And I sign I sign up the same way on her side. Whatever she did that annoys me. I can't complain. <laughs> I will still Why complain. don't you list them? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I, I do complain because I am very a truthful person and I, I have no filter. And sometimes I, I do have a filter. I definitely am using a filter when I'm on YouTube for sure. Because I try not to swear as much, but uh, yeah, I usually still say things that are on my mind, so I can understand them more if people can explain back. Um, yeah. But. Um, Rob didn't play necessarily board games before we got together, but he did play video games. But I told, like, I was a heavy I, gamer. Like, gaming was like yeah. my hobby. Like, I like flat out met her and was like, Mel, you understand? Like, I already knew. Uh, yeah. yeah, you knew because like. She already knew me that I like wait in line for a video game console launch. I waited with him. Yeah, like the night, like she waited outside with me from like, you know. We weren't nine, together at the time. 9 p.m. the night before till to launch the next day to get the Nintendo Wii, for example, with a bunch of friends too, mm -hmm. uh, who also wanted it. But like she knew I was like, I was a hardcore gamer, like watching all the press conferences, same like I do for board gaming. Like, yeah. I go a little too nutty with my hobbies, um, too deep kind of, I think, but. But then I did play video games light like we played Wii and we played like rock band and like those tetris kind of things tetris stuff. like yeah like i love super nintendo regular nintendo all that um you play mobile games and things yeah i play mobile games definitely and then when we started playing board games we started playing board games kind of together so that was fine and then now i we both played board games in childhood though yeah definitely but then we got into modern board gaming like together at together the same time. yeah we got into it together and then video games i play with him some. Yeah, like I play Call of Duty with him. Yeah, she started recently with the DMZ, Call yeah. of Duty DMZ. She started watching it and was like, I want to play. And I was like, all right, I'll make yeah. it happen and see if you like it. Now she plays with me some sometimes, not always, yeah. but sometimes. Uh, but yeah. 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 Okay. Oh, 20 says, my wife just asked me why I like to watch people play board games instead of just playing them myself. So that's a question that's been a that's the age old question since like video game streaming became popular in the late 2000s. And the answer is the same reason why your wife or uh, you uh, watch reality TV. Why are you watching a baking or a cooking show when you can cook yourself? Why are you watching the Super Bowl when you could go play football yourself? It's the same damn question. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you just want to see people do things different. People who take it more serious. Sometimes professional level people do it. The best of the best do it. Uh, you want to watch it with others. And there's this whole community aspect around it. So everyone getting together, all hype up the Super Bowl, for example, because it's happening this weekend. Or even your local team hockey game. It's something about it of like being a part of the audience and bonding over something and being a family. And like, like the chat here, right? Yeah. Everyone gets to know each other. You have the same taste. So sitting there watching sometimes a video game, Mel used to ask me, like, why are you watching a streamer play that video game when you could just boot it up? You have the same game. 
Sometimes the answer is, I just played that game for six hours, I'm wiped. Now I just want to watch someone else play it because I really like that game. And now I want to see how they approach the game, how they solve the puzzles. You know, maybe I can learn something from their strategy of play. Mm -hmm. And maybe I'm in the chat chatting with other people who love the game and I'm learning about cool tricks or how to get my game to not stutter or whatever, you know what I mean? There was also video game streams that he and I would watch together. Yeah. And it's also the personality of the people that were playing, right? Yeah. Or the combo of people, like if two people were playing together and it was funny or whatever. Yep. So, yeah, so we get it. Yeah, like you watch uh, like The Bachelor or something, uh, Dancing with the Stars. Like, why are you watching that reality TV show when you could just go dance? <laughs> or go live on an island and try to survive, you know? Like, go do something. Like, why are you watching any TV? It's the same thing. I get so frustrated when someone's like, why are you watching them do that when you could do it? It's like you could say that about almost everything on TV. Yep. Yes, Sean, that was one of my... So I signed all the things. I will let Rob do all those things that he listed. Not let games, me. There, or there I don't be, care. There should be not no No, letting. I don't... Not that I don't let... If yeah, you're in a relationship you're where right. someone has I just to don't, give you... It doesn't bother me. Yeah, where someone has to give you permission, th there's something that's wrong true. there. That's, there, true. that's 100%. Get... get professional help for real <laughs> go see patient. somebody you're you're literally being manipulated like go do it for real there's that's something true. wrong in that relationship you you're being manipulated like yeah that's that's a whole control thing you don't want to be in that kind of toxicity you're right that's the wrong word yeah, yeah. but i it doesn't bother me when rob plays video games does whatever he wants to do i don't i don't care but he needs to watch big brother with me you're right yeah but then <laughs> then there's the the other like maybe you're not meaning they're not letting you, but then there's also the like, just don't give me a hassle. Yeah, or they get upset. Yes, they just give you trouble if you do something that they don't, like, they don't yeah. understand, so. Yeah. Yeah, that's weird. That is true. Or they think that you're having fun without them. That one bugs me too. That one bugs me, I don't like that. Yeah, it's like, you can, you can sit here and be miserable, but if you dare have fun without me, yeah. I'm instantly pissed. Like, I've Unfair. seen that, I've seen that before. Yeah. That's like, so garbage. Yeah. Such garbage. Like, get out. There's other people out there that aren't like that. Find them. Get get run. Like, run. Trust me, run. Or half your life, or more than half your life, is going to be uh, torture. Torture. Like, it's not... Like, you have one life to live. Like, live it the, like, the fun way, you know? Like, don't 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 be trapped, man. It's, it's bad. But anyways. Yeah. I've lost, I've lost some friends. Over the years, we've lost a few soldiers along the way. Yeah. To some uh, toxic relationships. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's unfortunate. I don't know whatever happened to them, but uh, hopefully they, they hopefully they made it out alive. <laughs> um, but yeah, anyways. <laughs> it's your turn when All you're right. ready. That was a fun little side side rant. Rant, yeah, sure. Or a tangent, I guess. Not necessarily a rant. <laughs> Alex O says, I would love to see one unfiltered stream with a warning label clearly posted. I bet it would be hilarious. Oh my gosh. I mean, there's been a few slip-ups for sure. Yeah. Like, you know, accidental... <laughs> like, why am I getting all these YouTube flag warnings after and my, my video is being uh, flagged on, and reported on YouTube? I don't, I don't get it. What, what's wrong? <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, where were we? Your turn. Your, my turn, turn? your turn. Yeah. Did I do dark hearts? Um, Did I even do anything? No, I haven't even started, right? I've only no, done that one was turn. Me. Yeah. No, you haven't done anything. Sorry, guys. I'm so sorry. For those that don't care about this and are just here for the board game, I'm so sorry. But yeah, this is what we do here sometimes. But it was a talk about how... There's the community in the chat and all of yeah, that. It's related, but educational decree for each card with a value of four or more in hand, active hero loses a health. People are always also very interested in us, like what we do. That's and, the thing about yeah. live streaming. Yeah. Like, yeah, some people don't, don't even care about the game we're playing. They just yeah. want to hang out. Exactly. And there's already videos out there of people playing through this game and every game we play. I don't want to just mirror and make the same thing. Go watch them. Yeah. If you want to watch an edited short form playing the game, explain the game, whatever. But this is Rob's gaming table. We we a little different. Just a little. In good ways and bad ways. Uh, but we're different. All right. I want to... Did I do all this health stuff? No. no. I don't think I have any. Yeah, they're all starter cards. Active lose the health. Yeah, this troll needs to go. He is so frustrating because I never want to put the detention card in. But you could put one in because this will help you get it out of your hand. Yeah, but I'd rather out. not because I'd but rather it, get but rid of it. But if it's in your deck, you won't be able to get rid of it. So that's yeah, why I'm, I, I'm worried. I'd rather use that ability to get rid of one of my starter cards. Same. Yeah, it's greedy. If I can. But then you might, well, this guy sitting here hurt your turns for, and you'll get way behind in the game. You yeah, know? I kind of wish he came like out later. Going to have control problems. 
I need to get something that'll remove the paper. Uh, yeah. Well, I think one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I'll do that. So I'm going to play these for six money, or five money, five money. And I have this for six. I'll, I'll spend the six. Gain one and attack, roll a red die. Yeah, let's take her. So I said they're not like five or four costs, so I can dig for them, but big, big cards, I guess. And then I gain one attack, which unfortunately I'll put there. As long there. as it doesn't heal it, we're fine. We can just go slow and steady, I guess. Or instead to... of the attack, actually, instead of the attack, uh, I'm going to do this. I'm going to toss this card to do this ability and find a card five or less. And what I'll do is take this ally and pretend that I played him in a little different order. So that I could have said I played an ally who will heal me too. Or is it four it's or four less? four or less. Yeah, but this so is going to be gone I'll by your turn. i generate two attack doing it this way instead. Okay. I'll say I played that guy before that guy. I gain the two, shuffle these back. And then these go here. And then I draw, draw but I only four. draw four. Okay. And then we replace. Oh, there's the four cost ally. That's a money one. Okay. Helps us get through the, the junk, but. Okay, and then just before I reveal this, it is my turn, but Miss says, Hi everyone, I'm new to your com uh, content and love watching you guys. I've been watching lots of your old video playthroughs of games. Thank you for your content. Thank you. Thank welcome, you welcome. Lots of new faces today, or yes. new names, I guess. I like it. Faces. I appreciate it. Thank Thanks you. Thanks for joining Thank in you. the chat. People don't bite. Everyone's pretty cool here, so yeah. get involved. Hang out in the chat. You're getting involved in the conversations, the side combos and stuff. Like, yeah. Some people watching later, they think like our little stops and our side combos are like bad and interrupt the video. But like, man, get in the chat. You guys can have all the combos you want in there. And like, there's some good side combos that happen that we don't even address. I just see them and I like oh, read some yeah, of them. People talking but them. yeah, come and join us live and get involved in like a, in the live chat and hang out with other fans who are or like other people who are fans of board gaming or gaming in general or the game that's being played. And just hang out and talk about the game being played. Mm -hmm. Talk about the channel. Talk about whatever. But you find it's like a safe space. People are pretty friendly here. Yeah. Usually. Well, um, we get rid of the ones that are not. No, yeah, I'm just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and even Jack goes, Bandhammer. last 15, 20 minute discussion is why I watch you guys. And yeah, that is yeah. true. People say that, right? And then people that are watching later are like, oh, I wish I could have chimed in. <laughs> then the people who later could just scrub right through it. Like if yeah, they, they see don't the care. cards all stop moving, they hear me start rambling about something off topic. They could uh -huh. just keep scrubbing until they see more cards moving, you know? So I'm not worried about that, but. Yeah. You guys also give life advice along the way. <laughs> some people join in live and are here for the game. But True. Then again, it's like, I can't. But then you want, they should be watching edited content. Yeah, I can't. Yeah, we're live streaming here. I built the whole channel name around. You're at my table, just like at a board game night. If you came over to my house, if I met you at a convention, we're going to play a game. I'm not literally going to sit you down and go, hi, I'm Rob. Shut up. Let's play a game. <laughs> I mean, so maybe. let's only say game words and talk about game and discuss game. <laughs> And if you say anything else, shut up. We need to hurry and finish game. No, I get together at board game night. I meet new people at a tournament, a convention, come over to my house. I want to, hey, what do you do? What, you know, what's your name? Have you ever played games before? What's your favorite? You know, let's talk about it. And then in the middle of the game, they start complaining about something. I'm like, oh, let me tell you about a game that does this better and blah, blah. We talk about whatever, you know? Mm -hmm. Same idea. That's what Rob's gaming table is about. It's like the whole, whole kind of What's your like, significant other life situation? <laughs> That's come up before. I'm just kidding. No. And that's fine. And no, just because of the yeah. talk that we just had. Of both yeah, yeah. Stuff. It's funny. It's a bonus. Anyways, <laughs> carry on. Okay. Uh, all heroes choose one. Discard a spell or lose two health. I think I have to lose two health. I think I'm done either way. So I need to lose two health because I need to keep these two cards. Okay. I'm stunned either way. You have to do the same thing. Discard a spell or lose two health. Actually, if I... Hold on one second. If I discard a spell, then this will make me lose four. That will stun me. Then I only have to discard one. I'm in the same spot. It doesn't matter. Okay, so lose two. Uh, this one 
for each card in hand with a value even or an even influence value active hero loses two health so i lose four but i go down to two and i'm stunned uh discard all tokens half my cards which are going to be these two i pulled that next card doesn't have two dark arts cards on it i know i know sorry like yeah and control to location active hero lose one i'm good and Oh, I have to put a detention in now because yep, I can't. Yeah, do it. Just do oh, it. Okay. In your discard pile. So then, yeah, it was going to happen either way. Okay. Cynthia's here. Hey, Cynthia. Hey. I do love having your stream on while I study the rulebook for a new game. Currently reading the rulebook for Obsession. Nothing to do with what you're playing, but it's still fun to be in chat. Oh, that's, that's awesome. awesome. Love that. Cynthia, love we that. love you hanging around. So this is just play. This is one of the here. good ones. He is. But there's another username you might see in the chat. It's it's instead of Cynthia Walbridge, it's like an, an imposter user that goes by Brian Walbridge. That's the the bad half. We don't you know, don't get those confused. One is definitely better than the other. Okay, I just want to state that for the record for those new people here. Let's watch out for that Brian Walbridge trouble. Trouble. All right, gain one. And he's probably gain hearing one. me hearing me through Cynthia in the background. He's like, oh, that's it. And he's booting it up on his phone to get in the chat and yelling. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to roll the house die because I would like some. Uh, I'm going to roll the green attack die. Yeah. I would like some attack if I can. Health, I cannot gain, but you can. Yay! I don't know if that'll help you not be. Okay, know. so then here says play two even card, or sorry, <laughs> play two cards with an even uh, influence value in one turn. Done. Which I did. So then so this at the goes end of away. Your turn, you get that. Okay, perfect. And this says, is each time you play a card with an even influence value, any one hero gains one health. So now so we have a new here. encounter that is active. It's Norbert and Troll. Each oh. time a hero shuffles her deck, put a detention card in first. Oh, no. Oh, I don't so, like oh, this. Oh, it does need those tokens. Oh, okay, perfect. It does need those tokens. So to complete it, we need to do that dice rolling stuff. Oh, luckily I have one dice. Oh, and I just got the health one too. Oh, dang. So we need a heart okay. and a card draw. Once per game, you may discard this. Then all heroes may banish a card in their hand or discard pile. Okay. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. And I'm going to do that right now, too. This filthy. is so frustrating. Filthy, this filthy. This game is going down. Okay, so the, then yeah, I wrecked. go back to 10. I draw up full. Okay. And then it was before. Each time a hero shuffles their deck, put this in first. Now I have two of these in my deck. Oh, my God. Okay. We're going to get wrecked. I can feel it. It's your turn. Maybe we can just get rid of it quickly. I do, if I can get the house. Guy. All heroes reveal the top card of their deck. Right, one second. Uh, I'm assuming I have to do that, right? Because I don't have a one, deck, two, so. Three, four, five. I have to shuffle, and then I have to put a detention in, right? Yeah, and then what is it? Uh, if they reveal a card with value of one or more, yep. uh, discard it and lose two health. Okay, I'm good. I had a detention. So I have a detention on the top of my deck. That's annoying. Okay. So I'll reveal one. It's the starter card, so we're good. I did that. Each card in hand with even. Nope. Active here, lose a health. And then I think I have to put the detention in so I don't get stunned. Although, getting so stunned lose only lose one, one card. card. Yeah. And I'll just put the. No, token. no, I don't want this. I know. I, need, I don't want location need to get, control. We need to get a card with location and stuff. I don't want location control that bad. It's crazy. The rough times over here. Okay. Oh, this is gone. Sorry, sorry. I don't know what to do here. James, hello. I definitely can gain too money here, but I don't know. Yeah, I, sorry, can, I, had some I can only get up to there. four money. I need six of this die roller if we even thinking of doing that. I could just draw two cards and then attack for two maybe. Yeah. So let's get two money. It's not really going to do anything um, yet. Actually, I should draw first. Hold on. Let's play this. I'm going to get... Uh, Draw two cards. So now I would have three. 
four, five. Nope. Uh, let's just gain two attack, and that will go right here. Like, we need this guy to go, or yeah. we're in trouble. Uh, then I'll play this guy. I'll just get the attack on there. Please tell me you've got two attack coming. Please. Mm, uh, one. Uh, I definitely assigned three or more attack on my turn. All heroes gain a health. Okay. Okay. And then I'll gain three influence. Uh, which, I mean... Yeah, I'll take the Quidditch gear for some heal and attack, I guess. And also okay. pitch it as an item later to dig. Which, I mean, I definitely wouldn't do with that one. Okay. Oh no, I have... Le oh, the no, health thing doesn't matter anymore. So I'm drawing five cards. Yep. I'll be shuffling my deck soon. Oh man, okay. Uh, then let's replace... Oh, that's a good very early game card. Okay. It still could be relevant. Gaining two money for on a piece, one single piece of paper, or just drawing through it later. Yeah, not bad. Uh, active hero uh -huh, loses three health. One, two, three, down to seven. Uh, I'm not stunned, so we don't worry. Reveal an additional dark card. <laughs> active hero loses two health. Okay, wow, five. This one, I oh here each time. Okay, that worked. We're good. Here, I don't have any value cards. Active Hero loses one. Holy moly. Down to two. Down to two. Wow, wow, wow. James is here. Hey, James says, Mel and Rob, joining you to see how the Masters own this expansion. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We're getting kind of slapped around a little bit here. But we'll see if we can overcome. Troll is rough. Yeah, the troll is literally trolling us hard. I'm going to discard two These spells. These encounters are rough, too. Yeah. Gain an influence each and draw a card. Oh. Do you have two attack? Yes. Like, I can just heal But my... it's too late to get... I get hit by that on the start of my turn. Like, you're just going to leave him there? Well, I can only late. do one. Oh, then do whatever, yeah. I'm saying, do like, I'm going to yep, yep. heal two, I guess. I have to, but if I get stunned, I'm, like, losing cards. But I'll, I'll keep the attack, I hope. Uh, unless something comes up that stops me from playing them or something. Uh, I think I'll yeah, need three. This... So, both heroes gain... Or all heroes gain one influence. Spend three... On this, sorry. And then uh, this just gets discarded, but I don't have to lose health when it's just discarded at the end of my, yeah, yeah, my turn because I didn't play it. And then one, two, three, four, five. All right. New card in the market. Pomona Sprout. Sprout. Yeah, okay. Dark Arts. All heroes lose a health. Add a control to location. Oh my god, one, one away, one away. Uh, even. Yep. One even card, so oh, I lose that. two and I'm stunned. Oh. Add a control to location. We flip it at the yeah, end of yeah, the turn, right? Yeah, yeah. But I don't know. There's nothing that removes. No. Okay. Uh, okay, uh, so I gotta get rid of half the cards in my hand. I have six, so we're gonna dump three cards, I think. Yep. Yeah. Although, I could with the money. Oh, yeah, you don't have to do these in order, so do this one first to avoid the detention. Sure, I did that one. Now, this one, that just one whips. Yeah, thank Whatever. you, thank you. Yeah, I, I guess, yeah, I didn't realize we always do them from left to right, but yeah. But yeah, in certain situations. Hmm. Yep. Okay. Uh, let's do this one. Gain an influence and an attack. Oh yeah, you would lose the influence that you had. Oh, that's right. You just have uh, the one. That ruins everything. Okay. Uh, gain influence and roll the red die. Influence for both of us. Uh, yeah, because it's not the symbol I need. Mm -hmm. 
this one will gain attack. I'm going to assign. If you also defeat a villain, gain an influence. Uh, we defeat this villain. All heroes gain a health. Oh, I can't. And then may banish an item from their hand or discard pile. So if I banish this detention, I don't lose two health. No, right? that's only um, discarding, it says. All right, so we're going to banish that one. Yeah, so let's banish this one. Oh, the villain, uh, sorry, the troll's not a villain. So no one oh, oh, yeah, I didn't realize Yeah, he's a creature. <laughs> uh, we're in our first game ever. Thank you for catching that. Oh, yeah, this is a creature, too. Yeah, I, yeah so just I, I even was saying that at the start of the stream over and over again to Mel, like, Villain and creature matter. Cards suck based on them saying villain or creature. We already went through this. Um, but I, I wasn't looking at them as I'm beating him. I keep thinking creatures are going to have money on them. That's what I was thinking would be the difference, but it's not. Um, but again, first time playing. All right. Uh, so don't get that influence. This one I get influence. Oh, someone did comment on the last stream. And this happens a lot, right? People catch all of the mistakes that are in our, our, uh, that work in our against. favor. Yeah. No, opposite. Yes, they catch all the mistakes that are in our favor. Like, I defeated that guy, tried to take extra money. Oh, I get it, yeah. So someone commented on one of the last Harry Potter streams, says your fans like that watch you play this game are mean. <laughs> because they only catch when you guys do something that like helps you make the game easier. But they never catch when you're missing extra money you should get, or attack, or helping you, you know, card order and stuff like that. It's not 100% true. But it is it's funny. funny. I think it is related to this game because I think we make fun of this game sometimes. We we make it look easy, and some people lose at it. And I know they don't want. They're like, no, no, you're playing it wrong. That's why it's easy. So they want to catch us to make sure we fail. Like you know, yeah, sure. Which right? we're gonna fail some of them. Totally happens in games all the time. We play on the channel where people are like, no, this game you shouldn't win this because of this. It's like I find it hard. You need to find it hard. It's like whoops. But I appreciate you guys catching mistakes either way. I appreciate it. But it was so funny, someone just basically said, the fans who watch the game are mean. I think it was a couple times, like, because I'll tell you when you get a bonus from me. And I know, and I know you're reading the chat. Yeah, and, you're, and I don't you, hear it. You, and so you, it's all good. Yeah, exactly. You're looking but at they didn't catch it. There are times when they catch it, like, Rob, you should have an extra money. Yeah, it happens. It happens. That's funny. It's funny. <laughs> There's still a chance in this one. I mean, we'll see what happens when we when we flip this over, but... I assign only two attack, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm shuffling my deck, so I have to put one of these in my thing, my discard. All right, I'm just going to do this while you're shuffling. Oh, my deck is huge. It might be because of sleeves, but... We are revealing two dark arts now. Two yeah, it seems not... It's over, man. Not necessarily. Oh, no, 100% it's over. That is, it's, it's, we're not winning. 100%. I'll, I'll promise you. We'll keep playing, though. I mean, we could get lucky. Oh, this is so good. But the fact we've seen no control for villain tokens, like, it's just going to get even worse and, and speed out of control. And if you thought we were already stunned too many times this early in the game, this two cards from here at a time, we're going to get stunned even faster. Mm -hmm. So, FYI. Uh, Petrif Petrificus Totalis, gain attack. Choose a villain. So let's start. Oh, this is the muting one. Yeah. Cool. Maybe. Maybe that can help us, but it doesn't turn off Dark Arts cards. Oh, no. Each time location is added to the, to the location, or each time control is added to the location, remove an attack from all villains. Okay. Uh, so I have to reveal two of these. Remove two attack from all villains. Well, there's none, so that's good. Oh. I know. And now we're going to roll the green die and see what happens. Card. All heroes discard a card. Okay. Uh, that's fine. Uh, for each card in hand, I don't have any that have value, so we're good on that. Active hero loses one, and we didn't add a control. I'll okay. discard this and lose two. Mm -hmm. Yeah, maybe I should have done that too. I don't know. 
probably not right, but I'm going to draw into cards and I might end up getting a bunch of money where I could grab something good and like grabbing this would be huge. Okay. Grabbing these two with the dice because we need we need to bust yeah, this one. away. Like we can't keep adding detention every time we shuffle. That's messed start. up. Okay, well no, I'll just keep it as is. We'll just okay. I'm gonna discard two spells. All heroes gain one influence and draw a card. Anyone hero gains two health. I will take that. Uh, gain one. I may put spells on the top of my deck. Can't do anything with this, so we'll just throw that out there. Nope. Did you draw two dark cards? You did. Right? I did. I did. Yeah, the yeah. first one was yeah. uh, remove all attack, but there was nothing. Or two attack. Um, and then three. I guess. Oh my gosh. There's not enough spells Ed, happening. Ed, Edgar, what's the difference if I discard this now or later? What's the difference? There is no difference. Oh, you're right. I do. Thank you. <laughs> So it's like I discard it for this ability, I still lose two health. I discard it now, I lose two health. I don't know why I wait, but yeah. Uh, each time you play a card with an even value, anyone, anyone hero gains one health. I will take it. Okay. Done. Oh, am I going to shuffle? Oh my god, I'm going to have so many this is an stupid item? cards in my mm. deck. One, two, three. No, I think I think I would rather discard this one, but we'll see. Uh, because I have unknown information, so I, I would rather discard one of these. Uh, or uh, based on what I see off of this. Sorry, because when I draw from this, I, I might change what I want to do. Right? I, I'm I might not want to dig. Like, what am I digging for? Is that more important? The little cheap ally? I don't know. I don't know. Stupid things in my hand. Okay. Go ahead. Yeah, but that's the way I'm thinking. We'll see. Let me put items you acquire on top of your deck instead of in your discard pile. Okay, great, whatever. All right, Dark Arts 1, Dark Arts 2. All right, Active Hero loses 2. All others lose 1. Great. All heroes choose 1, discard an item or lose 2 health. All lose 2 health. Okay, stir my turn. <laughs> this game is just... Uh, no. No. There's two. No. Active hero loses one. Uh, each time it's added. No, not added. Okay. I'll, I'm going to play this. Definitely draw two cards. And I'll choose to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, let's gain attack. Two attack. Okay. Then we're going to play this one, gain an influence, an attack, and roll the red die. Coin, not okay. a heart or a thing. Okay, we just gain a coin. Okay. Attack, I have three. Uh, this. I will gain an attack. I'll play this, gain an influence, and for each ally I played, which is two, right? yeah, two, I gain an attack. Gain three influence. So I'm at seven. I think that's all I need. So I wouldn't do this to gain extra. I don't see an eight cost card here. So I could just grab any six or grab the seven. Yes, yeah, so the money does not matter. Okay, so what I'm going to do is assign six damage. Okay. 
Nice. To a creature. Killing creature. All heroes gain two health. And an influence. Thank you. And then I'm going to spend seven of my eight influence. Oh, Mike James with the Super Chat. Member for 12 months, rocking the gold die. Finally rocking the gold die. Thanks for a year of content. Looking forward to more great games. Thank you, Mike, so much Thank for you, the long-term support. We appreciate it. Thank gold you. Gold die. Nice. Welcome to the Gold Die Club. There's quite a few gold dies. Yeah. Sprinkle in there. Thank you. Thank uh, you. Thank you for supporting us for so long. Much appreciated. Thanks for being part of the community. All right. Uh, I'm going to buy this one. One of these allies said attack on them. I would buy them instead. <laughs> That's fine. But I don't need them late game rolling dice and not getting me attack value. This one will give me attack at least. I prefer the allies working with the attack thing, but oh well. All right. And then you did Ron's ability because you just did a ton of six. Yeah, damage. yeah. Uh, all heroes gain a health. Boom. Nice. All right. Uh, so we'll fill here, and then we need to reveal a new villain. Oh, oh there we go. there's a card. That's a classic. That's a classic card. Always good. Oh, we got the new Basilisk. Hero heroes cannot draw extra cards. Oh, it's the same. Okay, it's, it's the same, same it has creature, creature trait and villain. And villain. Okay, so it works for both situations. Okay, we can't draw extra cards this turn or anymore. Uh, all heroes lose one health and cannot draw extra cards this turn. Well, we're not already, anyways. Uh, active hero loses one health and discards a card. Card that will you can find yeah, some location funny. control, like one or two cards. Okay, actually, that's only two. No, 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 rewind, rewind. I won't have enough. Oh, I have two here. You get this, the shutting them up one, or even I don't know. this card draw. All right, yeah, let's do this because I don't know yet. Oh, I can't draw, can't draw. That would be two, that'd be four, maybe five. No, 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 I can't since I can't draw. We're just going to get rid of this one. Okay. Uh, those are my two. Can't draw. Active hero loses one health, and we didn't add control. Okay. Anyone answer Mrs. question? If, oh, if no, you, I meant to. Wait, you were, if you yeah. played the Charms and Potions expansion, do you think you'd mix it with this one, too? I think I think that's a question for us. Like when, when... No, I, no, I'm, I'm going to play the campaign in it, however it's meant to be played, like the first time out of the box. Maybe in the future after we play through all the campaigns, if we do, uh, we'll mix stuff together and all that. But right now, we're just playing in order of release, pretending like we got into it years ago when there was only one expansion released, and we were going to play through this, and then... We already have that expansion, then we'll maybe go into that and play through that campaign, however it's recommended. Uh, will we mix both? I don't know. I haven't even opened the other one to see what it recommends to do on your first time playing through. This one at least recommended, like, finish game seven of the base game, then start mixing them together uh, the way it says, and that's the way we're following it. So hopefully that, that makes sense. All right, I'm going to choose and roll a house die. I'm going to roll the green one for possible attack. Uh, the reason I yes. didn't do a platinum die is because it looked too close to the silver. And I want the gold, the yellow, like, my favorite color is yellow, and the gold die popped so much in the chat, especially if you're on dark mode uh, on YouTube, it popped so much, I always wanted gold to be the top die. Like, that, there's no platinum. Platinum, it would look so much like silver that it's like, people wouldn't know if you're a silver die, you know? Like, that's why I didn't do that. That's why I stopped at gold, if that makes sense. Um, oh, yeah. you're right. I, let's rewind that. Yeah, yeah. Let's rewind. Let's not roll this one. Let's roll the health die. Let's roll the health, health die yeah, for this. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I was rolling for attack, but I really should. Yes, oh. let's do. Okay, yeah, thank you. Yeah, we need so to get rid of bad. that. Okay, and then um, here, each time you play a card with even influence value, any one hero gains a health. What are you at? Five and five. Whatever, do whatever. Okay, I'll, I'll take this one. And then here I gain one. And then you can gain a health. And then this doesn't do anything. So put that there. I have three, which I could just spend for two just to clear and get more spells in my deck, I guess. I'm just discarded. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Polyjuice. 
All right. Going to. Mm -hmm. First one. For each card with a value of four or more in hand, the active hero loses a health. Nope. All threes. Nice. Uh, add a control to the location. Cannot draw cards. I lose a health. That's uh, we're good. Uh, it says each time, each time you play a card with an even influence value, anyone here. So each time, not each round. Yeah, it's not a once per game, it's not a once per turn, yeah. but it only happens on Mel's turn. But there's no limit to the amount of times. Yeah. It doesn't say once per turn or anything. Okay. I feel like I want to, I don't even know what's in my deck anymore. <laughs> I've been buying the stupidest cards. I know. I feel like I feel like, like I'm doing the junk, same. Like all junk, all expensive, and like it doesn't even work with this ability. But and then I think I'm holding the ones that do work with the ability. So I'd just be getting a starter card, but it does cycle through my deck. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna toss this to look through my deck and grab a card. Yeah, not the greatest. Oh, you can't. Oh, yeah. You're grabbing, not look, not drawing. Five or less. Yeah, yeah it's not draw. Yes, but it does help get cycled through my deck. Um, shuffle, 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 shuffle. Okay, uh, so let's just gain an attack and a health. Let's gain an attack, and then let's gain three influence. And we'll oh, that's a great question. Uh, if you use this, do you have to gain a detention each time a hero shuffles their deck? Is that no? I, no? I don't think but so. But then it says then shuffle your deck. I don't know if it's intended to be when you shuffle for cycling, or just in general shuffles. That's a great question, though. I don't know the answer. I'll do it though. Sure, I'll do it. Would that change what you? No, no. I'll just do it. Yeah, we got to play the worst way because that's what, that's what the diehard fans of this game want. That's the way we play it. <laughs> I'm telling you, they're mean, man. The the players who play this game are horrible people. They are cutthroat. <laughs> I joke and say you're not a hardcore gamer if you play this game because it's a pretty like light deck builder. Obviously, with the expansion, we're now in hardcore territory. But yeah, definitely. Uh, not hardcore, but like definitely medium to heavy weight for sure, or yeah. medium weight ish. That's rough. Yeah, but I yeah, agree. They, We're gonna have people a full take this game of... serious. The uh, Harry Potter fans, you think they're like young and like they love magic and all this? No, they're like they're like cutthroat rules lawyers. It's crazy. But it doesn't say your the. It just says each time a hero shuffles their deck. Yeah. Not anything about like their discard pile into their deck. I know. I know. Yep. So this right here says shuffle your deck. So, sure. I don't think they play tested or cared about those kind of interactions. It's probably in the FAQ. Don't care though. I'll just do it because I don't care. But we'll just keep going. It's just easier that way. All right, but you can continue your turn. Sorry, you're still playing. But again, play however you want. It's your game. You buy it. Do whatever you want with your game. Don't don't do necessarily the way we're doing it because it may not be the right way. It may not be the intended, designed way of doing it. Uh, yeah. Okay. So sorry. What am I doing? I don't even know where I was. You were. Before we went on that. You played the item to get that Oh, item. yes, that's right. Okay, so I have money. I'm going to spend three money and buy this card. But you still have whatever's in your hand, no? Have you played all this? No, of this I played all oh, this. Okay. Uh, so I'll put this here. Uh, this two attack. Now I will draw three. I need to shuffle. But first I will put one of these in here. So, yep, even worse. Uh, yep, we'll play it on hard mode. It's all good. What's in there? Yep. Okay. Well, this ally gives you two attack and all hero or all heroes gain two health. Okay. Two dark arts. Oh, this is bo box one. This is the new one. Uh, Raging troll. The next. Hero loses two health and add a control to the location. What does the next hero mean? Like in turn order? I would assume. Okay. I don't know. Sure. Add the control. That's a new that's a new term. Remove one of these. 
Oh, out of control. Yeah. And then remove one of these. Okay. Uh, can't draw cards. Active hero loses one, and we've already done that. Okay. And I can't draw, so maybe I can actually just play one, two, three, four, five, six. All heroes gain one influence. So I'll have six, and you will have one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Did you take one influence? One influence yes. I take. Yes. Thank you. And then if you play four or more spells on your turn, any two heroes each gain an attack. Ooh. Okay. And then can I put these on the top of my deck? No, unfortunately. Oh, they healed that? Yeah. The damage? Yeah, because they put so two dumb. from that. So then I'll spend six. <laughs> Woo. Huh. Do I here's a question. Do I spend six and I probably want to gain this? For, I don't know. Or the gain two attack and draw a card. Whichever Can't. one. I both are amazing. Let's do this one because maybe one I can still get two attack, right? Yeah, and yeah. I can blank if this guy's still out. Yeah, that's huge. Okay. And then Or any future attack. combo. I guess gonna... we're trying here if it doesn't heal. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Go ahead. First one, active hero loses a health. Reveal additional dark arts still on the first card. All heroes lose a health. And then for each card in hand with value of exactly three. Oh, sorry, one health for exactly three only. So oh, all heroes? Yeah, I don't have an exactly three. No. Nope. Okay. And then we have all heroes lose a health. And then add a uh, control to the location. Okay, which means he says this is going to heal that. Oh, I'm sorry. Let me just reveal this. Okay, awesome. Did I play? Yeah, so I'm going to get rid of this guy. No, that was not even. Yeah, let me get rid of that guy. I don't know. He will remove a control if we can get there. Oh. Okay, yeah. Mm. All right, I'm gonna attack two. Roll the red. Influence. Garbage. Oh, gain an influence. Gain an influence. And then, um, for four, do I even buy? Oh, roll twice, does it say on your card? Roll twice. Oh, okay. oh it does say roll twice. Thank you. Oh, oh, thanks. <laughs> Neil pets one of the good ones. Another oh, another. Money. Okay. Not what we want. We want a card. Well, maybe. Well, this can get rid of five money. We will want money when we have baddies that need money. Five money. Yep. Show it six. I mean, I could have signed this first. I'm going to sign this first here. Mm -hmm. Then all heroes gain one health. Yeah, I can do some better. I uh, oh no, the shuffle thing's still a problem. Yeah, no, that's fine. Yeah, we just need to try to get rid of that. I'll try to roll the card draw die next time I get that card, but... Okay. Good place. Oh, I like Nimbus this Nimbus 2001. Gain to attack. If you defeat a villain, also gain to influence. Okay. Oh, box one. The next hero... Which would be you loses two health and add a control to the location. That heals one from him. All heroes lose two health and cannot gain health this turn. So I'm stunned. So add another control. Um, hmm. And he heals. Okay. Can't draw active hero loses one. And we already did that. I don't think I'll be able to. Yeah, I can't. I know. Like, I don't know why we're still playing, but just to sh just to go through it, because you have hope. But I I knew it was lost once we flipped that location. I based like on what was going on in our deck. I'm literally having dead turns. And you seem to also. Uh, one, two, three. Oh yeah, these don't make me lose health right now, right? No. That's right, duh. Yeah, yeah, sorry guys. Uh, for some reason, I forget the whole thing that you don't keep, like it doesn't keep hurting you when you're stunned. 
Thank you. Yeah, I definitely forgot that. I was like, man. This one. Although, on my turn, actually, I want to uh, discard this for this. Oh. Maybe, if this is gone. but I, I can't get rid of it this turn. Oh, then. Yeah, no, it doesn't matter. Who cares? Uh, this does nothing because we can't heal. This one will gain an attack. And then five, I'll just go for the broom. The Nimbus broom. Hate not being able to draw. One, two, add one of these. All right, go ahead. Crystal Ball, draw two cards and discard any one. Okay, draw two Dark Arts cards. All heroes lose a health. Oh yeah, I'd be full, now I'm back. And then uh, add a control. Oh, that would already Oh yeah, fit. sorry, sorry. Yeah. I'm still, sorry. One, two, this. three, four, Okay, five. what's this one? Oh, three Dark Arts, awesome, okay. Well, do you want to scoop it then if you are, just like if you don't think it's even possible? I don't yeah. know. What do you mean you don't know? Like. It, you, you never know what, what can turn around and okay. what luck we can have. But if you want to scoop it because you, you think it's a waste. Like you think based on the amount of attack we're generating and how much control tokens we're adding every turn, you think we're going to win? It, I and don't we know. have zero. If we had like one or two villain control things to buy time to get back into it, yes. But I have literally keep pulling cards off this deck that's way too big. And I don't see a single, oh, there's one. Oh, man, we could win it. Okay, great. No, 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 if you think that it's not worth it, then we can just... No, I'll show you. We'll keep going. No, it's not about showing. But I want to yeah. see, so we know. We get to get more information, right? If we play the full game through, we'll learn. I know some people will fight me on that and say, no, you should always scoop and play again. But I think, I've always been a believer of this, playing the full game out to see, you just get more knowledge, more information to see what your engine can do, your deck can do in a competitive card game, whatever, right? Yeah. Okay. So uh, that was one. Add a control. Uh, active I, hero loses two oh, health. Yeah, okay, you. and then my third one, active hero loses two health. Okay, fun. All right, then I will. And then you have to lose one. For oh yeah, game. sorry. Let me continue. Uh, okay. This doesn't matter. This can't draw cards. This I lose a health. And then this would heal from. Oh that yeah, one. he plays that, so he heals. Okay. No, let's just stop because you're not. No. I want to see how this goes. I want to see how far we get. We'll see some more of these. We'll see some more enemies. We'll get more but information. But then they're going to change, potentially. I know. I know. Yeah. Yeah, the thing with the random, like, this is kind of gross. And it, it, like, this, based on just the first six cards in the market, you can almost call, if you play this game enough, I bet you could put this in a simulator. Based on the cards that get drawn in the first six, you could find out, like, if you're going to, the odds of winning versus losing. I bet if someone played, like, you know, simulated 500,000 games, you could easily go, oh, yeah, we're going to lose based on the market you see at the beginning. Depending on the villain makeup, then the villain makeup's random now, out of and you might not see some in there. So right. you could see guys that maybe aren't hitting you as hard for certain things you need to control from here versus the other way, which is interesting. But we can discuss that later. Okay, gain an attack. Uh, gain an. Gain an attack. Sure. Uh, bruh, bruh. I'll, uh, uh, no, I don't think it's worth it. I, I can't see how it's worth it. I'll just hold hold this. Uh, let me just put these here. And then, uh, yeah, that's my, my turn. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, I didn't buy anything. Do we cycle? No, there's there's good stuff there still. I would definitely not cycle. But maybe I would have a few turns ago if I remembered that house rule that's in the rule book, the optional rule. Uh, there was a turn where one of us didn't buy something a few turns ago. If we realized we were struggling on villain control, we could have uh, cycled just to try to dig for villain token control. Right. Because that's what we're hurting on right now. We just need one or two cycling in our decks to then hold off from hitting the two or three Dark Arts cards. So that's like literally because we haven't seen any, but that is on us because we didn't do the optional clear the market. But I didn't really personally want to clear the market because I see amazing cards like that. I know, it. I see cards I and, want to and buy. And these, these couple could have been good, but I was passing on these. So like, what can I say, right? Yeah. So yeah, this this that made me not want to clear it. 
because that, that card, getting that in our deck as fast as possible could have been something. But this guy came out and said, no, that card sucks right now. That's true. That's true. So, yeah. All heroes choose one. Discard an ally or lose two health. I don't have an ally. I'm going to lose two health. I'm stunned. I don't have any tokens. Discard. Yeah, like, I, I got to keep my ally because, like, we need two to cards. roll a die. Like, because I'm, I'm playing rando mechanics here, and it's, like... Out of control. Not fun, I find, with the... With the relying on a dice roll. I know. No, no, sorry. This is not relying on a dice roll. Sorry. This is relying on drawing from an oversized deck to find cards that maybe roll the dice that maybe don't even have the odds a one in six or better of even rolling this, right? Yeah. Like that, that's bad design, I think. That's a very bad design. Uh, so this because I like I don't like this in games. It's bad design for me for those who like dice rolling and luck and all that and don't care about your time being wasted. Well, I think it's mechanics like this that put that rule in about clearing the market one time, like just to be able to dig six more so, cards. In. Even, even so, it's only six cards. I know it's only six cards, and how many actually let you roll dice and let you roll the dice that generate these two symbols that often? I know, right? Yeah. Like what have I been rolling? I've been rolling the money die over and over again because of what we saw. And I'm just not getting one of these two, but it makes sense because it's a one and six. Right. Yeah, it's just, just it's weird. Anyways. Uh, okay. Uh, I can't discard that. So what was I, my punishment? Two health. Two health. Okay, easy. All heroes lose one health for each creature. Uh, one, one. I'm already stunned. Just stunned. Down to one. Perfect. Okay. Active hero loses one health and reveal additional dark rights. I'm already down to nothing. Active hero puts a, a detention in their hand. Oh, son of a gun. Uh, then all heroes lose one health for each detention in hand. Oh, I'm well, I have done. none for once. I'm already stunned, so that's fine. Okay. Oh, uh, no, no, I'm already stunned. And okay, we already did that. Okay. Let's see. Hmm. Can't draw, so let's do any two heroes each gain an influence and a health. Can't gain a health. Uh, one. One, I can put items on the top of my deck. Well, I can't draw cards, so. Annoying. Three. This does nothing. Draw two cards and no, I'll just take this one, I guess. Goes on top of my deck. Done. Any two heroes each gain one and draw cards. The pensive. Pensive. Well, I got the house die again, so maybe we can clear that, but we'll see. Okay. All right, three dark arts cards. Here we go. But could be more because they can cascade. I can here lose three health. Boom, stunned. Okay, what else we got? Uh, if it stuns, also add an additional to, to two. control. Oh, this also reveal additional, so I'm doing at least four dark arts cards. And then I'll hit both of those. Still on number one. At all heroes lose a health. I can't, but add a control. Now on to card number two. All, all heroes lose three health. Oh, sorry. I was supposed to be back up. Was this one? All heroes lose one. And then all heroes lose three. One, two, yep. three. Sorry. Third card. Uh, active hero loses one. I can't. And please add another control to location for me. Okay, we're, we're one, one away. Okay, nice. All right. Uh, next, what do we got down here? Can't draw cards. Oh, I already can't lose the health. Okay. Uh, oh, we added how many? Oh, so they're all healed. Okay, cool. All right. So let's see what I can do here. I'm going to play this ally uh, again. Awesome. Uh, oh, you wouldn't have that token. Oh, oh this token I lose. Thank you. Uh, so I gain one, I gain an attack, and I'm going to roll the red die. Just praying, praying for this, but I mean, you know. Oh, oh, we got it. Oh, wow. But it doesn't I got go it. away till the. You, I guess you get on your doesn't turn. Doesn't matter. Right? Who cares? All right. Once per game, you may discard this. Then all heroes may banish a card in their hand. Oh, I guess you could get it now. Holy juice. No, we do it end of turn, right? Well, it's a card in your hand. So I guess, yeah. When Anyways, you draw back. Uh, so I'm copying this ability. Okay. Oh, yeah, discard. Did you, did you discard for being stunned? Discard for being stunned. Oh, you're right. Thank you. Uh, sorry, these two will be discarded. Okay. Uh, Poly juice this. Roll and red die. Oh, card draw. Can't draw. Uh, this one. Hmm. I guess I'm doing money and attack for my Felix. Okay. 
Uh, then, for money, hmm, kind of sucky. Kind of sucky. I I won't buy anything. I won't buy anything. I'm gonna I'm gonna do that once once per game thing. I don't know if it happens at the end of your turn right away. I, I'm not sure. I think it's the whole turn. Because I can't buy anything on the turn, so it makes sense, right? Mm -hmm. Let's just see. YOLO. YOLO. Anyways, uh, okay. Four attack. Uh, I'll sign here for no reason. And then I'll uh, let you heal one. As I assign three or more. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Don't need to shuffle yet. Interest. Oh, this is going oh, that's to end the turn yeah. anyway, so there might be something else that's going to hurt you right here. Okay, heroes do not collect the rewards for defeating villains and creatures. Play two allies, wow. two items, and two spells. We can't draw, so this is we can't do anything with this until we get rid of this guy. Hold on, hold on. Play two allies, comma, two items, and two spells in one turn? Yeah. So you, we need this guy to be gone so we can draw and have all of that line up. What? That's a thing? In a game where you can't even decide the order of your discard pile? Well, that's where you're just hoping you have draw, that you can just... Because remember in the past when you're drawing a ton of cards, you can make that happen. You literally have to have six cards in your hand and they have to be specifically those types. I don't care about your draw effect. You have to make sure you get those types. Yeah. Like what if all game I've not been buying one of those types? Yeah, I haven't bought any allies, so I can't do it. Yeah, it's messed up. Is it not supposed to be an ore? No, I guess not by the end of the game. I don't know. Yeah. That's messy. What if you didn't see any draw cards come up? What if those didn't come up in your market? Or, or you have a villain out here that's getting healed and you can't even get rid of him and he tells you you can't draw cards. Hmm. And then, and then the crazy part is this card stops you from getting the card draws when you defeat a villain to try to get to possibly have this happen. I'm maybe reading this wrong. I don't know, but this card seems like a huge block. Yeah, but I think it's supposed to be. Hmm. Hmm. But it makes sense if you think back to many of the turns that you had in the in the last game. But that was before they added in the whole like uh, clogging up your deck. So like, yeah, and and again, it's it's de definitely relevant. Some games it'll happen depending on the right flow of these things, right? And him not showing up till later in the game. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. Interesting. Okay, so then I have this now. Once per game, you may discard this. Then all heroes may banish a card in their hand or discard pile. But the worst part is, like, we're not going to be able to get rid of the control off by getting rid of these guys. That's, like, that's, like, harsh. Yeah. Well, but, I know. We might lose right now with these yeah, two. Yeah. Add these three. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, That's fine. All right. I heal back up to ten. Go nuts. Look at any of these yet? No. Okay. Ooh. All heroes reveal a top card of their deck. Heroes that reveal a spell, discard it and lose two health. Spell, discard it, lose two health. Uh, okay, I got to shuffle, but before I shuffle, I add another one of these in. Okay, that, that's great. Ooh. Dustin, hey Dustin, how's it going? Dustin says, uh, hence why I found this expansion frustrating. Yeah, you're not the only person to tell us this expansion is kind of sucky. I don't think it's frustrating. I think you just have to play with what you're given. Like, you have to play with what it does. And now that we've seen all that it does, you know how to play, I think. Yeah, but you can't decide what card. Oh, you don't have to add that detention. It's gone. Oh, thank you. Yeah, that's Thank not... you, thank you. That's not a built-in rule. Thank you. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, we got rid of that card. Woo! Now we can shuffle freely. Can that you is. tell the frustration is short-circuiting my brain? Can you tell? That's what I was saying. You can just, we can just scoop it. But what do you do? You keep scooping until you get a lucky market? No, I think now that we know more information. Or a good enemy draw? I think having the troll early was rough. <laughs> kind of like when you have that Dementor, Dementor early, yeah, yeah. right? It's but kind we, of replacing... We've gotten out of that before. Yeah. But... It's all good. Again, we're playing blind. It's our first time. That's what I'm saying. So, so we're getting, we like, surprised see. by things. You have to reveal. And if it's a spell, you have to discard it and lose two health. You're, ah, you're it's good. a bird. Eat okay. it. 
Uh, active hero loses one health and cannot assign more than one attack to each villain this turn. That's fine. I don't think I even have attack anyways. Uh, the previous hero loses one health and discards a card. Oh no. I think I have to hope to get money to get this to remove control, so I gotta discard this item, I think. That sucks, but... Yeah. And then I lose one health from or, that. No, I'll, I'll actually discard this because I could draw into cards that maybe get me more money, but I doubt it. I don't think I have such things. Okay. So what do you need, money? Yeah, it, well, it would help, or if you could buy it. One I don't of the have money. To buy this, I like, don't have a money it, generating because my deck you know, is so big from buying garbage cards that showed up. Same. I, I, it would take n n from n from detentions uh, buffing up my deck. Getting this into here and getting it through my engine to even remove one is like way too far away. Drawing three dark arts cards at a time, it's like wait and and not being able to even use the villains to to remove some, like it's just inevitable. But. Maybe we got lucky and there are none in there, and then we shuffle and we don't get them near the top, adding... And none of us get stunned, by the way, too. Like, yeah, we can't gonna, get stunned. I'm gonna heal four. One, two, three, four. These don't do anything, so I'll just discard two to give everybody one influence. Can't draw. And then roll the house die. I guess we're just looking for attack, right? To get rid of... I don't know. Just roll it. Doesn't change anything. Attack. Woo! Okay. And I'm done. This is not doing anything. All right. All heroes lose a health for each card in hand with a value of exactly three. One. 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 All heroes lose two health and cannot gain health this turn. Two, one, two. All heroes lose one health and cannot draw extra cards this turn. Okay. Draw, so, uh, yep, that doesn't cascade. Can't heal. Okay. Can't heal, can't draw. Fun times. Okay. Oh, hold on. Yeah, sorry, sorry. Three. Uh, you were at... What were you at before you started? You lost three, right? You can heal one, heal one from this, and I'll heal two, because that should have happened before. One, two, three, what, or two. What's happening? Sorry, you want Last me to... turn, yeah. Sorry, you, you'll be here. Okay. Yeah, because okay. I forgot about this, that those three oh, cards okay. I should have gave three health yes. out. So I took two, you took one. Sorry. Thank you, thank you. All right, I'll toss this item. I'm going to look through my deck. Five costs or less. Let's see. Yeah, we'll just take this guy. I don't know. Oh, wait. No, we literally need the money. It's our only play. Oh, I can two, three, four, five. I can buy that and put on top of my deck. Okay. Well, that might be too late. Might be. But it'll be faster but, and I can do it. Yeah. So if that makes a difference for what you're doing. Yeah. Okay. I'll still just take this guy then. All right. Three influence. And I oh. yeah. Oh. I'll just scan to attack. Yeah. And then I will.
not by anyone. Uh, all heroes seal one from this ability. Okay, our next villain, Draco. Okay, so three of these. Be one, two, three. Active hero chooses another hero to Oh, I can't to heal. I can't heal this turn. Yeah, that's oh. right. That was the thing, right? Oh, Draw was it all extra. heroes? Yeah, not heal. Yeah, sorry. Take that no away. Worries, no worries. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, active hero chooses another hero to lose two health, which is you, and then reveal additional dark arts. Uh, active hero loses one health and reveal an additional dark arts. Active hero puts detention in their hand. Oops. In their hand. Uh, then all <laughs> heroes lose one health for each detention in hand. So you have, everybody loses a health per detention. One. Do you have any detentions in hand? You lose one health. All right. Okay. Great. We're going to roll out. the green die. Coin. Add a control to the location. Okay, yeah, I think we're done then. But you but. can put this on top of your deck and play it, right? No, I can put it on top of my deck. Oh. I can't play it. <laughs> <It's>, yeah. <laughs> and then I would be stunned and we would add an additional. GG's. Okay. All right, thank you. I told you we could have scooped it. No, but you still said your stupid line, your optimism line, without stopping and thinking first. No, I was thinking that you never know what's going to happen. I didn't know this was going to tell us. Had that not said... Mm, I don't think that was what ended us. Uh, way before seeing that, it was over. Like, way before. Way before. It was just the, we don't have the attack output to keep up with the rate that they're destroying our health and we're piling up these metal tokens. We can't even clear, like, a villain for ten turns, but they go through three locations. Like, it's that's too fast on their side. They're winning the race faster. And it's just like not even possible to come back no matter what card you draw. Especially when you're slowing down your engine with these, right? You're just not drawing into your solutions, even if you saw your solutions. So if we're going to get stunned like that crazy, we need cards that remove control. That's, that's the answer to that. Or, or much healing. But then there's lots of ways it stops you from removing control and healing. So right. they have answers for that stuff, right? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I think also getting unlucky and having this. Oh, that guy's going to come in no matter what. Yeah, the way we're playing it, yes. Yeah. I mean, you could. You could rule it that he is a replacing a card from the first set, so you would grab a random from there and shuffle them in, but I think it's intended think, yeah. that this first playthrough, you're supposed to do it that way. Like they're making, he's from this set now. Okay, so then one, two. Uh, James says, flying proficiency removes control markers and is needed in this game. Is that the new one? First time you assign one or more to a creature, any one hero heals. If you defeat a creature, also remove. I mean, that makes up for them removing the bonus off of defeating a creature or villain. That's only for creatures. There was another one, too, that was like, if you spend five influence or more, you can remove. Flying lessons? Once per turn, you may discard five money if you do remove from the location. That's the one we always said was so good. Yeah, I think if it's good. If you just weren't sure, you, you put that one. Because late game, when you're not buying cards, you just do this. Yeah, this is the one from the from earlier. Yeah. yeah, this is the one I always said was like the third one in the set that you would just grab if you weren't sure. Because it's just, this is good. Now, I can change mine. I'm happy to change mine. I mean, it does. Well, based on our ruling the... of shuffling my deck and then I take a... Hard, like 
Yeah, I would just replace it with this because that breaks that other card and makes it garbage. For like the majority of the game, it felt like because we got stuck. You think I added detentions? I did, I did. <laughs> I, I'm sitting here in my head thinking this deck is so big it makes me not want to play this game. Really? Yeah. I'll shuffle it if that's the problem. N no, or just like in, in general. general. Yeah, this would, this, this, a deck, a deck this big in a game, um, and not to mention if you played the whole setup of like, let's reset the whole thing and play from the beginning. Like the cleanup of deck building games, like sometimes just makes me not want to get them out and play them, especially for some of them, but, uh, Yes, leaving this has definitely like bothered me. So maybe let's. But it's needed because oh. our base cards are like the card quality in this game is so trash. Every time I try to push a card in, they were like almost bent. Two, two of them I bent um, because they were like the card is so f like cheap, flimsy, thin cardstock. They were like bending me trying to put them in these good sleeves. I think you have to use like really cheap sleeves for this game to match the quality of the cards, but. Um, but uh, because of the base game cards, shuffling the starter cards so much, they did start to wear off only after playing like eight times. They, you can definitely tell. I could easily tell if I wanted to look very closely. I could see even a few games ago, like if I was about to draw a starter card or not. Like then it just kind of breaks the game, right? So I figured let's shuffle, but it just sucks to keep adding more cards to this deck. This is, that's so dumb. Like this is ridiculous. Ridiculous. Uh, Daniel, I have no interest in that game. No interest right now. Not at all. I don't think I'll, I'll ever have interest for that. Don't think I'll ever have interest in that game. I already don't play enough of the other one I own. I haven't even played an expansion I own for that game, too. So, yeah. I'm not about just buying games just for no reason. I can't do that. Hello, Brett. Brett, hello. Brett, thank you for the super chat. Hey, gaming table friends. We're moving to a new house. Nice. Congrats. Unless it's for bad reasons. Um, been staying away from live stream, so I, I don't do too much of this. Brett, we appreciate Brett, it. Thank, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. So one thing that's worse, I think, is moving homes. I oh, hate going through that process terrible. myself. Worse than shuffling these giant decks of cards. <laughs> Thank you for the super chat. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Good so, luck with your move. So we're saying this proficiency instead. Sure. Let's try it. Do you think that one or the other one? The new one? No, not the new one. Okay. The new one just happens passively as you add, you know? Only the first time. Right? This is not clear, by the way. The first time you assign one or more damage or coins to a creature. Is it the first time on your turn? Oh, I Is it that. the first time for that villain or creature? Sorry. What happens if the creature got healed and you go to assign the first damage again? Does that consider the first time? Or does it remember previous rounds of the game when you assigned damage that got healed? Basically, because this game, this this templating and the rule writing is so horrible in this card, I don't even want to like deal with it right now. So uh, let's just get into playing the game. Just getting to play it. Yeah. The fact is an expansion for a very highly played game, like how they don't have, they didn't think through some of this stuff. Like you shouldn't have questions like that coming up, but hey. Ron needs attacked. Yeah, does he though? I, I think this Ron card kind of stinks too. I, I feel like the other one was better, whatever it was. But again, we're just playing with the one that comes in box one. I, I don't know. But like, again, I want to shuffle these cards all together. Oh, I'm like shuffling halves at a time. <laughs> so stupid. Oh, man. Sorry. Well, I have to do it. I mm -hmm. have to. It feels so dumb. I'm sitting here shuffling on stream for so long. Like this is the kind of thing I would do before gamers came over to play the game because I wouldn't want to have them sit there watching me shuffle the, bo the boring side of gaming. Anybody that plays board games understands that shuffling needs to happen. But this this, this amount? Well, I mean, I guess depending on the game. For Wingspan and Terraforming Mars with expansions and stuff, yeah. 
Maybe it's this game that made those games think they could get away with doing that, and that was cool to do. Because it's not cool. And at least if you're going to make the deck that big by adding every expansion, keep adding more cards to the deck and not taking cards out, which is like something we see in other deck builders do, right? They'll say, put these in, but remove these, right? To change up the feel of it. This game is just lazy, and they say just keep throwing more in. They should at least use card quality that could survive the shuffling. Because without the sleeves, the deck is manageable-ish. But uh, with sleeves, this is a joke. <laughs> After I sleeved it, I regretted it right away. I was like, oh, I should unsleeve all these, but... The core set card's wearing down after like eight plays. It's embarrassing. And it actually like ruins the game. Because then you can kind of tell what you're going to draw. Oh, man. But yeah. Definitely see why Janet put this game back on the show. Well, I think Janet said that they were having trouble with uh, like, oh. box two from the Yeah, I can't wait. <laughs> uh, but we'll try. Oh. I hope you just shuffle them if you don't want to. Oh, I did just shuffle them. I know. And I'm just trying to like put them back in, kind of like a little, little mix. I'm I'm just praying we have a good good amount of like in the first twenty cards of the deck that we'll see in the playthrough that we have a little bit of heal, a little bit of draw, some attack, like not just money cards and buying junk just to get it out of the market. Michael says you're going to have some uh, trouble with hand cramping tonight. Yeah. No kidding. All right. I'm just going to put it in two stacks and we can pick which stack you want to draw off of. Okay. I don't know. Let's divide it in half ish. There we go. Okay. All right. Uh, six cards. Here we go. First two cards in the market. Oh, Oops. we got control and cheap. You sign at least one? No. This card is a trap card. Gain one attack. If you assign at least one attack to each villain, also remove control. That's a trap because that that will get healed, and you know you don't ne normally want to spread out damage like that. It's almost not worth it. But yeah, it's a trap card for sure. Oh, there you go. Dobby can help us. Dobby is helpful. He's a good for four cost card. Mm -hmm. But do we have e even number cards, which we need for the start of the game? One, right? two so far. Okay, we got a couple. Okay, we have a couple then. A chocolate frog, man. See, you have to buy garbage cards just to get even cards in your deck. That's not a good play. But hey, whatever. All right. All right. Uh, shuffle my deck. SWKDB says Magic had a format back in the 90s that had 250 card minimum decks. And now people don't play that version anymore. <laughs> <laughs> it died in the 90s. Leave it in the 90s. Just because it happened doesn't mean it was a good thing. But isn't, aren't Commander decks huge? I don't know much about Magic, but I think Commander decks, right? That's like the huge format. I know Game of Thrones card game when we played that. There was like an agenda for first and I think second edition that let you make a huge deck. But then you had to put a bunch of, like, you can only have one copy of every card or something in it. Oh, okay. So then it, like, diluted Oh, that's it. annoying. Or you could draw, no. One of them was draw an extra card in the turn, which is huge, but then it made you play with a minimum like 85 card deck. So oh. then, then it diluted your deck, so trying to build, like, cons it, consistency. Well, it depends, because you could draw through, and yeah. you just had to put good cards in. But it ended up being broken. They had to, like, nerf it, because it ended up being OP. Just card draw is OP. Matthew, we are still on box one. We have to re-attempt box one. Yeah, yeah. We lose, we try again. If All we right. lose again, I don't know. Does our campaign end? Do we have to play it again next episode? Do we just keep playing box one forever on the channel every single weekend? I don't know. We'll have to talk about that. We'll see what yeah, happens. Yeah, let's see what happens here. Do you want to go first or second? Uh, uh, I go I don't know. first. I'll go first because sure. I have the four spells again. All right. Oh, we got some shake shake up here. 
Norbert is a creature. Active hero loses one health plus one additional for each detention in hand. We have oh, to he's a money be guy. with money. Okay. So he's gonna be around for at least six turns. Okay. At least. Okay. Oh, serenity now. Scoopity scoop scoop scoop. Serenity now. <laughs> Scoopity scoop. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Scoop, I mean, it is scoop, doable. Scoop. Really? You want me to redo these? I don't know. It is. I think it's doable. No. We could buy time with location removal, but we don't have many attack cards. But there is some draw, but it really depends what comes out and replaces a couple of these cards. But we don't have the classic cheap, give you money, draw cards, or attack and draw card cheap cards that like just start the flow of the game. None of that's here. I but, mean, we can possibly cycle nope. right away. Yeah, that's true. And see before we. There go. are a couple decent cards like this draw two, discard one can help you filter and dig. Yeah. And it's an ally for my deck, but. Dobby's good too. Yeah, Dobby is helpful. He'll buy us time. So I wouldn't wipe right away. I would definitely buy a couple of these. Yeah, we'll yeah. see what comes off. But it, we need to know when to pull the trigger of wiping the market if we're just not, like, if they're speeding up faster than us yeah. and we're getting stunned every other turn, like, we something needs to change, right? Yep. Okay, well, let's try for now and see what happens. All right. I will gain an attack. Dustin says, I would absolutely redraw villains or worse than last game. No. This is how the game's designed. Like, th it sucks that you have to, like, do this to fix the game. It's just redraw until you have a favorable setup. Oh, yeah, we haven't, That's I haven't even started. That's kind of sad, right? Sorry, I haven't even started. Let me go back here. <laughs> oh, they're in the description. Sorry, that's why. Okay. Let's actually start for real. All heroes lose three health. Yeah, why not? One, two, three. That's you as well, sorry. Three health? Three health. Uh, this does nothing right now. This is nothing right now. Active hero chooses to lose two health or put detention. I'll lose two health. And then active hero loses one. Holy. Plus one for each attention. Okay, we don't have any yet. Okay, so then actually maybe this will go to heal. I can draw. So one, two, three. I only technically need two. Four would be good. Let's do... Also, we only have one card that rolls dice, and we know on the second card we're going to get trapped again yeah. if we don't see dice rolling mechanics show up, too. That's the other thing we need. We got caught off guard by last time, too. That is, you're right. Yeah, there's a lot you need to see in this little mode they have happening here. This expansion ex assumes you see a consistent amount of things, which you don't. And that's why they added the house rule of the one wife, but again, that might not fix it. But we'll see. Maybe it does. Okay, I'm going to discard two spells. Both of us can gain one influence and draw a card. Jacko, no, man. My shoulders are, like, hurt pain right now. I'm so tense. Like, it's, yeah, this is frustrating me. Gain an influence and a card. Influence and a card. All right. That worked out good last time. Okay, this gives me two. And this gives me one. Okay, I am going to put one here. So I have three remaining. Spells could go on top of my deck, but you say that's not good, right? But it is attack. You do whatever. It doesn't help us with this. I have to buy Chocolate Frog for that. Yeah, the problem is, like, you barely have three attack on a turn even, right? So this is saying, like, you have to have three attack to do one, one, and one to remove from there. So, like, literally you're buying just a one attack card for three. I, I don't know. That might be good. But this guy also does one attack. But he's not that great either. If you defeat a villain, now we have creatures, so he automatically sucks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just like that. we don't okay, have a I'm single gonna... villain. So this this card is literally trash. I'm in still this just gonna now. work towards this. So I'm just gonna spend two to buy the chocolate frog, and then the one is gone. Yeah, this whole this whole replacing villains with creatures thing and diluting makes so many cards in this deck like not as good because they don't affect creatures, only villains. Like even one of my starter cards is like not as good anymore. Yeah, and this is better when we have less. Villains that get closer to the end, it does get better, which is true, because you're it's just on Ultra V. Is yelling at me. I'm not just on villains, not creatures, Rob. What? Sorry, what is? Oh, this is even worse. Oh yeah, because you can't do it right now. This part, yeah. Sorry, this is I'm talking about right now about villains. Any card that says villain on it now sucks even worse. But this already sucks originally. But it's only to villain, so right now we would only have to do oh none. So all like if you only have one villain out, you only yeah. put one attack out. But it still sucks. Like this still sucks. I I still right now it doesn't even work. Right now it doesn't work. But I think I'm I am gonna buy it because I want to see if I can make it work. Right now it doesn't even work. 
And in the original game with only just villains, it still sucks. Even worse. Well, it's worse in that game. And it sucks in Meld deck, who barely even gets that much attack generated to even make it fire off. It would make more sense in my deck, maybe, but no, the card sucks. Oh, here you go. You get two oh, of them. Oh, that's what I want. You get two of them. You can combo it together and make them almost okay. <laughs> Ultra Violet, it sucks. I don't know if that it sucks. I'm interested in it, so I can see what you're, where you're coming from. You correcting me made it worse, not made it better. Nice try, though. <laughs> Depends on what comes out next. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> One villain. Okay, great. All right, your turn. <laughs> yeah, James says the game splits enemies into two categories. It really breaks engines. Yeah. Yeah, it definitely can. <laughs> All right, I'm drawing. Yeah. Uh, you take two damage. I got to draw another card. Uh, I take a damage. You take a damage. Or I take two. You take one. Mm-hmm. All right, what do we got here? Do even even cards card? in hand. Nope. Lose two health or put a detention in hand. I mean, discard. And then lose one and, and one additional free detention. Crazy amount of health loss right now. Yeah. Yeah, this guy is terrible, but I didn't have any attack, so I'm just putting one here every time I go and get rid of this guy slowly. Heal two. Gain of money. For each alley, play his turn, gain an attack. And then I gain four more monies. Six monies. One attack. Oh! It'll be only five monies. It's fine. If you can get a bigger card going, that's going to do more. No, but that's like kind of the trap. This guy leaving him around forever will eventually be haunting us. I don't know. I kind of the worst. Gain in money, draw a card, and roll the blue die. I know. The blue, die... blue die is the card draw one. Oh, I know. I want then... him. I do, but... Go ahead. I mean... But while this guy's more... here, I feel like we also don't want him. Like Dobby's there. I could just buy Dobby. Start the removal process, which we know I'm going to get stunned. You're going to get stunned. Yeah, it'll, it'll help get ahead of that. Yeah. And it works with your ally thing, too. It's up to you completely, but if you want to take one turn. But then also getting a die rolling card in before we flip to the next thing is, is kind of huge. Yeah, but Especially if maybe I grab on a future turn. I don't know. Um, I might be able to give you. Yeah, I'm going to do this and just take mm -hmm. Dobby. Okay. Play it safer. think safer but who knows later i'll be upset uh anyone here who gains three health draw a card this is a oh i don't think that's I don't, it's, no it's game six like but we just probably we never saw that it. one okay that's interesting okay i like that it's interesting okay uh all right before you're shuffling i'll do yeah, that go ahead. unless it affects you for each card with a value of four or more in hand, active hero loses one health. I don't think. Nope. Okay. Uh, I don't have any even cards. Active hero chooses. It'll stun me. Is that fine? Those cards will be gone. One, two, three. Two will go there. My camp's three and get that. Fine, that's fine. So I'll lose two health. Then here I will lose one and I'm stunned. Oh, stunned. I don't have any tokens. I'll discard two cards. Out of control. Out of control. And that's that. Okay, so let's do. Oh, I had four less healthy in a turn, right? That's the thing again? Oh, yeah. Shoot. I didn't have that. Uh, I think I put the top one on. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, yeah, I think that's, yeah, yeah. I only should only draw four cards, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I forgot that was back. One. Encounters. Uh, no, let's do this one. That's one. Then I'll do this. How much money? Can you only have three? Mm -hmm. No, I need to do two. Yeah, do whatever. Whatever I makes need sense. But one here. Three for this. And spells go on top of my deck. That'll go there. Even if it doesn't work for that, it works for other things. So 
Okay, and then one, two, three, four, Dustin, five. Dustin says a comment I was going to say earlier, but I felt like I was rambling too much on negatives about the game being critical, uh, and that upsets a lot of people when they hear their favorite game is not the best game. Um, the staged villain deck. I think we said that. I oh, think I said that. Yeah. One of our first streams ever playing this game. Like Mel even said, it, she was surprised there wasn't like a increasing difficulty on villains as you go. It just kept adding them and shuffling them. Yeah, it was in like my our final thoughts. I thought that was strange. Yeah. That just kind of random. So in the beginning, you could get stuck with enemies that you can't really control or do anything about right now. Like let's say this guy's gonna take us a while. Um, mm -hmm. We don't have like a build up where we did in, as we played through the boxes at but first. That, but then playing Devil's Advocate on that is if it was staggered where like certain villains show up in the first half, the second half, the third half, then it would get kind of predictable. But also the randomness of the market, you might still not have answers for some of those earlier villains right. that you need. So it could still make the early ones hard, right? Yep. Yeah, Dustin says, imagine getting two Dementors. I don't think you can get two Dementors. You can't, I don't think you can, no, but you could get like yeah. a Death Eater who is tough. Well, no, no, that's not really that bad. Yeah, you can't get two Dementors unless you house rule it that you get to put both Dementors in the deck, but one's supposed to replace the other. But you could get a... But I know what you mean. I know you, what you could mean. get like these three. Yeah, yeah. And then these two, sorry, and then the Dementor. All right, so the next card is Essence of Dittany. Okay. Okay, draw. Add a control to the location. Uh, even cost. No. Two health. Sure. One. Buh. Here's me banish a card from their hand or discard. Okay, that's going to happen soon. So I gain an attack. And then I gain three influence. Good. You draw four. <laughs> I'm just gonna shuffle again and draw yeah, yeah, again. That's fair. I don't know what I drew first, what I drew last, whatever. <laughs> Screw PD PD pepperoni over here. Stupid that encounter. Chad's laughing. <laughs> uh, for each card with a value of four or more in hand, active hero loses one. I think I don't have. I just have three and Serenity a two. Serenity now. Serenity okay. now. Uh, for each even card, I have one. Uh, lose two health. I'm going to lose two health. And I'm going to lose one health. Holy smokes. Okay. Uh, let's do, it's still going to be Sunday. Any one hero gains one influence and one, no, let's do, no, 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 let's do this first. Let's do discard two, gain an influence both in a card. Okay. Uh, let's gain an attack. Gain two influence. Right, three. I'm going to go there. You're going to be stunned even if I give you a health, right? Because this is going to make you lose two. That makes sense. Well, I or... can choose not, but this one does hit me for one. Uh, this one I do have an even card in hand, so it hits me for oh, a so two. Oh, you're stunned anyways. Okay, yeah. okay. So then I'll Plus take this card draw, yeah. for one influence and a health. So then I can put one here. I have... I need to get some even cards, so let's spend two on this. I don't have four, so two. One and I mean, that's fine. We would have four if you don't put this on here. I know, but we need to get rid of that guy. It also lets us banish a card, so we can banish a card before I we know, can get one. I know, I know, I know. It, it'd be very good for our engine, for yeah. sure. Yeah. And attack is going to go here. Not a villain, so that's good. Okay. One. Oh. Oh. I like that one. Okay. So at least we can hang on with some of Maybe. those cards. Yeah. Yeah, see how different it is? All here is the health. Add a control to the location. I'm stunned. One, Get rid of this card. 
add another control if you could for me, please, because I just got stunned. Yeah. Uh, I'll just get rid of two cards. Okay. Um, even cards in hand. Uh, it doesn't matter. Oh, nice. Just take a detention. Good. And then this doesn't matter. Okay. So remove a control from the location. I'm going to draw a card. Uh, gain three influence. And then for each ally I play this turn, I gain an attack. Uh, yep, I'll put that on there. Uh, and I'll throw away the rest of my money. I don't care. Um, then this guy's gone. All heroes may banish a card from their hand or discard I pile. I had a discard pile. So I'll banish this one. I guess we're just going to get rid of that. I don't know that I want to, but I think it's efficient. Good? Yeah. Oh man. It's annoying. Oh, yep, 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 yep. Active hero loses three health. And then I have to reveal another one. One, two, three. I'm at two. Uh, active hero puts detention in their hand. Then all players lose one health for each detention in hand. No detention. I lose for one. Me. Then here, nothing. Here. I'm just going to go stunned anyways, that's fine. I got... But the control is, that's how we lose, is by going to the two Dark Arts cards. Like, why would you do that? Just take the detention. Unless you're going to get stunned anyway. But, uh, no, I guess Yeah, not. I would okay. definitely... Because we're two away, right? Unless you have removal right now to give us a breather. Not right. Yeah, mine just went in through my deck, so I might not see it for a few turns. So, if we can fight off not drawing two Dark Arts cards, that could, while we buy some time to defeat a few villains... We have a chance, but that's our only chance. Like, all right, let's. We didn't value the tie enough. We get stunned way too often. Yeah. But it's because we're choosing the health. But maybe just a, a couple detentions is fine because these allow us to remove them. So taking one and then removing it is like you're evening out anyway. Yeah. Okay. I, I will discard two spells. We both gain an influence and draw a card. Influence and draw a card. Okay. Uh, let's. Not Dobby. Not Dobby. I will gain an influence but again, and a if health. You can get this going, put a spell in there somehow, do something with that. I don't know. I gain one. Maybe. Oh, we do have a villain, so if you play that one card that does I know, this, I drew hoping Ultra for Violetta it. will get to cheer that you're like getting the effect going off and saying, see? <laughs> see how the situational card is good? I am and I'll say, to... eh, it's situational. Hmm. <laughs> is it just me, or did they both just sadly Thank glance you. over the camera simultaneously? I started hearing. In the arms of an angel music in my head. <laughs> Gain two health. Michael, you're That funny. does nothing. <laughs> Let's spend three. Spells work well for my deck, so put that in there. Thank you, everyone in the chat, for keeping it, it, it you know, it fun, uh, even with I'm the trying. frustration. No, I appreciate it. If they weren't here, though, like, I'd be like, flip the table already. Yeah, you would already stop playing this with me. Yeah, this game would have been thrown <laughs> in the garbage. I would never put my daughter through this. I'd be like, no, let's just keep the base game, throw the expansion in the garbage, move on. Ultra Violetta, I get it. I think it's a good card. I'm, I agree with you. <laughs> fun doesn't mean good. Doug's the, here. The bonus is fun. If it triggers, it triggers. If it doesn't, it doesn't. The definition of situ situational, yeah, but, inefficient cards. Okay, so then what's the difference? Then I... Okay, let's not rants and go on. I, I said my part will degree to disagree thing, but hey, Doug, it says, hey, gang, lots going on here. It seems like an interesting game. Mm -hmm. Definitely interesting. Mm -hmm. Buy the base game, play that first, and then research the expansion before buying any expansions. We were warned about this one, but we still did it, so I can't complain too much. All right. Quidditch gear. Oh, Mark, two cost cards or four cost cards. I have all odd cost cards. <laughs> no problem, Ultra Violetta, no problem. Just, uh, <laughs> sorry, I just noticed my eyebrows needed some fixing. <laughs> uh, okay. Better. My turn? Yep. All active here loses two health. Woo! All right. Even? Oh, shoot. Even cards? I uh, no. shouldn't have as many cards as I do. Okay, uh, I'll lose two. I'm just going to shuffle Yeah, I'll lose two. And then put one back. Each time. No, okay. Uh, now my turn. Let me think for a minute. Uh, 
I get two attack. Uh, yeah, that's sucky. What can I buy here? Is, is buying... One, two, three, four, five, six, no, five, only five. Is there a five that's worth it? Do you like this one for card filtering? Mm-hmm. There's no money, guys. Okay. All right. So I'll just play this. To gain an attack. I'll gain an attack. Four influence. So I have five total. I will spend four. Hmm. Could be an answer to what's going on here too. I know. I think that's the other thing is the lack of card draw. Like I don't have enough card draw. No, this will fuel buying bigger cards if we have good attack cards show up. This could get me into them faster and afford them faster. I think that's what I need right now. And then I'll throw away that money. Don't care. Put that here. Hope he doesn't heal too much before we get there, but you can probably get Remove stunned. location. Could you have done that? The control? Remove control. I don't know. Yeah, I could have done that. Could do that instead of buying her. Oh, it's up to you. We don't have to. I have one that will remove one. Yeah, like I'm going to get Dobby soon, but if you're going to get stunned and then on a card here puts one on, we're in trouble. Well, I have one in my hand that can remove one. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Then that's fine. I won't worry about it then. Yeah, no. Okay. Two, four, uh, one. So they're there. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Marauder's map, draw two cards. If you discard this, all heroes draw a card. Oh, I like this too. Okay, yeah. you kind of draw in multiple draws even better. Yeah, yeah. Uh, active hero loses one health and add a control to the location. Yeah. Instantly regretting my decision. Control, this <laughs> goes away. Okay. Yeah, you got that? I got that. Okay. okay, then this one, I don't have any evens. This one says lose two. And that's done. Okay. Let's do this. We'll gain an attack. We'll put it here. <laughs> if you assign at least one attack to each villain, also remove a control from the location. <laughs> <laughs> I feel the wind coming. <laughs> <laughs> I'll discard two spells. We both gain an influence and a draw card. We oh. gain influence and draw card. Okay, I got a shuffle. Uh, I can put that on top of my deck. <laughs> gain one. I can put spell on the top of my deck. Uh, worst case for me, it's a three attack. I think that's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Let's not talk about. It. Let's all just, heroes let's gain. Let's just watch it win the game for us. All heroes gain uh, influence. <laughs> It's like Ultra Vila was watching the Super Bowl. Like every every time I thought something good, like yes, it's like a team scored, like jumping out, popcorn flying all over the living room, and I'm here like, <laughs> it's awesome. Uh, you gain influence. I did right here, right? Another, right, another one. one? Yep. Oh, okay. It doesn't heal because there's no villain to heal. Oh, oh, oh it's villain! Lord. It's villain! Oh my gosh. Are you saying we have to reread the cards and relearn what we they have to do? Mentally, just assume. So I probably did that wrong in the last game. Andrea, are you telling us to RTFC? Yeah. Because thank you, you should. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. How wrong did we play that last game? I probably did because I didn't even in my head. It was just you. Definitely, yeah. I think used him to heal off the Basilisk, which is oh, but he's, he's a villain he's a creature. Bull. Yeah, he's a villain creature. Oh, maybe I didn't play it wrong, but yeah, that's who funny. was in the middle last game when he was out? They kept getting healed. I don't think, I can't remember who it was. Cornelius or whatever the guy's name is. I was putting damage on Bath and then I started putting damage on him. So I don't think we played it wrong last okay, game. Okay, we may not have. Okay, good, good. good. Yeah. Okay. Uh, then I'm going to spend three. I'm going to purchase this card, which is a spell, and it's going to go on the top of my deck. Okay. Uh, one, two, three. Go ahead. Well, Z yeah, Zalt would have got us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay. 
Chocolate frog. Oh, okay, I guess a chocolate frog is another two. Yeah. Oh, I see all these items. I'm like, man, why do I have this card? Oh, I want to be cycling, digging, and all that. Oh, it's such a different game. I could have been, oh, I'm only drawing four. I, I could have been digging Dobby out of my deck over and over again. Three, three, oh, four. that hurts. Four cards. Yep. Have I used this yet? Wouldn't we be mad no. if I switch it? I wouldn't be mad, but... Because, like, man... Do it. It's just... fine. Whatever. Whatever make you have fun. They want to watch you have fun and play. I don't know. Is anyone mad if he changes it? Like, like the cards that have come up now, It's I'm not buying all the six-cost allies. I'm getting, like, good five or less cost cards that I would love to dig and, like... I could dig this out, draw cards. I bought that one girl. Yeah, like, you didn't use it. It's like, fine. Like this girl. I bought I bought this girl who's perfect for this, right? Yeah. Like, oh my God. Michael R would be furious, but okay. everyone else says it's fine. Then I can't. <laughs> then I can't. I can't do it. If Michael R would be furious, I know Michael nope. R is always then says serious. Just joking. No, no. Michael R is always the most serious person in the chat. Definitely never jokes around. Yeah. But no, definitely never you're definitely around. getting all switch. They want you to have fun. So if that card but will this, make you have this fun. Could, I, this could be the losing decision, though. No, I got those spells in my deck. Don't worry. Yeah, that's the thing. <laughs> we we put this in here. I put this in there because the like, being pissed off, we didn't see any control here. And we kept getting stunned. Yeah. Now we see control. This is what I'm saying. The market gener like can determine whether you have a better chance or not. Just by the cards that show up. Yeah, I'm going to my classic engine. I have to. Oh, what? Michael Lars says I'll give you five dollars to switch. No, no, I am switching. <laughs> I am switching. I have to. I need that. I'm looking at all these things. I'm like, man, I'm probably even gonna forget that that's a thing because I I play with this for so long. Yeah, yeah. Emperor <laughs> Palpatine voice, do it. Jackal says finger covering on unsubscribe button. <laughs> no, <laughs> must switch. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't used it yet. It's fine. Yeah, yeah. Okay, go ahead. All right, it's your turn. My turn. Yeah. And you have villain. you do this first, but you have villains that you can defeat or creatures and next hero loses two health. Add a control oh. to the location. Okay, I'm stunned. Oh, uh, I changed my mind. Can I switch oh, it back? Oh. I'm just joking. Okay, so we're gonna add a control. <laughs> then I'm stunned, so we're gonna add another one. I don't have oh, any tokens. Oh man. Two cards is going to be Okay. I These have two. I have an even card. So I have to lose two health. This guy says Oh, we have Dobby. I know, but it's like going to still keep us on the edge. It's okay. I have one too, though. So if you can remove one and I can remove one, we have to just. But we have to do it faster than this. Yeah. Is adding them and stunning us. Right. Right. I get but it. But that's not fast enough, is what I'm saying. Well, hopefully now that we have multiple in our in our deck. But every time you buy a new card, it makes it less. I put one on the top. But I'm going to use this to dig. Oh, Michael R. Thank you so much. <laughs> Michael R. Also trolls with only $4.99 instead of the $5. That was prompt. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so thank you for the super chat. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Oh, my God. This is falling apart. All right. Uh, so did I do all this stuff? He... Did we do this? Oh, it just heals just from himself, him. right? Okay, that's fine. Yeah. <sighs> this guy I'm still debating on. I think I if just you take can a kill detention. Him. No, I'm taking oh. a detention. I have to. I can't lose health. I can't. We can't keep getting oh, stunned so much. One health and maybe an card. Yeah, if you have one attack and can kill him. Uh, maybe I'll draw into one, but I oh, don't okay. have one. That's the sad part. We haven't seen many attack cards here, and the ones that are there are really sucky. All right. Uh, remove from the location. I'm gonna draw a card. Not an attack. Ooh. Okay. Fine. Oh, but I have this for each ally I played. Oh. Yeah, I forgot about that part. So I'm gonna play this for each ally I played. I'm gonna gain That'll attack. Give a heal. Oh, I won't be able to heal, but it can banish a card. I'm gonna put this here. Let's kill this guy right now. All yeah. heroes gain a health. I cannot. And I'm just gonna banish this. Just banish that. Thank you. I'm losing my spells. Whatever. Actually, can I put those in your bin? But you have other spells that you'll draw into more often now that you bought later. Yeah. I'm just gonna do this so I remember to put yeah, yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, of course. And then I have five moolah. So I'm actually have eight money. Dear Harry Potter Gandalf, where are you? I would like to purchase your services. But I know you're buried in that giant mountain of a deck, and I will probably not see you in a hundred games of play because of the size of the deck. We still can do a wipe, but not when you have eight money. I know, I know. We need to look for more die too. Oh, is it only items? 
Oh, it is only items. Thank you, thank you. What? The troll is only banish an item from your deck. Or discard oh, from your hand. Oh, he's or discard even from. worse. Yeah. But it let you get that detention out, so. Yeah, thank true. you, thank you. I didn't even read it. I just assumed. Yeah, I think I just go for the dice guy because we know that card's coming up and a die roll is a die roll. Mm -hmm. And then the other two money I'll just throw away. I mean, I could buy this just for an item to toss with this ability. Oh, yeah, which I didn't do. Oh, but you needed the attack. I know. Them. I know. I should have still tossed it, though, because I could have just grabbed a, a card. Maybe as attack. I don't even know. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to get it because it does work with the discard. Uh, because of this part on it, I think I'll do it. Basically, this card just says, Rob, discard this to do your ability. Like, even if I'm just pulling a crappy card, it's still fine. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to take this. I'm going to take it because it does work with my engine thing here. Um, so that's all my money spent. I don't have any attack. Um, draw five. Yep, yep, I'm above. And then I refill. Yeah, see, I could have grabbed her and then she would have drew and then gave me even more money, but it's fine. Oh, I want Thok. We got Akio and Old Thok. Oh, you have Dobby, though. Mm. Another? Yeah, but only when I have it in I know. hand. But... If you discard it, though, you gain two. I will always, like... Oh, this is good as well for you. Yeah, it's true, actually. Then you can discard it for your ability, gain two, draw. Yeah. What was it? The Although I missed that, sorry. I was uh, gain two, that. choose one. Gain two money or search your discard pile for an item and put it oh, in your I've hand. Oh, I've played with this before. Okay. Oh, let's look at this first. Oh, this guy, active hero, loses one health. Okay, he's not the worst, but... Yeah, I want, I want the map 2 for my engine. That's the one I was debating buying instead of buying that uh, ally uh, with the money there, but... All heroes lose one health and cannot draw. Okay. Oh, now my thing is broken. Any one hero gain two, which is you. Gain two what? Health, right. Health? Uh, gain an attack. Who are we attacking next? Oh, sorry. Oh, I didn't even... Uh, sorry, I need to do this. And then I need to lose two. And that's it. Sorry, I just got excited. Um, who are we attacking next? This guy probably, yeah, right? Yeah, yes, absolutely. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I get all five cards this time. Okay. Go ahead. Uh, all heroes reveal the top card of their deck. Heroes that reveal a spell, discard it, and lose two health. Nope. Okay, shuffle. Attention. An ally. Hero loses a health. Even cards. One. One. We haven't been paying attention if we even got I that. haven't yet. I'm trying to get them to line up together, but they're not. Okay. Oh, I can do it with my thing, probably. Um, then we get to the dice. So I lose two. Yeah, I know. And what was the bad thing? Shuffling on that? these every time you shuffle your deck. Yeah, maybe we wait then. I don't know. Because we only have one dice roll. Card. Yeah, maybe that's the thing. Rushing through that, we did. Yeah, because I'd rather draw one less card here and there. Hmm. Okay. Until we can build up some dice but, roll cards. But I think it's going to happen here. Okay, all right. Okay, I'm gonna play this even cost card. Draw two cards, one, two, then discard any one card. I'll discard this spell, which will gain me two money. Play this ally, gain one influence, draw a card, then roll the blue die. Card draw. Okay. 
I'll toss this item to draw for this. Yeah, I think I'm going to get rid of it. It's fine. You already did. With the foreign oh, place. I did. Yeah, yeah it's fine. I did. I didn't see that he was even. It's fine. I'll take Dobby. I'll play Dobby. Uh, remove a control from the location. Draw a card. I'll play this guy. One attack. No, I'm going to heal two health. I don't want to get stuns. Mm -hmm. Okay. Then I'll play this to gain an influence. And then for each ally I played, four of them, I gain an attack. And then I'll play four more influence. Eight influence, four attack. I assigned three or more attack. All heroes heal one. I'm going for this. Uh, for five. The map. And then with three more, could do the sock, but I don't think so. I could get another ally for attack. He's so crappy. No, I don't like him. He doesn't help my engine. Yeah, we gotta play smart this time. This is serious Harry Potter. This isn't your kids. This isn't grandma's Harry Potter. This is, this is the hardcore Harry Potter. All right, uh, I'll get done. Okay, so this is... I mean, or there's this. Uh, no, it's bad too. That you get. Okay, uh, so each time I play a card with an even value, uh, any, any even influence value, any one hero heals a health. Okay, oh, well, that's good to get started, I guess. Yeah. All right, I'm going to draw. I only draw three cards, but I need to do more. Uh, that... I don't think is active yet because you're supposed to. I thought, oh, I guess it depends on when the end of your turn sequence happens, like how. When was the step on checking this? Is it just like generically end of turn? End your turn. Uh... Oh, it triggers next turn. Okay, you're good. You're good. But not right now. When do you check it? Well, you take it at the end of your turn. I just don't know if you should have uh, drawn up first I before it's revealed, but they're saying it triggers next turn, so you're good. Okay, okay. Okay. Let's reveal from this deck. Oh, I like this. Yeah, a see, that's a decent card. That gives two attack. Okay. That's a decent card. Always to attack. It's not situational. Active hero puts detention. I keep getting these stupid. This one is so annoying. The Three Stooges card? Yeah. Even though there's four of them? Uh, and then all heroes take one health or lose one health for each detention in hand. So I don't know how many you have. I, I have two. Attention. I spent enough time in detention in my life. I don't need to go anymore. Uh, active hero loses one. Uh, for each card of even value, one, <laughs> one, I lose two. And then we didn't add control, so we're good. Okay. What are we doing here? What are we doing here? Those I'm just going to put to the side because they don't do anything. Uh, remove a control from the location. What are you at? What's he at there? Two more to get rid of him. Okay, so then we're going to do... I can't. Never mind, I cannot. Let's do this for myself for one influence and one health. Gain an influence. Gain an influence. I may put spells on the top of my deck. I won't even be able to afford. Uh, <laughs> I gotta gain two health. And three. Not enough for anything. I could just get a stock, I guess. 
Or I go for Quidditch gear for the attack. Yeah, I mean, and the yeah. healing, which keeps us away from stuns. Yeah, as we're just not take the worst. This. this can't go on the top of my deck. It's not a spell. Okay, done. Owls gain two money. If you play two or more spells, also gain an attack and a health. I need to get more spells because. Vanish. Active hero loses a health and discards a card. Vanish too. Hurting my engine here. And discards a card. Active hero loses a health. Even card in hand, I have one. Loses two. Yeah, that guy's next, I think. Okay. I'm going to do my ability. I'm going to toss the chocolate frog. If you discard it, gain a money and a health. And I'm going to search. Search, it, search, search. I will play the play play. Uh, I played an even card. So any one hero heals on, I'll do me. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Uh, draw two cards. And then I'll discard a spell to gain two influence. Gain an influence. Draw a card. And roll the blue die. Draw on a card for both of us. Draw two cards. Okay. Uh, this guy is going to generate me an attack. This is going to generate me an influence. And then for each ally I played, one, two, three, will generate me an attack. And then four influence. Rob has the build for that final card. Yeah, come at me, bro. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, do we want to not take the card? Oh, I forgot that was there. But I don't know what you drew, so oh. it's fine. It's fine. But next time we have to remember. Does anyone that. know what I drew? I totally forgot. Like if about you drew this. money. Yeah, I totally forgot. I, 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 I didn't yeah. even look at, my, or I didn't. I don't know what I drew. Uh, if anyone can quickly or remembers, I I'm going to go back to on my side uh, and check. Maybe I'll see it. Because if you don't. I did it fast though, but. Like I drew so many in a row. I just have to see what card it was. Oh, I think you played another even card as well. Oh, yeah, I did. I definitely played some even cards. Because uh, we only heal for one. I played this one. Like, so another heal. You take a heal. Oh, here. Roll. Draw. Yeah, oh, the money. The money. Okay, the money. money. Yeah, absolutely fixable. So that wouldn't have been drawn. Right. I'll just shuffle. I. It doesn't matter, because I'll draw them all anyway. Okay. And then we're going to cover this. Yeah, because it's... Uh, uh, and then yeah. I would put this one back. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. You're corrected. Corrected. Thank you. Yeah. Because that yeah, yeah. is. Yeah. Yeah. It was just Since a money we only card. have one die roll card or die roll person. Yeah. Yeah. I right obviously now? would have done that. I just forgot that I was forgot. even out. Yeah. I'm sitting there worried about being at four health and not drawing up in my turn. That's long gone. Like I'm, I'm all, it's right here. I'm all over the place. Um, okay. So this guy will defeat him. All heroes gain an influence and we remove a control. Yep. And I think this guy is next. Oh, how many? Oh, what did I just do? I had at least one more. Yeah, I think I just had four attack. Oh, okay. So I'll sign another one there. Uh, also, I signed three or more damage on my turn. So all heroes heal one. Then... I'm uh, buying...
Let's... Oh, so we'd have one more. Thank you. Yeah, because you had four. You put two here. Oh, so, I had thank five? you. Thank you. Oh. You had four, but you put two here. Oh, it was two? I, sorry, then... I thought I put three on him. No, I thought he I put had three five. Yeah. Thank you. Ugh. It's all good. Losing my mind. Uh, yeah, I'm going to buy these two cards with the nine money. Quidditch gear. Okay. I don't know what that does. Tr 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 oh, here's one. You may banish a card in your hand. If it's an item, draw a card. Oh. Okay. How many cards do we have to draw to see our first ever one of those? There's six of these shuffled in this ginormous deck. That does change how the game works, too. If we yeah. see even one of those early, that changes all of this jazz. Yep. Yeah, I'm definitely drawing. Shuffle. Oh, yes, yes. So this goes in, yeah. Oh, no, we can't draw. Oh, son of a gun. That guy's annoying. Uh, Go here next. Active hero loses two health. One, two. Active hero loses one. For each even, none. And can't draw. Okay. Killing is two. Okay. That does nothing, so we'll just put that there. Let's do, we'll gain an attack. Two influence. <laughs> what do I need? I need spells. I need thing two. Both of us can gain one influence. So then I think I'll just take thing two or search. Yeah, I'll just spend four. I'll take this one. I need more spells. One attack. Keep going for that guy. You don't want this? I do, but I think. Okay. Oh, another Expelliarmus. One of these. My turn. Yep. Did you do this shuffle thing? Yep, I put one in. Out of control to the location. Deck is huge. Two, three, four, five. All right. Active hero loses the health. Even cards in hand. I have one, two health, and I'm not allowed to draw cards. Hmm. And toss. Oh, wait. One attack. Yeah, I'm going to toss this item to search for a card. Just remember, you can't draw. That I know. Oh, okay. I know. Oh, I'm aware. Maybe it's this one. So we're not going to get rid of that guy in time, but I'm thinking of healing, so I'm not in like a bad spot. But this could also let me heal. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> but it's not an even number, so I won't get heal off this. But yeah, I don't know. Whatever. Okay. Uh, remove a control from the location. Uh, I'm going to gain two attack. Uh, I'm going to gain an influence for each ally I played, which is just one. I'm going to gain an attack. I'm going to gain two more influence. Assign three attack. Pow, 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 pow. Boom. All heroes gain two health. 
and an influence. All right. Oh yeah, did I play an even? I did. Uh, I will heal off this one. Mm -hmm. Off of this card. And... Five money, you say. Not the six I was hoping for. Hmm. I can't. I can't buy any. You don't want the banish? This one? Oh, I forgot about this. Yeah, yeah I sure. thought that I would leave that for yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. Oh. I'll take it. I'll take it. Yeah, I forgot. I was looking at all these items. Like, I'd rather buy one of these, but I'm like, I don't want one of these. I want this. Mm -hmm. But this will take. But still not. An item draw. Yeah, it'll help get rid of the stupid these things. Yeah, that it we're helps, yeah it helps get rid of those. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Oh, and your power. You dealt more I did than it. three. Oh, okay. Thank you. Uh, yep, go ahead. Oh, yeah, let's fill this. It's George Weasley. Okay, another die, which is maybe too late, but we'll see. It is the red one, though. Uh, heroes cannot gain health. Oh, <laughs> this is a problem. <laughs> That's a problem. Okay, uh, here. All heroes lose one health for each creature. One. What? Heroes lose one health. All heroes lose one health for each creature. Just one. Okay. Okay, then active hero loses one. Can't heal, can't draw. Okay. Okay, let's see. Um... It's going to give me one influence. Can't heal. All heroes can't heal, yeah. Uh, one attack. And then one, two, three influence. One, two, three. And then uh, I played four spells. So any two heroes each gain an attack. This guy's probably worse, right? They can't heal. Can't draw. Okay. That slows down everything. Two, three, four, five. Hmm. One shy from that. That's all I want. Green one. Green two. I guess I'll spend four on this one. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. You healed for the Pixar reward and the even cards, but not for Ron's ability. Oh, so we would have I one more? I even said it out loud, like, that I was going to take that heal when I put the three attack on, I thought. That's why I purposely generated the three attack, was just to do that heal. I don't know. So we would both be one higher, right? Oh, yeah, they're saying that we're right. So maybe we just... Oh, you know what I did? I might have just healed myself only, and not both oh, of us. Oh, okay. Yeah, you just take it, I don't know. Because I was at one, right? And I just lost one. So I was here. So I healed one. Two, three, four. So I think I took Ron's ability, oh. but I didn't give it to Mel. That's fine. I think that's what happened, right? Oh, you healed yourself for the event, the even card. Twice. He, he did that twice. Was I not at one at the start of my turn? So I healed one for this. I healed one for this. And then I had a card, I think, that did. You played two even cards, didn't you? No. Oh. I drew an uh, uneven one. There's some other... Oh, I healed two off of killing this guy. So then I was at five, right? I think I did Ron's ability, but just on myself. And now I don't know where I'm at. I just lost one, so I'm at four. Okay. Yeah. So I think Zolt's half correct. Yeah, I forgot to do the, hey, Mel, heal also yourself, which I may have wrongly played before, too. That's fine. But yeah, that's I'm all good. to catch it if we can. Yep. Okay. Finite incant... Tatium, remove a uh, control from the location. If this is in your hand, only reveal one dark arts event on your turn. Oh, I want that. Well, that's good for later. Yeah, I want that. But maybe we don't get to. Yeah, we hope so not. That's third, another new, third. new expansion card that maybe shows up. Okay, and then your dark arts. All heroes lose two health and cannot gain health this turn. No, we can't gain anyways. And then she has to lose one for this guy, and then. Oh. Okay. Uh, okay. I'll discard this to look for a card of five costs or less from my deck. 
I'm allowed to heal, so that's useless. Useless. And draw, useless. Unless, hold on. Money. Attack or money. Mm -hmm. Attack. Draw. Go ahead. Let's do this one. Oh, yeah. Accio. Uh, the previous hero loses one health and discards a card. Boom, I'm stunned. Okay. So I will discard this card, and then I'll discard... Uh, well, I'm stunned first. I don't know what I resolve first. Remove the tokens. Yeah, I remove... Oh, remove tokens, yeah. Uh, discard half, half down, so one... And two. Yep, two. And then we add this. And then I have to discard a card from whatever you said. This will gain me a money. But no health. Um, yeah, okay, awesome. Okay, active hero loses one. Can't heal, can't draw. Okay, these do nothing. Uh, remove a control from the location. I gain one influence, and this does nothing. Can't do anything this turn except for remove a control. These are so annoying. Mm -hmm. My turn? Yep. Uh, active here, lose two health. Oh yeah, it would be up to full health, so now I lose two. I lose one. Can't heal, can't draw. Uh, so, gain a money. Uh, roll the blue die. Money. I played an even card. You can heal one. Oh, we can't heal. Oh, yeah, we're not allowed to heal. Great. Uh, this I can't even play. Oh, I guess I could have bought the sock, but... Oh, yeah, I couldn't even play this. It's fine. Yeah, yeah, sorry. I can't play this, so what I'll do is instead, I'll ha say I had this still in hand. I'll pitch this to dig through my deck to find a card of five or less. And this will give me a money. For four money. Nada. Do you want to wipe? So okay, bad. Okay, then let's wait, let's wait. But, like, if we can't get to six money anymore because of deck clogging, not drawing. It's just drawing. a draw, but, I mean, we're, he's already half dead, so as long as he's not healing, uh, I can do one. No, I'm not gonna, we'll see. unless they're looking for dice. Well, we have, we have two dice cards now. But, like, I don't want to lose, like, like, we need more attack. There are cards that have attack yeah. on them, okay, but, not. like, I don't know. We could draw into better cards. We could draw in another copy of this. Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, let's wipe. There's too much junk here. Too much really, ju really junky cards. See? Another copy of it. My faith okay. was right. Part of the cards! All right, Asha says, yeah, or good. Osha, uh, gain three money or gain two or remove. Yeah, she's amazing. Yeah, very good. Okay, this one, gain one money, you can put it as garbage at this point in the game. Uh, same card. No. Nope. Oh, there's the banish one. We got another banish. Mm, good, I need one got of those. Got the draw card and, and attack. We got gain two money, remove a control. We got the sword. Okay. Which is the role of the heart, which uh, if we ever could afford seven, get that going. You, I think the character that you have rolls the red die as well. So potentially we'll get that going. 
Okay, so I'm discarding. I know I must draw because of this torture. Mm -hmm. Put another I'll just bad do this card. while you're shuffling. Hopefully it doesn't make you... Active hero loses one health. Reveal an additional. Oh no, I'm going to be stunned now on my turn. Great. Great. Uh, the next hero loses two health and out of control. To Done. Lost two health. Okay. Then here I lose this. So I am stunned. Discard that. One, two, and then add a control to location. Okay, can't draw, can't deal. All right. I can search for an item. What items do I even have? Anything good? No, probably not. Something with attack. We need to get rid of this guy. Yeah, we don't have items with attack. I'm just giving you money because I can't play two spells because I got, yeah, nope. Okay. So then I'll just gain an attack. I'll gain two influence and one influence. Three. I'll just buy the bandage. bandage uh, maybe. Oh, Cho Chang with the bat mm -hmm. on the board. She is sad, sad, sad. Makes the deck sing. All right, my turn. Mm -hmm. All heroes lose oh, the health. Sorry, and I cannot draw extra cards. Active hero loses the health. Can't heal. Can't draw cards. Fun, 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 fun. Uh, ability. Discard this, which would gain me a health, but would just gain me a money. And I'm going to look for a card. Three more for him. Oh, hold on. Hold, hold up. No, I guess it doesn't matter. But I would be able to draw eventually because I have three attack here, right? Yeah. So I can grab something knowing I should be able to draw. Yeah. And yeah. this will let you draw as well. Yeah, once we get rid of him, then move to here, things may be. Okay. Oh, does the event keep us from drawing? Yes. Oh, I forgot about that. Thank you, Michael. Ah, so I don't know forgot. Ah, forgot. Forgot. Yeah. The, event. the double. The Basilisk will die. The but double no the draw. Event. But I don't want to kill him because then he doesn't draw me cards. Okay, so then just throw some on here and then no, I should leave kill him, him still. Away. I should still kill him. Or leave him one way because I he can still kill removes him. the control. Uh, if you if you leave him one away, then I can kill him. Uh, yeah, true. Unless he heals off of the card you draw. So well, I can do like two remove. attack. Okay. It's the worst case. But doesn't it like remove two from each? Isn't that what one of those cards says? A few copies of it in there that we haven't seen yet this game. I don't know. Oh wow! 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 Can't heal. This is take horrible. Dobby to remove the control. Yeah, I was thinking that. Was good. Yeah. Can't draw, but he does something. He does something. Mm -hmm. Unless I can get to six money some sneaky way, which I was just trying to do. I don't think so though. No, hold on. Let me look what's in hand. Probably not enough. No. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Petrification killing me. Dobby. Dobby will just remove a control. Uh, he isn't even cards, but we can't heal. Nope. It's already now. On uh, heart. Gain an attack. Another hero has a Weasley in hand. All heroes can't heal. Who cares? Oh, not Weasley. No fun. We're not allowed to have fun. Ah, uh, no, Garbage. not the result we were looking for. Garbage. Uh, gain two attack. Gain two money. I think I just gotta do it though. Because I don't want to put some on him and then it clears some and clears some. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So remove a control from location. Basilisk gone. Okay, so at least we can draw going forward. Well, depends what that depends says, what but that yeah. Okay. 
Uh, can't heal. Yeah, this is rough. I know. I can't heal is rough. We got to kill yep. that guy now. Okay. Oh, did I play another even card? Yeah, I did. But we can't heal. Oh, yeah, never mind. Derp. 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 Yeah, it shuts off so many things. Do you have enough for o Osha? No. Oh. I have only four. Oh. But Cho Chang says, that's okay. I'll back you up. Remember, we have a bond. We've, we've been places together. Yeah. We've experienced things. All right. Repair all. Better now, but. Oh, Fluffy. Uh, for each item in hand, active hero chooses one. Lose one health or discard a card. Oh, man, items. Oh, man, items. God, okay. Go here first. This one you're talking about? <laughs> uh, I saw the future. You did, you did. I, I felt we hadn't seen it in so long. I'm like, it's coming. It has to be. Jason. Jason, thank you for subscribing. Welcome. Thank you so much. Uh, active hero loses one. Can't mm -hmm. heal. Uh, for each item in hand, I think I have three. One, two, three. Yeah, lose a health or discard three a Three health. One, two, three. Wow. There's nothing you want to discard there? You literally oh, need yeah. all the money? No, one is the... Oh, but you'll lose two health. Oh. You know what I mean? Yeah, we're just gonna... <laughs> yeah. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, okay, we can do... So who's worse now, the can't heal or the item guy? Can't Probably heal can't guy. heal, right? Can't heal guy. Okay, one attack. One attack and can't heal. That does nothing. One of sixteen. One. Uh, all heroes gain one influence. Uh, three. I'll just choose for the draw the card. That's it. Mm -hmm. Now let's take one of these. Luna Lovegood, which we is. do not remove from our deck because we're not playing with her as a character. But if you do, you've got to remove her from the deck. All right. Drawing. Mm -hmm. You did this whole thing. I did. And of glory. Active hero loses a health. Add a control to the location. Active hero loses a health, can't gain health, and for each item in hand, unfortunately I'm stuck because if I discard these to not lose health, I would lose health anyway. So whatever. Um, wasn't I know, but I wasn't so worried about the control there. I think we really need to get rid of this guy. We kind of have this under control. Stunned. Discard but I did think about cards. it. Add a control to the location, please. Okay, and then now with things are gonna ask two me. money, I'm going to do nothing. And... Just literally do jack on my turn. Uh, unless. No, you know what I do? These are so annoying. No, 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 no. I'm going to say stun. I'm going to uh, keep one of these when I'm stunned. And I'll just discard this to search. And we can draw, right? Yep. And roll dice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, if we can roll a heart. Okay, so hold on. Let me redo what I just did there. So I had a hand like this. I was here. This guy put me in a situation where I'll just discard this. Boom. I get rid of my money, and I have to lose half the cards. And we already added there, right? Because you already stunned, yeah. Half the cards. Then I toss this. I still have this in hand. I'll search... Yep. Yolo. Okay. Um, I'm gonna play this. Draw two cards. One, two. Uh, I'll discard a card. That gets me two influence. Draw two cards. Uh, anyone here with real heals three health? We're not allowed to heal, but I'll still draw a card. 
Uh, gain an influence. You may banish a card in your hand. If it's an item card, draw a card. I'll banish this. Draw a card. Gain an attack. Gain a money. Or money. Oh, I want joy. I know. It's like, I don't know. What to Hopefully, say. I'll be able to give you money this time. It's like, Whatever. my turns have not been efficient at all. Many of these silly things, I need to get rid of them. Fog in my hand. Three. Uh, take one of these. Okay. Active hero loses three health, and then I have to reveal another one. I'm not going to be stunned. One, two, three. Reveal another one. All heroes choose one. Discard an ally or lose two health. Well, now I'm going to be in trouble. Not. One, two. So now I'm stunned. So lose, discard two cards, add a control to the location. Oh, yeah, I'll be full. Mm. Uh, I'll lose two health. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's discard two spells. We both gain an influence and draw a card. I mean, it doesn't matter. So all heroes gain one influence. Gain an attack. And two influence. I'm not doing anything with. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. And then I go back. Uh, active hero choose another hero to lose two health. Reveal additional dark arts. Uh, lose two health. I'll reveal additional two. dark arts. Lose two health. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> active hero loses three. One, two, three. And it did not stun me and reveal additional dark arts. Uh, all heroes lose a health. Add a control to the location. Oh no. Yep. That's disgusting. Very disgusting. Mm. All right. Uh, continue on with all the horrible effects. Mm -hmm. I lose a health. Can't heal. Uh, for each item card, I have one. I could lose a card. Or I'll lose this card. Okay. Uh, Draw two cards, then discard any one card. I'll discard this card, it's a spell, so I gain two influence. Um, gain an influence, draw a card. Roll the blue die. Yes. Yeah. Do you want to do this? Because we can't obviously. heal anyways. Okay. Duh. Okay. Like, obviously why I just cheered when I rolled that. So why would you even give me the option? Just do it. No, not oh, till later, okay. right? Yeah, so we'll just put it like yeah, that. Yeah. So we know it's done. Or you just love the tokens. It's okay. All right. Uh, so I still can't heal. Doesn't, order doesn't matter. Unless we kill this guy, then you can heal. Or... I could actually... No, I don't know. It's fine. It's a little out of order. It's definitely messy what I'm doing, but it's fine. Okay. So then I'll just play this to gain two attack. Uh, this, I'll draw two cards. No, I don't want to play that yet. Uh... Smarter. What's better to not heal? I could, I could have been healing. I could be healing like crazy, but it's fine. Do. Oh, we'll heal three off this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Never mind. I'm gonna keep playing the way I'm playing it. Uh, draw three cards. One, two. Three and discard any two. Guard one. 
or a two. Remove a control from the location, draw a card. Uh, gain an attack. Do you have a Weasley in hand? No. We can't heal anyway, so I don't even know why I'm asking. Oh. I shouldn't even ask. Money. Uh, gain a money. For each ally played this turn. One, two, three, four, five. Gain that much attack. Gain of money. Oh, you forgot to roll a blue die for Cho. Oh, yes, I did. I always do that. I always do that. Hard Card. draw. Okay, so I would have had an extra ally that I would have played first. Mm-hmm. He will gain me on an extra attack and then would have gained another attack off that other card. Mm -hmm. So, hold on. The eight for that guy. Do I? Yeah, I do. On the spare. Oh, but then I wouldn't heal. Yeah, so okay. So, four here. Defeating okay. him. All heroes heal three. One, two, three. And then remove two control. Yeah, yeah. Big time, big time. Big plays. Yeah, I shouldn't be picking those up because yep. then I mix them and then we get confused. No worries. Uh, I have five here. I'll just place here. Okay. Yeah, I'll put those for your bin. Uh, I assign three or more, whatever. Oh, I have one more here. I can defeat this guy. No, I'll still go for this guy. So uh, we all get to heal from Ron's ability, right? Yeah, all heroes heal one from Ron. Well, I'll just leave. Okay. I have not in money. Now, if I only knew the mix of cards in my deck, because that last card, I need like an even distribution or just lots of draw. Or just a turn like that. I know, I know, but then I can't dilute my draw. She doesn't let me draw. Don't care. This, I don't care. Well, once we flip this, this I will... This could draw off the die. This, don't trust. It's just this card. I only want this card. That's it. Screw the rest. Yep. That costs six. That leaves me with... Three? Yep. No, I don't want anything. Repair. All right. All right. Discard. Then you will also get this. That there for you. Once per game, you may discard this. So it has to happen on my turn. Then all heroes may banish a card in their hand or discard pile. So let me know. Yeah. Uh, okay, I'm gonna draw. Okay, our next villain reveal an additional dark arts event each turn. Oh. Okay, so let's do this first. Active hero loses one health. Reveal an additional dark arts. Active hero loses two health. All other heroes lose one. Okay, I'm down to six. Okay. Uh, here, she reveals an additional. All heroes choose one. Discard an item or lose two health. I'll lose two health. You can feel that. Be careful. You're about to, like, you know, yeah. check your items. Uh, one, two, one, two, three. Yeah, okay. And then... Uh, we did that. Active here loses one. Zolt says you don't you have to play two. allies one, first two. to get the benefit from beans. Well, that's not what we were told before. I don't know. I thought so, though. I thought order matters in this game because it does say played. For each ally played this turn, it's like talking past tense? Or is it played after? Played before? In general, in the turn? Yeah, so that would have changed things, because obviously I would have got all the even heals off whatever, but it's all good. I, I don't know. He's, who's, he's right? Zolt, Sorry, Tony, who's, who's Zolt's he? right? Zolt's right or Rob's right? Oh, man, I wish I knew that before. I've been playing that wrong for like, I don't know, 20-something hours, 30-something hours of streaming this game. That sucks. It's the whole turn. Oh, that's sad. That's sad that we so just then... found that out. Okay, that's fine. 
It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We'll go with it. I'll play it that way in the future, though. Thank you. Yeah, I always play it wrong then, like different. I was uh, approached my turn differently because of. Wasn't there something in the rules for this game that said about order of play matters, or am I confused with another game we play? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I I don't remember be. reading anything where it's like turn matters, but we just thought based on other card games that we've played. Keep going, and I'll uh, look it up. Uh, in okay. the in the base rule book, I swear there was something in there, but maybe I'm thinking of a complete other game. We played too many games, so okay. I just don't. I'm gonna discard two spells. Everyone can gain one influence and draw a card. Uh, you can, sorry, gain one influence and draw a card. Gain one influence, draw a card. Yeah, this will gain me one, oops. One influence. You may banish a card in your hand. If it's an item, draw a card. So we'll banish that, draw a card. Okay. Uh, anyone hero can gain two. I will gain two, so I'm not stunned. Gain one. <coughs> Excuse me, sorry. Uh, anyone here? Uh, let's. I'm gonna give this Rob to you. Anyone here can gain an influence and a health, but potentially you don't get stunned and have a big hand. Okay. What do you want me to do? Uh, health and influence you can gain. So that. So uh, you're just saying gain a health and an influence? Yeah, just okay, so that you don't you. get stunned potentially on your All turn right. and you can carry on. Bam. Uh, gain an attack. Do that, but we'll just put that here. Four. Just yeah, three yeah, I'm just one. imagining that. And I only played three. I think of this to work because I banished spells too early. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. And then we'll refill this one, which is just another ally. Draw two cards, then choose one. Uh, discard any one card or banish a card in your hand. It does matter in certain uh, circumstances, but when the card says this turn, it means the whole turn. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't oh, know. Oh, Ultraviolet says it's the English on the card that makes it past tense played. If it was play, then I don't think order matters. Yeah. I, yeah, I, I don't know. Yeah, but who knows? Oh, but then Andrew says order matters, I think. Yeah, I thought order did matter in this game. Yeah, I think it's a, up for interpretation. That's the problem. Like, it, like, what does played mean? Played later, played past tense. Played in general, play, played. Who knows? It's confusing. It didn't need to be that way. That's fine. Okay. And this is the um, card that came oh, yeah. after. Draw here. All heroes choose one. Discard a spell or lose two health. Discard a spell. Okay. Dark arts. Reveal, sure. Active hero loses a health and discards a card. Actually. Okay. Uh, I, I, I lose a health. For each item in my hand, two of them, I will discard a card, and then the other one will lose a health. Okay, uh, then I will just play this card, gain one influence. Uh, you may banish a card in my hand if it's an item. Get it out! <laughs> draw a card. I have nothing to draw, so I will shuffle said deck. Oh, 
Oh, there's a big debate on it on BGG. I know, that's the thing. So it's like one person plays it one way, we play it the other. The designers have been printing new versions of the game for years and they don't feel like correcting it or anywhere in the rule book, putting examples, rewording the card, fixing it. They have space on the card. You can reword it, make it more clearly. But they don't says, care. The op says played means your whole turn, whether you play them or not. Or not. Okay. But yeah. That is fine. Whatever. I'll, I'll just play it like that going forward. I just wish I knew that in the past because that, that would have totally changed how I played my turns and stuff. And oh, yeah, Yogi. When I draw cards and stuff. Yogi's right, too. It says, if ordered mattered, then this turn is redundant. Like, you have to play all your cards that turn. You can't hold anything. Yeah, you I can't know. play anything when it's not yeah. on your turn. I know. I, I know. It's, it's confusing. Hmm. Very confusing. All right. So are we allowed to heal yet? Yep. Any one hero heals three health. Draw a card. Oh yeah, and I played an even. Oh, I should have done this before I played that. You have a, a thing to banish in your discard? Or your hand, one of those stupid things? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. so pretend before I played my first card, I'll banish one out of mine. And then you banish one out of yours, and then this is just like removed. I don't know, whatever. And then I'll just get rid of the one I shuffled in for my discard. And I'll just shuffle whatever. Okay. Uh, I just played a, a two even card, so that will be you can heal twice. Thanks. Uh, I drew this. Mm -hmm. No, I drew. I need to draw another, right? Yeah, I had. Oh no, I just threw away from my hand. You just drew that from that one. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Then what I draw from this one? That's a banish. Mm-hmm. So then what I draw from this one? I thought I drew this from this oh, one. Oh, because you banished. Oh, maybe you did. Yeah. And Sorry, I, I need to draw a new one, right? Yep. Anyone Hero Hill Street, I draw a card. Right? Yep. And then... An attack. You don't have a Weasley, I'm assuming. I don't think so. No. Money. I don't have a coin enemy, eh? No, Sucks. just that one. Is it dead? Yep. Six, seven, eight. All heroes heal. One and, and draw a card. I'll pitch this to look through my deck for a four cost or lower. Mm. I'm going to pretend this is in my hand still, though. I shouldn't have just threw that down with draw off the enemies. Oh, I'm not allowed to get the enemy. Not allowed to get the enemy benefit. Lose the health. Oh, yeah, yeah. I forgot. I wouldn't have drawn this. Shuffle that back in. Yep, not happening, not you're happening. You're right, you're right. Yep, not allowed. Did you? Oh, no, I caught no, it, I caught it before I even looked at the chat if they're yelling. No, nobody's yelling. No, no one's yelling yet. Okay, I was fast enough to catch it before. Yes. Yeah, I forgot. I can't get away with that stuff. And because of that, I can't play two allies, two spells, two items. Yeah, we just need, I just need to get you card draw going also. Like if I can... Well, it was just about to go, but yeah. Not this turn, though, with two of these in my hand. Okay. Five money. No, she doesn't draw. She doesn't draw. Maybe she draws. Uh, yeah. Stupefy. Gain attack. Remove a uh, control from location and draw a card. Awesome. Awesome. Oh, uh, yeah, I already shuffled. I don't want to shuffle. I don't know if we got all the heals off this. I gave you two, but mm -hmm. no, I definitely had one more. Uh, you can heal one more. Okay. We'll see our next one. Oh, these guys are not bad. Each time a dark arts event or villain causes you, or villain. Not, only villain. Only villain. Not creature. Hero, uh, cause the hero to discard a card. We lose one health. Oh, okay. yeah, I just caught it. I just caught the heal. I just caught the extra heal. <laughs> 
Our local Best Buy has PS5s available today, committed to the end of this game. Hashtag Rob didn't make me buy it, dot, 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 yet. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, all heroes lose one health for each card in hand with a value of exactly three. No, I have zero of them. Four, three, one. Okay, so one of them. Okay, then she says reveal an additional one. All heroes lose one health and add a control to the location. Oh, oh man. Okay. Then active hero loses a health, and then I did not discard. Okay. Um, I have a not a good turn, but we'll remove a control. We'll gain two influence if you play two or more spells I do not have, and I don't have a way to draw. Gain one influence. I may put spells on the top of my deck, but they're not that good. So, and then those do nothing. Four. Draw two and choose one discard. Yeah, let's buy this guy, I guess. Sure. And Jacko, what version of PS5 is it? Is it a certain color? Is it a bundle? Does it have the disk drive? Is it digital only? And the cost. We need all the information. But don't tell us where they are because then some sneaky person in the chat's gonna buy them all before you can get them. So don't don't say where. You are they still that hard to you find? You shouldn't even said Best Buy. Because now somebody's scouring Best Buy looking for local stores in stock. No, no, hurry! I'm just kidding. Don't rush. It's all good. Don't don't go with the FOMO. But yeah, th yeah, they still are because uh, just shortage on like shipping still affects that industry. Shortage on uh, audio chips, video chips, graphics card components, all that stuff. Still a thing. Yeah, Bellatrix is the worst. Yeah, she needs to die. All right, uh, fill this. Pro Pro to go. Gain one attack, one health. If you discard this, gain an attack. Out. I like that one because it works with my ability. Okay, before to I take a turn, though, I need to take a quick break. Uh, so I'm going to pause it here before I draw my dark event, and we'll be right back.
We back. Okay. Ah, got a war bundle. Okay. Cool, cool. All right, we're back. Ready to do this? Uh, my turn, right? Yep. Just drawing a dark arts. Three cost cards. Lose a health for each one in your hand. Exactly three costs. Oh nope. my gosh, three of them. Oh, I have oh none. Oh my gosh, one, two, three. I'm stunned. Oh, okay. No tokens. Half your cards. Half uh, my cards. Round it down. Add a control. That's a draw. That's a draw. And this is a dark arts causing you to discard? No, this is you stunned discarding cards, right? Yeah, one. Two. Okay, I'll lose a health. Active here, lose a health. I'm going to draw another Dark Arts event. Add a control to the location. Each time Dark Arts or Villain causes a hero to discard a card, that hero loses a health. Okay. Now I go to my turn. Let's start the party. I'm going to play this card. This gains me two attack. And I draw a card. And I played an even card. I can't heal. So I will heal. So Chang is going to draw three cards. One, two, three. Then I will discard any two cards. I guess I'll be discarding that anyway. Yeah, I'll just discard. Hmm. I'll discard one of these spells. And I'll discard this card. Uh, if you discard this card, gain one. Money and a health. Okay. I'm gonna roll the blue die. Money. Useless. Okay. We gotta remember too that this I think is the, is the turn. It. Thank you. All right. Stop. Nope. I'm gonna pitch this for this ability. If you discard this, all heroes draw a card. Then I'm gonna look through here. Don't be. Right? Or, yeah, I think I have enough. Yeah, yeah, I have. Oh, I'm not really playing items. And I'm going to draw into one for sure. Not guaranteed. And I can't play this one. Okay, if this is not the turn, it's fine. We're no, not. No, it we're is not... the turn. I, I, it is the turn. Just let me correct my thoughts here. Uh, this is. Um, So sorry, instead of you drawing from this, um, I will play it in a second. I drew a card from it though, but um, no, I should probably draw from it first. Yeah, I need to play it normally so that I can have played two events or two items, right? Mm -hmm. So then. Yeah, I just need to shuffle this and draw uh, one more card. Because I drew one, you drew one. But yeah, you but put, I put it back. Yeah, you put yours back. Um, so the card I discarded is instead this one to do the search. Which I got Dobby, right? Yeah, Dobby's here. So then I'll play this, draw two cards. So now I've... Oh, but I don't have another one. Yeah, it's only if you get through your deck. It's the only way it's even possible. Yeah, so I can't pitch this yet. So I don't have Dobby. But on the draw, hold on. I don't know what the other one I drew was, but we'll just say I drew them. Oh, it was Dobby, and then I just drew a card. I just drew this. I drew one of these. <sighs> yes. No, Dobby's who I searched. Oh my god. I'm so lost now. I got I got like all befuddled. Trying I'm trying to play two items so bad here, but I'm pitching one here. You can play detention, they're saying it just has no effect. Oh okay. So then you're fine. Okay, but I, I don't have that for sure. So anyways, I'll draw two off this. I haven't done this yet, let's say, right? So I draw right. two. Okay.
Yeah. So so I have this now. I can pitch this to do this still. Yeah, that's yeah. right. Yeah, yeah, okay. That's what I needed. Uh, so I gain one for this. Uh, influence, draw a card. Roll the blue die. Draw a card for both. Okay. I can still, yeah, I can still play this. Each ally played this turn, so I can play it any time, right? We all are, are good on that. Gain that, but then I'll forget it later too, so... I definitely get two attack here. Uh, let's draw two cards. And discard any one card. I'll just discard a spell to gain two money. Remove a control from the location. I'll draw a card. I have no cards. Also, I, I'm forgetting this too, but I also played another ally. Two, of them. two allies, so I gain two more attack. Um, how many cards have I played that are even? Four, I think. One, two, three, oh. four, five. I can't heal, so just take it all for yourself. Five heal. <laughs> Shuffling my deck. Uh, and that was me. I don't remember what that was from. That was from Dobby. Dobby. Drawing a card from Dobby. Uh, I'm going to gain one influence. You may banish a card in your hand. If it's an item, draw a card. Okay, and then I'll gain two attack. I'll gain an attack. One, two, three, four, five money. Okay, and then um, I'll start assigning some damage. We know where it's all going. She needs to go, but do I have enough? Four, yep, nine. Nine attack. We just don't get the rewards. We don't get the rewards. I don't care. But she's gone, so she that's She's gone. Good. Happy about that. Uh, and I did assign this, so all heroes heal one. But cannot. you can't. I can't, so well. Ah. Okay. And then I look for a card. Oh, beans on owl. One more attack you would have. Beans on... Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, Probably him next, yeah, right? Sure. He, these ones are not that bad. And by stupefy, one, two, oh, and I did this thing, right? I definitely did enough. Yeah, it's at the end of your turn, yeah. Yeah, you definitely did. <laughs> Let me just double check. Yeah, definitely a, a nice rainbow there. All right, I'm spending six. I don't care about the rest of the money. Uh, just to buy this one. Stupefy. Okay. Okay. Uh, draw one, two, three, four, five, and this says, once per game you may discard this, then collect the reward of the top villain or creature in the discard pile. Oh, oh so, oh, that's cool. But only on my turn I can do that. Mm -hmm. All right, uh, okay. replace, Reparo. Okay, then we're going to put out, oh no, the Dementor. Active hero loses two health. No! And now he's active. No! Active hero loses one health and discards a card. Oh, wow. May not be assigned damage. Okay. So, we're going here first. Rolling the green die. Seeing what happens. And that. Oh, no, no, no. Sorry. All heroes lose a health. Oh, I would I be I back full. Then we all lose a health. Ah. Uh, active hero loses a health and discards a card. Oh. Okay. Why do I only have moldy, moldy. four cards? It must have made me discard cards for something uh, else. Uh, those are draws. Matthew says, Rob, you got any virtual reality setup advice you could give me? Do this one for now. Uh, I only have the quest two. Who's like two? we only own the quest two. Who's one? Who's one? Um, yeah, just research what your minimum PC specs need to be to run VR. Because even with the quest two and rumored quest three, and any other headset that you plug in, 
if we're not talking PlayStation VR, uh, they all, they have a requirement. I think you need like a 1060 Ti. I don't know what the AMD equivalent is to run VR off of a PC. But the cool thing about the Quest 2 VR, it's like the, it's reasonably priced. You don't need any cables. Uh, the battery kind of sucks on it, but you can still play VR games. They're not the best looking. Obviously, the ones that hook up to a PC can look better, but the Quest lets you do that. You can actually hook a Quest into your PC with a cable or wirelessly and run better looking VR off your PC if you have a good graphics card, a good PC, to see um, better running games with higher res frame rates or higher res uh, textures and, and better frame rates and all that stuff. Um, so yeah, the difference between VR that's portable right now and VR that's run off of a nice big juicy PC is night and day. Like the games run faster. And again, you need a high frame rate for less motion sickness and better uh, immersion in VR. Like once they have nice VR running at like 240 frames a second, like 240 hertz screens for VR, then you're going to feel like you're really in the game as you move around. But on the Quest, this only goes up to 90 hertz. And uh, it's okay. It's better than 60. But it still has that like delay when you're moving in a video game at 60 hertz is like not the fastest. Um, so it's like not the best, but, uh, some of the headsets that hook right up to a PC and if you put them on a good gaming PC, the games look beautiful. They run nice on uh, the quest. You can do that, but PlayStation five VR. I don't know anything about that, but they have like a new VR coming or it's out already. I don't even know. PS PSVR two might be good. I don't know. Do your research. Um, but yeah, Matthew go, go start researching VR. There's, there's YouTube channels dedicated on just VR that literally only play VR games, review VR equipment, talk about VR accessories, requirements, setting up your rooms, your, your streaming VR, all that stuff. It's all out there, man. Go down the rabbit hole, have a fun time learning. Um, but again, I haven't I went in that rabbit hole for like a year and a half or so. So I, I don't know what's new out there. But uh, yeah. Uh, Mike, Half-Life Alex definitely can, can cause motion sickness if you're sensitive to it. I know personally, that's the game that set me over, was playing Half-Life Alex. That's what made me get, um, almost vomit a few times, because uh, I pushed myself too far. So no, Half-Life Alex, is, it, it, for some people, yes. Some people are not prone to it. But uh, that game is bad for it. It is, it is bad, very bad. I promise you. Yeah, any game with like the, the moving stuff too, like the teleporting. They think that helps, but it does not. It, do, it does not. And again, if you're running Half-Life Alex on a low frame rate or low hertz, it's bad, very bad. But that game is awesome. Beautiful game. But yes. I, I only I, play Beat Saber, so I have no idea. Yeah, Beat Saber is good for no motion sickness because yeah. you're just pretty much standing, standing still. still yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yes, there's a level of, of motion sickness with VR that like there's certain games that just like you can play you're sitting down or have a sitting down mode and you can play sitting down or standing still and not moving around too much and you won't get motion sickness mm -hmm. but then there's games that literally teleport you like you pick a spot and all of a sudden screen goes black and you're in a new spot and that can like make you if you're you, that can mess really mess with you uh, but you can blow a fan on yourself eat din ginger drink ginger to help you there's lots of other tricks that work they do work um, to help anything with helps you with motion sickness any of those kind of like medications for like car sick, seasick and stuff like that. Yeah, like gravel. Yeah, those help you with motion sickness in uh, VR also. I, I know from experience. Well, to be a I'm the exact same. I cannot read in the car either at all, even for like a minute and yeah. I start getting a massive headache. You can build up resistance to that though. You can build up to resistance to that. It, it takes time, but you can for sure. I, I know from experience. If you have trouble with like motion sickness, you can slowly you just need to like not push yourself. Mm -hmm. You need to not push yourself. If you start feeling sweaty, a little nauseous, take off the headset or whatever's causing it and get away from it. Just get away from it and slowly, slowly take your time. But yeah, VR is not for everyone. That's why it's not such mainstream because not everyone can do it. Just like the stupid 3D glasses and all that stuff. It's like not everyone has the proper eyes that work with that and stuff. So not proper eyes, but the compatible eyes like, you know, that, that work with that kind of stuff. Same with AR, too. Okay, I'm going to choose a draw card for this one. Same with this one. Uh, gain an attack and a health. 
this one gain two health. Attack here. One does nothing. And I'm done. Also, VR is not cheap. It's definitely a premium type of gaming. Games and software cost more. It's kind of like Apple versus Android. Like everything in the I Apple store costs a little more. There's like kind of like a premium tax on it because they don't sell things in such high volume. So they charge more. So you'll be paying like $40. Games barely ever go on sale. And you'll find you're paying for like $40, $50 for a game that you feel like is like, you know, you, you beat it in three hours. And it's like, but that's just the premium of VR right now. That's just how it is. Um, so yeah. So just keep that in mind. It's like kind of like a premium thing still. It's not cheap. Your turn whenever you My do. turn, all right. All heroes reveal the top card of the deck. If you reveal a card of value of one or more, you discard it and lose two health. Nope. Nope. Aloha Mara. Okay, active hero loses one health and discards a card. Ah. Uh, psh, I'll discard this card, which will gain me an influence and a health. Okay. Ah. Active hero loses two health. Okay. Active hero loses one health. Okay. Uh, active hero loses oh. one because you discarded a card. Ah. Ah. I'm down to I know. It's annoying. Oh, yeah. You know what I say to that? Nothing yet. I put one here. I probably should put it here instead because this guy's worse, right? Yeah. Two versus one. Okay. Whatever, but it might wipe and heal. But whatever. I know, but it depends. We can yeah, start yeah. focusing on this guy next. Yeah, I think so. Um. Hmm. Well, I'll gain three health. One, two, three. I'll draw a card. <clears throat> Gain attack. Do you have a Weasley in hand? No, I don't think so. Okay. No. <laughs> uh, draw a card. Oh, sucks. Okay. Uh... Gain an influence. If yeah, yeah. So so what do I do about this one? If you play an item, also gain money. I'm assuming that one order matters. Like you have to play this first, then play the item after. Probably. Right? I don't have one right now, but I'm just saying maybe I draw off the blue die, for example. Yeah. But like is the item I already played this turn? Does that count? I bet I bet half people play it one way and half people play it the other. Which is like why? Why is that a thing? Anyways, okay, uh, I'm going to roll the blue dot. Card draw. Okay. And again, attack. Oh, yeah, we should be doing some heals probably here. Uh, two heals. You take two heals. Thanks. Off of this. Oh, yeah, once per game, discard this collector ward. Oh, I don't have a discard pile. Oh. Have done that but you I... you did shuffle, so this is technically all was in your discard pile because you shuffled to draw that card for the yellow. So you could just look through this and then just reshuffle. What it. is it for? An, An item? item. Put it in your hand. Yeah, I should have done that, right? Yeah. Yes. Uh, so yeah, I'll do that. Well, keep that one you drew. Uh, I mean, it's up no, to you. No, 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 but... no, no. I can undo it, right? I can put it back like this, and then I look for an item. So yeah, I will. I will once per game. You may discard this. Collect the reward from the top villain or creature in the discard pile. So all heroes may search their discard pile for an item, put it in their hand, and also remove two from the location. Okay. Yeah, and I'll grab the Marauder's map. And then I would draw, I play this after. Sure. And then I would shuffle whatever, and then I would have drew. Okay, draw. Okay. And then uh, let's do Marauder's Map. I'm going to discard it for this ability. So if you discard it, all heroes draw a card. And I'm going to search. Mm, yeah. Okay. Okay. 
And then this guy gain an attack, sure. Uh, I'm gonna play her, draw two cards, then discard any one card. Uh, she's a four cost card, so I'll just heal one. I'm gonna pitch a spell, gain two influence. Uh, play her, draw three cards. One, two, three. Then discard any two cards. So I'll discard this one, gain a money and a heal. And I'll discard one of these. Then I roll the blue die. Can I? Oh, yeah, sorry. Go ahead. Go ahead. Card draw. And then can I heal from her? Yes. Thank you. Of course. I can't even take it. I'm going to gain two attack. Draw a card. And then I'll gain five influence. Oops. Five influence. And then I'll play this, which is an item, so that other one would give me an attack. Gain an influence. And for each ally I played this turn. Yes, I could have played it earlier, I know. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. Five more attack. Three, four, five. And was that an even? No. Okay. Oh, we're both full now. Okay. Hmm. I'll just buy the sword. Where is coin guy? We did that guy early, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. There's only one. <laughs> yeah. I'm okay. sure it's gonna I come in the be future. More. I thought there'd be more. Future games. Uh. Oh yeah. We got kill here. I could draw even more cards. Okay. Hold on. Uh, so I'll add five here. Okay, and what is it? All heroes. Draw All heroes card. draw a card. Another attack for playing Dobby. And then remove a control. Yeah, remove a control. I'm gonna draw another card. Oh, and he's even heal. No, nope, oh. don't need heal. Okay. Um. Then I'm gonna play this guy. Another influence doesn't matter. Whatever. Um. Draw another card. And then roll the blue die. Money, useless for me. Uh, okay. Gain another influence. Banish a card in your hand. No, it's okay. Don't care. All right. And then with this, I have six. And you get yeah, two more attack from the two characters you just played at the end there. That one and Dobby. Oh, okay. I thought I gained both. I, I didn't. I, I thought I gained one. But I No, I did gain the Dobby one, I think. Oh, okay. So just one? Yeah, I think it's just one I missed. No. no. I don't think you did. No, I didn't. You're right. Yeah, because you drew from killing Yeah, you're right. You're, yeah. right. you're right. You're right. You're right. Yep. I'm just going to remove these so we don't get... So then... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Paya! All heroes gain two health and remove a control from the location. Oh, there is none. Huh? We got you, Boldy, and your queer... Queerness? Queerl? Queerl? I don't know even how to say that. Those? I totally butchered it, I'm sure. Uh, okay. These all discarded. Look at that. Look at all those cards. Oh, yeah, that feels good. I know, it does feel good to start my oh. hand with all of this. Oh, feels better. Feels better. Okay, another map. Okay, I got a shuffle. Okay. Oh, yeah, definitely heal off this, but we don't need to. No. <laughs> all right. Male Karen, yeah that's, yeah, that's easier to say than thing, whatever that name is. <laughs> I butcher it, I'm sure. Mm. All right, I'm going to roll the green die and see what happens. James says, hold on, yeah. this is important. James says, I believe discard powers only work when forced to discard from villains, creatures, or dark arts. I believe that's in the rules. I may be wrong. I'm not near my rules to check. Hold on, James. You don't carry a, a small pocket-sized version of the rules with you uh, everywhere you go in your pocket? I thought you were a hardcore gamer. Uh, I guess not. Um, yeah, I don't know. Discard powers. What are we? What are we referring to? He's talking about any time I discard, where it says like, if you discard this card, heal and stuff. I don't think so, though. I think it, you're allowed to get the benefit off of it. Yeah, I think you can. I, I can't see why always, not. Yeah, I thought we always did that way. Yeah. So you're saying like regarding the chocolate frog or yeah, whatever. Yeah. So he's saying, he's saying like this. If you discard this, but it doesn't specify, 
But in the rules, James thinks it does. Oh, Mike wants to know how many rules are in your pocket, Rob. Mike, literally every single board game I play. You know why? Because I usually have my phone in my pocket and uh, I have a bunch of rule books, PDF form, saved on my Google Drive. And I literally will be sitting on the toilet. I I've done this anywhere. I'm sitting on the toilet, no joke. Uh, at Gen Con, let's say for example, out at a restaurant. And I'm killing some time sitting in my office, quote unquote. And I literally will get a YouTube comment saying, you played this wrong on a video. And I'll go, did I though? And then I'll go, hmm, Google Drive, PDF, look it up. Sometimes I say, I haven't played this game in three years. I don't, I don't know the answer, I'm sorry. Or go ask on somewhere where it's more active, you know, go to, mm -hmm. go to the forums. But uh, yeah, I'll literally look up rules quickly, uh, a PDF search, find the section I'm thinking of, especially the LCGs. Yeah. Because those I like, we play so often that I'm like, I think I know that's the rule. Let me just find it in the rules reference guide, get the page number. So yeah, I do do that. So yes, I have them all. Nice try though. Unless there's no PDF available, then I don't have it. <laughs> all right, we're good with what we did. How do you? No, no question we're okay? anymore. Yeah, we're good. Oh, Miss says, I think it does work. It's only when you discard for being stunned when you don't. Yeah, because you don't get the you don't get the health from that. Oh, but, but you would but still I get would still the token. Cards. Yeah. Oh, you don't get the benefit of discarding it from stun. Otherwise, you get it. Oh. Even for stun. Yeah, I thought it. Then maybe I was. It did even wrong. For so. stun, all effects are in are instead. I just thought you get the other bonuses, but not the um, any I health bonuses. I don't bonuses. know. I don't know right now. Where's all the stun stuff? I think, yeah, we did it. We did it right in this case, though, but. Hold on, hold on. This is from the original rule book. This is the stun section. Discard half the cards in your hand rounded down. For example, if you have five cards, choose two to discard. If a card has an effect generated by being discarded, you, capital letters, do still get that effect. Yeah, it's, Stop, unless it's, guys. You guys are so mean. Who unless play this it's game? health. Yeah, you guys are, yeah. Stop being mean in the chat trying to make the game harder for us. You guys are <laughs> ruining our fun. Horrible people. You all are horrible. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> no, you guys are making it more challenging for yourselves. <laughs> get out of here. <laughs> yeah, for, for being stunned, I was under the assumption you get everything except for health because you can't heal, but... Here's what I say, okay? You want to hear what I say? Oh, Miss has played it wrong all these years, lol. Oh, hey, I'm so sorry. Miss, here's what I'll say to you. I know you mean well, and please, if you don't know me, sometimes I just say things, they might sound worse than they do, but at least you get to see my face and hear how I'm saying it versus me typing it, so you don't know if I'm being a jerk or not. But I do, like, I know, it's hard to explain, but I will usually not fight on a rule or, or pose a rule on someone else. And people do this on BGG all the time. I see it in the rules forum. There's people that spend the time in there telling people how it works. And then you scroll down a bit and you see the designer going, ah, uh, sorry, that's wrong. This, this is how it works. But if you don't, if you haven't read the rules recently, and I know I do this too. I, my reading comprehension is not the great, greatest either. So sometimes I read a rule book multiple times. I skim through sections and I feel like I know the rule but I don't because I just misread or mis miscomprehended something. And then I ingrained it in myself as like a shortcut memory. Like this is the way it works. I never need to look it up again. But then human memory is flawed, right? Mm -hmm. But basically I say it to myself too, and I need to do it more is if I don't feel super confident with the rule, but again, you might feel confident. You might literally trust your brain. That yeah. You read it correctly. You remembered it correctly, but the human brain is flawed, right? But if you're not sure about a rule and people leave comments on here and on BGG and they try to tell me like, and I, I appreciate people trying to like correct rules and help other people learn. But sometimes people say it in the rudest way. This is horrible. You made a mistake. You're not allowed to draw cards like this or whatever. Then I have to go look it up, find the rules reference guide page, link to the PDF. He had an out-of-date rule book or he was wrong. She was wrong, whatever. And slap him back with, you're, you're wrong. Please don't come in here being rude unless you're 100%. Like, look up the latest FAQ. Read the rule book one more time. I know that people aren't going to do that before they reply, and they're trying to be helpful. Most people are. Most people are trying to be helpful. But, like, if you don't know, just ask, you know, or say it. I am not sure, but I think you don't need to do it this way. 
Yeah, like a question, right? And that is totally fine. Yeah. You know, yeah. I'm not sure, but I think you need to gain money at this way or don't get discard effects or whatever, right? No, James, you're fine. You're fine. No, but it just, it makes me think, and I'm not saying this to you guys. It just reminds me of like, I see this on BGG. I see it in my comments. I sometimes see it in my chat. People just get rude. And it's not like I'm misreading them being rude. They literally say like, you were just like every other YouTuber. You make tons of mistakes. Like, oh, uh, I can't find a good playthrough anywhere without mistakes. You guys are all horrible. Stuff like that. Like, mm -hmm. And then I have to reply going, actually, you're wrong on that. If you just read the latest FAQ on this page, this is why we play it this way. And then you get apologies or like whatever. They they roll back and whatever. But yeah. sometimes they're right. But it's just like, I, like, I don't like the way people are so for sure when your brain and memory and reading comprehension can be flawed. Or the worst is when pe there's been a few times, it's happened at least two or three times over the years where someone's commented and said, you play this wrong. Like play it correctly or don't stream it at all. Something like that. Like I get, I get stuff like that. It's hilarious. I'm like, what? Like what? I, okay. Um, but then I reply back and I correct them. And then right away they deflect and blame it on their friend that taught them the game. Well, my friend screwed up then. He taught me it completely wrong. You're playing wrong for six years. And starts blaming it on their friend. Well, you didn't read the rule book so, then, like, obviously. So, you were playing on secondhand information and you're walking around like a rules lawyer and you've never read the rule book yourself? G-T-F-O, capital letters. Like, that's, like, that's what I do. I, I read it sometimes. I show Mel. I'm like, look at this. Like, I, yeah, like, just double check before you go yelling at people. That's all. But that reminds me of that. You're not doing it. That's why I'm telling you right now. But it just reminds me of that. Yeah, we appreciate yeah, the... Yeah question questioning yeah, and yeah. also if you <laughs> if you think that you are doing it right and we're doing it wrong bringing up that also yeah. then just shows that there's some discussion or misinterpretation of the rules and yeah, yeah. but also say please if you're yeah. like if you think we're doing something wrong point it out and just say i think you're doing this wrong like try to correct it because man i'd rather correct it and if like one person's watching later because i do this personally if yeah. someone's watching the playthrough later and they go oh <gasps> Is that right? And they look in the comments or they read the, the chat archive or we correct it on stream and they then correct their game and then teach their friends properly and whatever, whatever. If I help like one person, it's worth being called out and I don't get embarrassed. Like it's fine. Like you can't play every game no, correctly. We can't. I can't play all these games. I can't play this like three or four different games in a week sometimes and not get a rule wrong. Like it just ha has to happen. Yeah. And we don't play the lightest games either. So it's totally fine. The other thing too is I think yeah. rule books are a little bit up for interpretation on some rules. There's sometimes that Rob will read a rule book, I'll read the same <laughs> rule book, we'll sit down to play and then argue about how some like we yeah. go to do something and I'm like, that's not how that works. Like, and we're like reading it. Like I'm like, no, I'm reading it this way. He's reading it this way. Then like, we have the to same go on BGG, words. we're like searching, we're like, oh yeah, true. It could be interpreted that way. Yeah, we like just interpret it in different ways. Yeah, yeah. So it's so, definitely yeah. possible. Everyone's understanding of like language, if the game was translated from another language, what's, mm -hmm. how did their translator interpret English words and stuff sometimes? Sometimes there's language barrier. Uh, you know, sometimes it's not clear. And then, uh, oh, there's another thing too. Yeah, there's so many things. Uh, and then also our, our upbringing and how we speak even. Oh, yeah. like read, so even just in the English language, for example, I'm sure there's other languages have this problem too. You get into regional slang or Definitely. understanding of words and it's like, even that, like, where was the game created? What do they assume this templating? How will it be interpreted in all English regions could be different, right? Yeah. And then it's like, oh, man. And then the assumption <laughs> from other games and the use of words in other games, and you're like, oh, they probably meant this, or this is what I think they mean, which also could be wrong. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's crazy. It's fun. It's a fun, fascinating thing. Yeah. I love it. But... Please don't apologize. You're fine. Yeah, Miz, it's all good. And oh, James, you're totally fine. Yeah, no, yeah. no worries. No, guys, I love it. I I love it when you guys say something and then the chat's like, no, this way. But then there's like eight people saying one way and eight people saying the other. <laughs> I love trying to then figure it out. Like yeah. it's like a puzzle. It's like, okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Some people think this way. Some people think that way. You'll see me get frustrated. But why I'm really frustrated in those situations is because the game could have been written better or the card could have been fixed in another printing or there could be a widely available FAQ, or they could work the FAQ into a future rulebook printing. So when I go huff and puff, when someone's like, oh, you're doing this wrong, and then six other people say, no, you're doing it right, then two other people go, no, they're doing it wrong, and they all start fighting, I get frustrated, and like, why is this still happening in games? 
Like, why is this still happening? It's going to happen forever, though. They're like, But it shouldn't, because the designers and publishers in our industry all go to conventions together. There's conventions literally targeted at publishers, store owners, the designers, all this stuff. They all get together. They all hang out together. It's a small world with this uh, board gaming community. They all hang together on forums and all this stuff, work mm -hmm. together on games. Man, somebody's got to sit down and come up with some kind of, like, standard in, like, each language of templating and wording and stuff for, like, I don't know. Got to get there. Got to get there. At least better than we are. Anyways. Or at least some kind of format. Like, if always, always create an FAQ somewhere and put it in your rule book from day one. And I love some companies that say, this is a living rule book. To find the latest edition, check this website. Or go to BGG. Our designer answers uh, rules questions on the forums. So then, no matter what, the first person who bought the rule book can always rely on that to look up stuff if they're confused, at least. Because not everyone gets the rule book right, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, I get frustrated. Anyways, I've ranted about this too much. All right. Where are we? I don't even know. You're, uh, my turn. My turn. Your my turn. turn. You're, yeah. you're shuffling and drawing. Did you do that? Uh, yeah. I think okay. I, I'm good, I think. You got five cards. I got a sword and I got a dobby. I'm rolling. Okay. Uh, active hero loses one health and reveals an additional darker. Ah! That's fine. I don't but mind yeah, when I'm full. It's a definitely an interesting topic. Like, yeah. It's... Active hero loses one health and cannot assign more than one attack to each villain this turn. That's fine. Oh, maybe it's not fine. I have like a bazillion cards here. Uh, active hero loses one health and discards a card. That's Michael's correct too. Yeah, games are becoming more... What do I got to do? Nope, nothing. Nothing? Okay. I'm going to discard this card because I can't... There's no um, location to remove. And then active hero loses one. Okay. James says, we interpreted the rule book that you cannot voluntarily discard a card to get its benefit. It has to be not in your control. Like see? Chocolate so Frog, if forced to get rid of it, you get the benefit. But see, that's the thing about two people reading the same book and interpreting it in different ways. But this is where also, just based on a few of these rules, thinking it one way or another, can also totally change the difficulty of a game. Mm-hmm. And also either make people not interested in the game because it feels too easy and not recommend it and hurt the game in the long run and hurt the hobby in the long run or, or hurt that gaming group even sometimes. Or you can make it way too hard and then the game also has another reason to not hit the table, the person not buy the expansions, the person not tell their friends, not give it a good review, not rate it, not hang out in the forums, not stream it on YouTube, whatever, you know. And all all of this stuff has, has a ripple effect that affects the bottom line of publishers and designers too, right? Mm -hmm. so it's like this is where it's like all good to like get, get these things correct like work on getting them more correct it'll never be perfect but they should always be striving to get more correct and that needs to there needs to be some kind of body within the hobby of publishers or designers that get together and start some kind of like a little bit of regulation on some things some standards of moving things forwards or something like kind of like coming up with an ISO standard, you know, that like if you're in this industry, this at least has to be followed and you can slap it on your box that you follow this, this standard. And then if it's like you have this standard, I know you're going to have a tutorial. I know you're going to like have a, 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 a increasingly complex amount of games before the full rules are unveiled. You're going to follow a certain templating standard where you're going to use specific words that do specific things like discard means the same thing in a game that has you know, Rob's gaming table standard slapped on the box, you know, <laughs> or whatever, you know what I mean? Um, but yeah, something like that. I don't know. I'm crazy. I think these things, but I like, we've seen it done in other industries and it's just part of maturing. It's part of an industry maturing, but it needs to happen. It needs to happen. I think something like that. Anyways. One of the things, and I don't know, you can correct me if I'm wrong, but one of the things I think is that one of the issues is the wrong people are playtesting games. Yeah, I know. That's one main I've issue. I've talked about that before. I've talked about that before. Yeah, because if you're asking yeah. people that know the game to playtest your game, they're not going to ask no, the right questions. That's, that's not prob the worst. That's problem number one. <laughs> problem number two is when it's just your friend or family and they don't want to tell you. Yeah. That something is wrong in your game. Sure, honey, your wrong game's the greatest. Person. You should go to Kickstarter with it. It's yeah. an awesome game. Thanks, mom. Thanks for telling me my game's great. Let me Five go to Kickstarter. Five people is not enough <laughs> to play your game and <laughs> test it, right? You need people to that don't know your game yep. to come in and ask questions when they run into questions like, "How does this work? Why is this 
And then they need to re reword the rule book to make it clear because if one person had that question, they're not the only person. The other, the other big bad thing to do is when you're play testing, I know it's cheap. I know it helps the bottom line, but you shouldn't go to your fans right, as same. your play testers. That's the same thing, yeah. And like Chip Theory does that, right? They reach out and they go, we need some more play testers. Anyone in the community want to help us play test? Wrong people. Wrong people. Get a couple of them in there because you need people to keep you doing what you do best and why they fell in love with your company. They need to be there with their voice being heard for sure. But you need to also pull from people who've never touched a product you made or even have played a previous game and didn't like it that yeah. you made. Get those, get your haters in there too and get them telling you why they don't like it, why they don't want to play it, what sucks about it. You know, mm -hmm. too many people are afraid of getting their feelings hurt. It sucks. But yeah. I agree, Michael. A game at $25 for sure. They're, they don't have the money and maybe they don't pay mm -hmm. for testing and rule book writing and all of that. Sure. Yeah. I'm not talking but, about the $25 games. But usually games. that's not what we're playing. I'm not talking about the $25 games, you guys. Yeah. I'm talking about the ones you go on Kickstarter and people are throwing $500 at and a base pledge is like $150 after shipping yeah. or more. It's like you spend a lot of time making those minis look perfect, but man, spend some of that money on something else. I, I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I'll do some play testing on your rule book and your tutorial. And your mechanics. I just want to say this is an interesting, interesting conversation with yeah. lots of lots of chat about this. So yeah, definitely a topic that people are oh, passionate yeah. about. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah. Okay. Tell me if you want me to stop, but I can keep playing my turn and see what happens here. Um. Okay, I'm gonna gain an attack. I'm gonna discard two spells. We both gain an influence and draw a card. I'm going to. I'm going to gain. No, Voldemort is not one. <laughs> gain an influence. Not yet. I'm going to banish a card. I'm going to banish this one because I don't care anymore. And it's an item, so I get to draw a card. Oh no, I'm not discarding that one. I'm banishing. I'm banishing this one. No, I had one in my hand. Uh, let's gain one. Let's gain one. Uh, I played four more spells. We all get an attack. I'll put that there, though, for you. Uh, Any one hero, that's me, will gain an influence and a health. Uh, gain two attack, or I mean two influence. If you play two or more spells, also gain an attack and a health. I did. Uh, gain an attack and a health. Oh, it sucks. I can't even, I can only put out one, one, uh, attack this turn. And I, the one turn I have four, uh, gain one. I may put spells on the top of my deck and we both gain an influence. One and one, but I can only put one here because of this. So these are all getting wasted. That's so unfortunate. Well, James, James, what you're still talking about. I'm sorry. No, nope, that's okay. Doing. That's okay. So I'm James, two, uh, what you're talking about, we can look at more rules in the rule book too. So this is on the next page uh, from what we are previously talking about. So drawing and discarding cards is in the base rule book. Okay, PDF off of the official website. I don't think it's been changed from the original printing. Maybe it has. Maybe it's different than your printing. But this says other cards have an effect that only happens if you choose to discard them, not when you play them. Okay. For example, the Remember Brawl, Remember Brawl? Neville starting deck gives a hero one influence when it's played, but two when discarded to another effect. The effect on these cards triggers if you choose to discard them to a villain, dark arts event, or from being stunned, or to another Hogwarts card like Crystal Ball. So the problem is you think, I think James, what you were saying is you read the part about choosing and you assume choosing is only happens on your turn uh, are your step of playing your actions, you're picking the card. But every single dark arts and villain in this game or any effect, if you notice, they all tell you to discard a card. And in, by default in this game, you get to choose the card you discard. And even some cases, it tells you lose health or discard a card. You're choosing which card to discard still in that case, or you're even choosing to discard a card instead of losing health, for example. So no matter what, you're always choosing the card you discard. 
This game never does random discard that I've seen. I don't think so. I don't think so. And it never lets your opponent choose. It never tells you to discard the third card in your hand or anything like that. It is always you choosing. So right here, it is very clear that no matter how it was chosen by you, whether it's you choosing which cards to discard when you're stunned, or you choosing which card out of the four or five to discard when a villain hits you, or whether on your turn you're choosing to discard it to pay a cost. Doesn't matter. All of them are covered right here. You get the benefit from it. And I think some of the cards that let you do that, they're cost accordingly. Like, they, there are usually cards that are a little more expensive that give you the discard effect. They, I think they cost an extra influence, I feel, um, to balance them with that ability to make them not as sucky. Because some of the cards that get the discard effect are like three gold and four gold. They shouldn't be that cost for just their base effect. And I probably can find an example for you, actually. Oh, James says it's the way that he, he's trying to type it. It's not making, it's not coming out as if you oh. were, was, yeah. With that, and that's also, that also. Oh, I see, okay. It's all good. Yeah, yeah, but still, it's okay, it's okay. Mm, yeah, maybe the frog is not overcosted. But I, I feel like they put some of those in mind of discarding, like you're taking them for the discard, but yeah. if you don't discard them, they still are fine. Yeah, I don't know. I, I'm not sure. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's all good, James. It's all good. <laughs> I'm going to spend five, oh, though, man. and I'm going to purchase this one. Oh, spells go on top of my deck, right? Yeah. And then, all the, no, that's all. That's all. Done. I think I gave you all your bonuses as well. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> and three, four, five. Okay. Uh, all heroes lose their health. Add a control to the location. All he active hero loses the health and discards a card. Oh, well, I'm going to choose to discard. <laughs> Just trolling. All right, I'm going to discard this spell. Alo, 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 Okay. Uh, then, active here, lose the health. Then, I'm going to play my turn. Stupefy. Gain an attack. Remove a control. And I'm going to draw a card. Did I remove one or add one? I don't know what you did. What did I just do? But either way, remove one. I'm going to draw a card. And then I'll heal. Because I totally yeah, just I did it without even thinking, and I don't know what I just did. You can heal the full, and I'll draw a card. Thank you. I think I added one. Okay, after I did it, I was like, I don't think I did that right. Like, my I'll brain didn't think about what I was doing. I'm going to choose to discard. She did. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna, sorry. I'm going to choose to discard the Marauder's Map so we all can draw a card. Draw a card. Draw a card. I don't have a deck. Thank you, thank you. I was, like, totally sleeping at the wheel there, eh? And I'm going to search. Yeah, that's what I've been doing. I, I get distracted reading chat. I don't even think I was reading the chat. I was just like in La La Land. Yeah, it's been a long day playing this game. I don't know what I was doing. All, all the side discussions. We burned too much brain power today. <laughs> Definitely. Okay. Which we haven't really done anything. <laughs> yeah, we debated, no, debated very serious topics within the board gaming world. We, I don't know. You're right. It's whatever. All right. Uh, so I grabbed Cho Chang. I'm shuffling. It feels like we're already done, so it's I like, know. I started to check out and like start discussing stuff. Now I gotta get my brain back in the game, so, so we're, we don't we're gonna lose. make mistakes all over the place, just so you know. All right. Cho Chang says, draw three cards. One, two, You're right, this three. is a super serious channel here. Discard any two, yes. Super Never serious. go off topic either. Guard two cards. Roll the blue die, don't forget. Yeah, I know, I know, I'm working down the card. Draw oh, a card each. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to gain an influence, draw a card, roll blue die, draw a card, 
Gain to attack. Draw a card. Oh, Jacko's also said not even a good rant yet. Whoa, Jacko. You might have just created one. Listen, let me tell you. <laughs> let me tell you. All right. Gain, I don't know if I gained it. You didn't. Uh, you know, you didn't. I also play an item. Sure, I'll play an item at some point. Uh, I gain an attack for that item. And then I roll a blue. Draw yeah. a card. I like 17 cards before my turn starts. Uh, I'm playing the item. I gain two attack. I'm going to roll the red die twice. Money. Attack. <sighs> I'm going to gain a money, and I'm going to banish a card from my uh, hand if it's an item I draw a card. I'll gain an attack. Whatever that was at, I don't know. Uh, gain two attack. And then gain four monies. Three. All heroes gain money and health. And then, ten? uh, probably not. You might. I don't know. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, two ways. Um, but, uh, um, I'll heal one from this. Mm -hmm. And I probably heal a whole bunch from this that I totally didn't do. Um, now with all of my juicy money. Are you going to buy Asha or what? She no, she doesn't have the word draw on her. Oh. At this point in the game, she was... But it's gain to attack. So? Oh, okay. No, I'm going to spend four. Not that it's going to get to my turn again, I'm sure, but... I'll buy this one that says draw on it. Uh, this one says draw on it, so I'm going to spend three for this one. And then, just for fun, this one costs three. It has the word draw on it. So I'm going to draw that one. And I have one money left, but I'll just throw it away. And then you get all new cards. Sweet. Boom, boom, boom. Protego. Gain attack and a heart. A Fred Weasley. Red die business attack. Oh, maybe we can get the Weasleys to line up now. Yeah, that's perfect timing. Uh, then we got Deluminator, which is removed to control from a location. Sure. Oh, definitely we need that one. Yeah, definitely. Uh, all heroes lose two health and cannot gain health this turn. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, lose a health and discard a card. I don't know what I oh, got going on. I got a draw here. still. I'm going to choose this one. Oh, I can't gain health, but I get attack. Oh, I, we, I already got it, but I'm playing my turn because it's fun. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, why am I even drawing? It's not going to get back to me. Well, you're going to... Uh, we're both going to gain an influence and draw a card. Oh, man. I'm going to gain attack because I can't heal. <sighs> Finish him. Uh, draw <laughs> two cards. You get to get an influence and draw a card if you care. Draw two cards, then choose one. Discard no, any care. one card or banish a card in your hand. I'm going to banish this thing. Okay. Then, uh, can't heal, so that does nothing. Any items? No. Draw a card. Remove a control. Uh, gain one. Banish. If it's an item, draw a card. Gain two. We both get attack. And yeah, yeah, whatever. Two. Sure, whatever. <laughs> okay, and I'll put these four here. Heroes win! Yay! <laughs> oh, uh, Zolt saying in his translation, the game he plays, uh, uh, Luna's worded, it, uh, for each item you play, you gain an attack. Oh. See, like sometimes translation, uh, the person translating the game, and then the people checking, like they, things get through that mess things up. I know this when playing competitive card gaming too. When we play at like uh, international tournaments, people will come with different language cards and they like misunderstand how it works. And we have to call over somebody and they have to look up the card text and explain it and stuff. And we have the designer explain it sometimes. Yeah, it's crazy. Hmm. Yeah, sometimes the, whoever's translating the game just misunderstands the card and then it gets printed misunderstood. Wow. Yeah, it happens. It happens. I, I remember happening at LCGs all the time. Are wands <laughs> allowed in Mortal Kombat? Yes, Brett. Finish him. Jacko also says, "What an emotional roller coaster ride this stream had every day." Yes. <laughs> I don't think anyone cried. Has anyone cried? I think that's no, one thing not. I was missing. Oh, I I'm sure. Do we want to make that happen. Ultra Violetta cried when. Oh, Ultra when... Violetta cried. You. Yeah. 
when I was talking yeah. trash about their favorite card. Yeah. I mean, the card was okay. It wasn't. It wasn't bonkers by any means. I did get some attack. James got. Oh, sad. James, that's sad. Okay. I'm sorry, James. I'm sorry. Oh, James, I'm sorry. Rob hurt your feelings. Yeah. Both of you let us totally cry. I told you. All right, we had a cry. We're good. We had someone cry. <laughs> oh, and it's not my favorite. It is now. Forever. Every time I see that card come up, I'm thinking of you. <laughs> it's like the the juice, right? How the we had juice? that discussion about that card and. <laughs> yeah, yeah. The uh, seven, eight. Oh, uh, I don't have enough. Oh, right. I here. forget what it was, but yeah, the, the ally copying one, right? Yeah, the juice. I don't know what the, the juice? first word is. Something juice. The juice. You like it a juice? <laughs> You like it a juice? Oh my gosh. That was fun. Yes. I, I think Rob had uh, some ups and fun. downs on, on that stream as well here. Yeah, once I saw that last encounter in that first game, that was like the straw that broke the camel's back when I was like, hold on. Hold on. This game is throwing all these basically junk cards in our deck and it wants something and, and like it was stopping us from drawing and getting our engines going. And it wants to tell me I have to have two of each card on a single turn. And not to get rid of that thing or we can't win? Like, what is that? I mean, it makes sense. But then I just thought, like, we are in the perfect example where I hate cards like that that are, like, very situational when you have the market deck that can screw you around in a game. Some games you see no draw. Mm -hmm. Some games you see no dice rolling stuff. Of course, that optional rule does help now with that. So if we don't see the dice out and we have a card that needs dice, we just say, wipe it. Yeah. But, but then you might be giving up a whole turn. Because you're like, I don't want to spend this money. We need to see a card desperately so you don't end up buying something. You just waste your whole turn clearing the market. It's like, that sucks too, right? Yeah. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. It's also we were playing blind. But that's... So it's like, but was it designed as like, play this blind? Or do they, no one, nothing explains it ever to play it blind. We just do that ourselves for the fun. Oh, to not look at what the dark arts are going to do. Not yeah, look at what the we just shuffle things do. in. Yeah, but I think that's fun for us. But I don't think that's the way it's intended because they're just in there in clear sleeves. Like, take them out, shuffle them in. Like, it, you could sit there and they don't say, do not read the cards, hide them in. It's part true. of the fun. That's true. So obviously they're play tested over and over again, you know, and, and the game's play tested over and over again, not blindly every time, right? We just true. did that to ourselves. So I always expect the first game to be a little rougher, especially with when we don't know anything coming. What am I doing? Anything. But that's, that's why it's more fun when we win. Yeah, but... On the first like game, more maybe. satisfying, I guess. Yeah. But again, if I see my draw engine, it's like, come on, man. It's like, yeah. And if I don't, uh oh, uh oh. What's the name of that card? Which card? Sorry, the juice. Which card do you want? Starts with a P, but I can't remember. Poly juice or Poly -juice. something. Poly juice. Polymorph juice or something. Something like that. Poly want a cracker juice. Gotta dig through all the cards to find. Yeah, yeah. Polly juice. Give me 15 minutes while I look through the deck to find it. One sec. Oh, sorry. You're talking about the cards for James. Yeah, James says there's a very controversial card coming uh, into the game soon. I'll be anxious to see how you play it. Spicy. Oh, no. We can fight over it. Be here. <laughs> be here for some drama. Stay what box? Tuned. Are, what box is it in, James? We'll we'll make sure we save a James little extra time. So James doesn't know what box it's in. For two reasons. Doesn't have his rules with him, so he obviously doesn't have his game with him. Oh. But also the second reason, he threw the card in the garbage after playing with it because it frustrated him. No so, one will even notice. Yeah, so that's why that's he can't so tell big. us what it is. Yeah. <laughs> it went right in the trash. James, you need to be here for the drama. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, James, call it out if you see it. Yeah, <laughs> I'm curious. I don't know when we're streaming next, but uh, don't tell the description, just the name, please. Zul, Zul, oh, can, trying to keep it yeah, secret. Yeah, wants to know. Doesn't want us to like even start thinking about how it can work until yeah, we yeah. read it. That's okay. It's okay. It's all good. I don't mind. If it's going to cause me to lose my stuff, lose my stuff. People uh, were saying, this... sorry, go ahead, keep going, yeah, keep go going. Ahead, but go people ahead. were saying how they were impressed at your ability to refrain from curse words. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think I heard one very, very low under you did. the breath. They probably heard it because when no. I say it, no, I have a mic right here. So when I when I, I swear under my so breath, quietly, though. when I swear under my breath, I'm swearing like down right into the mic. <laughs> but I think it was so quiet. You mother. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so funny. This son of a bees in chat. <laughs> Oh, that was a fun one. <laughs> I 
I guess that's up for interpretation as well. Well, it's officially the last time we're ever playing this game again. <laughs> yeah, Matthew all here was fuck. Yeah, I said the whole he word. He said the whole thing. I heard I it. I did say the whole word. But it was very quiet and it trailed off for sure. Yes. Thanks to our noise gate and, and <laughs> sound suppression settings. Once my voice gets so low, it should cut it. So you guys can't hear me whisper sometimes the things I say. <laughs> Thanks to technology. That is so funny. Wow. That drained me though, eh? Wow. Yeah, yeah, I know. We got emotional there. We did. We, we put a little too much into it. <laughs> it's supposed to be a nice little casual deck building afternoon of having some fun with Harry Potter, laughing with the chat. And we took it competitive. We were battling over yeah. card rulings. We were like looking stuff up. We we're fighting about relationships and, and couples and buying playstations and like <laughs> everything just it went all over yeah it was a wild ride you don't get this anywhere else i'm telling you but we're in the expansions at this point it's fine isn't that what we say like as we get deeper and deeper in it gets a little more know. wild a little more wild jack was asking hey guys is iss vanguard dead oh there's been a couple of those that have come through and asked is IS i thought i said it was didn't we say on stream or no i don't think we ever officially say it's officially dead but we, we said, like, there's no more coming. It could eventually. I would just say no. I will say no. It's never, you can never say never. Because exactly. I thought that would happen with other games. And we brought them back like a year later and just continued them. But with the amount of games coming, the amount of games I still want to play. And, like, Frosthaven still hasn't hit yet. And, like, if I just start thinking what I would want to play on a weekend, I already, Mel is almost done painting a couple games. And there's games I want to mm -hmm. play instead. That for the foreseeable future, ISS Vanguard will not hit the table over those games. And some of those games could be like 10 session campaigns or so. I don't even know. And then if Frost even hits, and we're playing that like once every weekend, let's say minimum. I'm not playing ISS Vanguard the other day, flipping between those two games. I can't. And ISS Vanguard is too long most times to fit on a weeknight for us. Mm -hmm. I don't want to play it solo. I'm not interested yeah, in no, that I don't, at I, all. I'm not. Mm, yeah. I don't hate it. But it's just not a game for me. I no, don't Jacko, it. I'm sorry. I thought I said at the end of the last one, I think we were done. But I think I always said at the end of those. I like, think, yeah, I think we just, just kind of. Kinda like, if you don't see it scheduled, it's not happening. If it's not the next within the next couple of weeks, we'll just move on. Matthew. But yeah. Thank you. Thank you. No, Miz. I, I, no, 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 no I promise you do no, not. No, no, you have to understand here. Like, I'm, tr I'm not trying to be a jerk. I'm trying to, we all need to improve, including myself. I'm not perfect. Um, but it just reminded me when you said that, like the way people come in and go, you're playing this wrong. It's not the first time someone's come in and said, you're playing it wrong. And then it's like, they're wrong. And then you find out, oh, they've been playing it wrong and teaching it wrong for years, or they've been fighting with people on BGG or in comments or watching videos. You're doing it wrong. And, and they're not even right. And it's like, it happens. Yeah. But no, you're totally fine. No. Please call us out. And yeah, yeah, if yeah. someone learns something, and in this case, you said yeah, that you yeah. had been playing it wrong. Yeah. I'm glad that now going forward, yeah. you'll you be able to play it on easier apologize. mode. <laughs> yes. I, I am super happy if you play this game again. And now you're like, guys, look at, I learned this today. It's like, I feel, I feel like I accomplished something mm -hmm. that you are now like learned something from yeah. the stream. Like normally, like, you know, you might learn how to play a game or should I buy that game or not? Or you know, but like when I can like help people play games better, like it's not what I'm intending to do, but it's like a nice side effect sometimes. Yeah. And sometimes I might make a mistake and you take that and go play it wrong. So that's why I appreciate when someone does call out. And even if you have to call out things that you're not sure just to make sure we're all doing it right, I appreciate it. Not every shot's going to hit the target, right? Right. Because again, there's so many things. English as a second language, translation. Rule book comprehension, people's level of education, understanding um, what the designer's intent was, poor rule books, poor tutorials, people giving the wrong information on Board Game Geek, and like people playing it wrong on other Twitch and YouTube streams and stuff. Like, there's so many ways where like a rule can get messed up and someone can be playing it wrong. It's not the end of the world. We're just playing games. Like, we're chilling. It's a hobby. We should all be having fun. But like, yeah, some of us take it more serious than others, of course. But, but if people are playing it wrong and it's making it more difficult and then they that's put that game said, back on the yeah. shelf, yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's a, that's a problem. No. The other thing, too, is that there's a couple people that are new and have been saying, like, throughout this series, they've been kind of following along and now in the chat live. And um, please don't take offense ever. Like, I, like people don't fully know your... Um, My sarcasm. Sarcasm. 
and my bluntness. Attitude, my, and, yeah, no, no, no. My bluntness, yes. Yeah, like please, no. He, he. <laughs> you're fine. Yeah, you're yeah. fine. <laughs> my critical, you know, my my willingness to just be a critical of things and always question things, and yeah. I do that all the time. Also, our everything. back and forth too, right? Yeah, like, yeah. Sometimes people think like you snap or I snap. Uh, like but today, it, when you were, when I was trying to think, I'm trying to think of my line of play, and you're like. You say something to interrupt me, I'm like, ah, Yeah, I know. Let me finish. I'm trying to do it all in order and remember all the triggers and do do my turn the most efficiently and gain everything. Like this scenario needs to die. So I like know, know. as soon as you start talking in my ear and I'm trying to like try to like go with my line, it's instantly I want to bite you. I just want to like <laughs> ah, like a dog. Like you try to take my bone, you know? That's what happens. I don't, I don't mean anything. No, I, I know. And I think it's funny. And yeah. then it's funny to see like little comments. Yeah. But I'm just saying like, cause there's new people that don't know. We're yeah, fine. Yeah. It's all good. Everybody's fine. I'm not aware of this. Yeah. I am. Yeah. 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 But I just don't want anyone to take offense or, you know, feel any kind of way. Yeah. yeah. Don't take it personal. Yeah. Um, Tony, thank you for your support today. Thanks for oh, joining yes, the channel. Thank you, Matthew, thank you. thank you for the super chat too, by the way. Thank you. And thank you, thank you, thank you. And Zoltoto says, I've been sitting here for five hours watching. It's been five hours also. Yes. Uh, I even gave up watching a handball match uh, with a team I love. Wow. Thank you. Did you record it at least to watch later? <laughs> thank you. <laughs> uh, we says, appreciate that. That's awesome. Uh, also says has it has blast watching yeah. that's good and zolt says when are you planning the to stream the second monster box just to make myself free um, um i don't know probably I don't know yet maybe next weekend maybe one weeknight i don't know yeah because the problem is is i mean five hours but we did we did no stop no but and talk. on a weeknight on, on a weeknight night. we would take it a little more get into it quicker yeah uh we also might only do one attempt that's true yogi thank you, you for the yogi, thank gifted you, thank, memberships thank you Thank you so much. You thank were too kind. You. Thank you. Thank Yogi you. just pulled an all-nighter, basically, and uh, is now getting loopy and clicking the wrong buttons and stuff. But uh, we appreciate <laughs> it anyway. Yogi, thank you so much. Yogi, thank you so much. Thank you for the support. That went to some from to some familiar names. So thank yeah, you. Yeah. Thank you. Yes, yes. Other troublemakers. It's Sunday for you, not for us. Still Saturday here. Yeah, but Yogi, what time was it when we started streaming, though? Like five hours ago. What time was it for you? What time was it for you? It was like middle of the night, right? It's like it was like two in the morning or something, right? Or or three in the morning or something like that. I'm probably wrong. I feel like. I mean, like I'm not doing much today. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, thanks. Oh, Yogi. Mike is here. Mike is here. Says cool. so thanks, Yogi. Mike's got the dive beside me. Jackpot man, fourteen months. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for the congratulations on the seventeen thousand subscribers. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thanks, thanks, thanks. That's so nice. Thanks to all of you for subscribing as well. And Yogi's been playing uh, Hogwarts Legacy for the start. Oh, you're playing the whole time we were playing. I get it. I get it. Yeah. Uh, uh Belco. Elko says, thank great you. game, and congrats on 17K. You two are great. Thank you, thank Aww, you. Very thank sweet. You. Thank you, thank you. We're not that great. We're, like, good, but I don't think we're great. I mean, but, no, I'm just hey, kidding. <laughs> everyone sees, like I said, just like with rules, everyone sees it a different way. <laughs> oh, Minion Q is here, too. Oh, uh, that's cool. Looks like I've missed everything, but thanks to whoever gave me the sub. That was Yogi. That was Yogi. Yogi Bear gave you the sub. Uh, Sean also just noticed. Or the, the membership. Membership, not a sub. The membership. Oh, yeah, sorry. Subs sorry. are different things. Uh, oh yeah, Mel was great. Sorry. Yes. Yeah, I think we already did, we already discussed that. Yeah, we already great. discussed that yeah, this yeah, stream. Yeah. We don't have to discuss it every stream. Yeah, yeah. When you yeah. average it out, maybe we're uh, we're not. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I was averaging. Sorry. Oh, you're decent. Yeah, I was like meh, and then I averaged it with the great, and that's why I said we're just good. You see, I averaged yeah. oh, it together, so it yeah. like kind of brought I brought her down a little bit if you put them together. That's why I said we. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Brett, we are. We are getting closer to the gazillion subscribers. So, yes, thank you so much. On if you haven't way. subscribed, help us get to a gazillion. <laughs> All right. Well, oh, uh, my I'm officially God. hungry, tired, loopy. That is uh, so yeah, funny. things are getting silly. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, we appreciate uh, the support. 
Janet, thank you again for the congratulations. Um, Janet's been playing Hoplo for four weeks of Hoplo today. How are you finding it, Janet? Do you like oh, it? Oh, nice. And how did the game go? It went. It went. <laughs> um, we have to. Um, yeah, I don't know. You uh, have to watch. Yeah, we'll play There's box two later. Roller coasters. Yeah, yeah. yeah, but we, you we were made saying it to box two. That's all we'll say. Yeah, and you were saying box two is uh, yeah where you got stumped. So it should be interesting. Yeah. So stay tuned. We definitely will schedule the next box. It could be later this week. It could be on the weekend. Um, we just kind of like kind of work out the schedule for the week still a little bit. Yeah. Based on Mel's painting, Kyle. He's, Kyle still should be coming Monday, but I mean that could change, right? So we just got to double check. Um, and yeah, then we'll kind of stick Harry Potter in there somewhere. Also looking at what other games you're going to play. Also, I do want to play Hogwarts Legacy, stream some more of that. I do want to stream some more Hogwarts Legacy and play some more of that. So yeah. And again, I don't know how long I'll even be streaming that or playing that. As long as people are watching. As long as just, I'm not bored of it. You know what I mean? So I definitely think I'm going to probably focus on that too this week a little bit more. And uh, just keep playing it. Even if I binge it and like rush through it, like I'm not, I'm not trying to rush. I want to enjoy it, but I might just, you know, take a couple weeks to jam that in there and play it as long as everyone's having fun. And then after that, I'll, I'll have my video game fix done and then I can focus back on other games during the week and stuff. But yeah. John also says, rest up, Robin Mel. You deserve extra large pepperoni and pineapple pizza. I do want it to get takeout. It today. does feel like, like a pizza night. And especially too, because tomorrow with the Super Bowl, it's going to be busy takeout night. So if we do it today, oh, yeah, true. then we don't have to worry about the rush. Yeah, yeah. And I'll just make dinner tomorrow. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, it definitely feels like that. Um, yeah, tomorrow is dismantling laptop, as I don't want to do it tonight anymore. I was going to do it if we if we the stream wasn't so long. I was going to. Take apart the laptop I've been playing Harry Potter on and uh, add some thermal pads to drop the uh, drop the CPU temp down so I don't have to throttle it and uh, then I can like crank it to get more frames. But uh, I'll do that tomorrow where I have more of a focused mind so I can keep track of where all the screws go and not lose any. Uh, but that's that's what I'm doing tomorrow. And I don't know about watching the Super Bowl. We don't follow football. Uh, and the only reason I watched it last year was because it had the best halftime show basically ever. Oh yeah, um, this one is the best the best group of artists ever. Uh, fight me? No, I'm just kidding. It depends what music you listen to, of course. Um, but I, I was so I was so wanted to see that because I know they put so much work and playing that for months and all this stuff. This one's Rihanna, so it should be it, good. I do like Rihanna too. Mm -hmm. I've seen Rihanna live um, before uh, back in my my youth. I, I saw Rihanna at a. Uh, festival of con different artists and stuff. I don't know if anyone else is with her, but yeah, they might do little guest appearances and stuff. Yeah, but yeah, Ron, Ron is awesome. Mm -hmm. I usually like the the um, halftime show. Yeah, and it's just fun to watch. I think, right? Mm -hmm. Interesting. Uh, what are you having tomorrow? Do you watch the Super Bowl? And oh, and do you watch? Super I mean, we have in the past. Yeah, we just we, have we like, like pizza and pizza wings, and wings and or something. Yeah, yeah nothing but crazy. Yeah. We don't do the whole day thing either. We don't have people over. We don't do no. potlucks or and tailgating and all this crazy stuff. No. You know, barbecues outside, none of that, because it's like freezing cold here and snowing usually. So we just get some pizza or whatever. Oh, yeah, all the commercials. Yeah, the commercials are fun to watch. But but you can just you watch that on YouTube. Yeah, like, they right just will after. do a compilation of all the commercials. Yeah. Like that, that night even, you turn on YouTube and someone's got a video showing every single commercial all in one video. And you can just catch them all there. Save yourself some time. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, yeah, last year was cool because like the like Eminem, Dr. Dre, oh, yeah. Snoop Dogg, and all that. I've seen all of those live like when I was younger. Was um, so it was very nostalgic for me, mm -hmm. definitely seeing it's not them. long enough though. I know that's why it's like not it worth feels it. like a commercial, yeah. And we're cord cutters, so we don't get the Super Bowl, like we don't have cable, uh, we stream or whatever. So, uh, to get the Super Bowl with American commercials is like illegal. With Canadian commercials costs like, I think like $20, $25, I think, in Canada to stream it legit if you don't have a cable subscription. So like paying $25, that's like, that could be an expansion. That could be like two packs of sleeves. Yeah, that could be like five paint paint bottles. Yeah, that's true. That's true. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, if for a game when I don't even know what teams, I think I know the teams though because I did look it up. It's, yeah, it was like the, the Chiefs and, and the Eagles, Eagles, right? Yeah. Kansas City mm -hmm. and 
Eagles? Philadelphia. Is it Philadelphia still? Yeah. Only I know because I looked it up for oh, about okay. it yesterday. The green versus the reds. Yeah. In some sports ball. Um, but yeah. Mmm, paintballs. Hey, boomer. You know. <laughs> I'm not a boomer. Get out of my parents are boomers. By the way, everyone calls anyone a What's boomer. What's the age of a boomer? Boomers are like the people like that were born, born after the... World War II. When oh, people okay. came back from World War II, they all, you know, got a little crazy and children started popping out everywhere. Mm. That's a boomer. Someone who's born in like, I don't even know, in like the 50s or oh, Okay, I was thinking like the 60s, but yeah, Is probably. It the 60s? I don't know. No. It's after World War II, right? Or is it different? But I don't war? know like the actual, like, isn't there cutoffs for all of these, like, technically that you I can know. Google? The boomers now the term people just use for like older people parents and older you know kids love you but we're the term parents boomer. so what, yes. like i mean i guess yeah so yeah, yeah but our parents yes yeah our parents are in the boomer generation i think yeah I'm pretty sure uh minion yes i have seen some of the videos on army painters website for their uh new speed paint line and i am very excited I think they come out april something i can't remember the exact date but i think it's like the 20 something maybe the 16th i don't know exactly the date but i'm super excited especially for the metallics i cannot wait to try those it's oh, oh it's 1946 to 64 okay yeah so our parents are yeah boomers. yeah yeah that makes sense yeah, and honestly, like oh, a, we are Gen Z. What's the Gen Z group though? There is a weird group. I'm like, uh, because aren't we in like a mix? Yeah, where it's like kind of like an overlap. Yeah, there's like some are like yeah, but I read something cool with like, oh, I always read these cool things that like things like um, starting in this year, they say things like uh, you know. Oh, something about like some kids or like people born now like won't know what it was like before the internet and things like that like there was other ones oh gen z i'm not gen z or gen x uh, what's the next one then because i'm not that rob is gen, uh, gen no. x is 1964 to 80. there's one that's like early 80s that's before the next one starts off i don't know what gen that is but there's like a little weird one that like overlaps Gen Y well, got mixed in with millennials for some reason yeah i don't know whatever okay, all of it doesn't matter to me okay whatever the next after gen X. mentally i'm like six <laughs> and uh you know my body feels like i'm 80 I, I don't know what's going on like who knows so whatever oh i just God. have fun each day i don't worry about yeah gen big hair <laughs> Anyways, let's get oh, thank here. you for the subscriber. I am hungry. <laughs> now let's talk and Super Bowl and pizza and wings. Uh, let's go get some filthy takeout. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. And then just drool on the couch for the rest of the evening. Yeah. There are two boomers. One after World War II and after... Oh, the Korean War, right? Yeah, oh. I knew there was another war. That's why I wasn't sure. I thought for a second, like, maybe it wasn't World War II because then my parents are too young for that. But yeah, there was like, yeah, it's basically when everyone come back from the war, then yeah. Oh, Janet, thank you. So I, I'm Gen Y. Yeah. And you're Gen see, X. No, but there's one. But then what's between... the one? What's who's? What if you're one uh, born in 81? Or 80. 80 is Gen X. No, but there's so like. that's wrong? Yeah, it's, it's, it is wrong. Yeah, oh. yeah. Get off my lawn was my grandpa. That's definitely yeah, my yeah. grandpa. There's a weird one that's like kind of in between. Um in between the gen y and the gen x thing and that's where like i fit in and based on the description of like what it is because like i think of mine is like I, I was like late 1980 right so it's like almost 81 but in that year oh based and, on yeah. like the month you're born no not even the month but oh. it, it's just like based on what they grew up with and experienced and taught and what the, was going on in the world and all that stuff yeah my virtual one <laughs> yeah millennials are Born from 1981 to 96, but why not 1980? Like, what makes you a millennial? Like, you know what I mean? I don't know. So I'm a millennial. Geriatric millennial. <laughs> Gen y. I forget, but I read one time there's like a, a gen in there that kind of overlaps those two, but it's in between. <laughs> where like they still learn this and have these influences from this generation, but they also have the influences from this generation. But they're like this special in between and they see things a little different. I forget what it was, but then I was like, oh, yeah, Rob's generation. Yeah, whatever that is in there. Yeah, there's one in the middle there. <laughs> yeah.
Yeah, I don't get the terminology either, and it doesn't matter for anything. <laughs> no, it's but it's literally funny that it's, useless it's, knowledge. It's creating, it is it's creating so much chat. It's, I love it. Yes, the blip. A, You're the blip. I'm the blip, yeah. <laughs> I'm the anomaly. Oh, uh, that's so funny. But yeah. Now it, everybody's it, Googling it that useless. doesn't know. It only matters to HR. <laughs> yeah, it's, use, it's all useless. Who cares? Yeah, HR, when they're interviewing and hiring, like... <laughs> What type of people are these? When were you born? Oh, you're one of them. Oh, you expect this from us? Oh, you, you, we can't fool you? Yeah, yeah. Anyways, we get it, Rob, you're special. Oh, I'm special, all right. <laughs> no, no, but I did read one time. There's like this weird thing where like one in the like early 80s, there's like, that's not really covered by any of the gens. And it's like, wait, but what about this gen? It's like, it depends also where you lived and stuff too. And like what you're influenced by and all that kind of stuff. Hmm. But yeah, I don't know who makes this stuff up. And What's whatever. it like? That right, doesn't mean anything. What is it right now? So people being born right now. What are I don't they? Know. Are we back to A again? Gen yeah. A. <laughs> Gen doesn't mean shh. <laughs> Zennials. Oh, is that what it is now? Now we're Gen Z. Okay, so what happens after Gen Z? Out of line. <laughs> yeah, they're just in trouble. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah Have just, fun with the world. We left you. are just going to live in your basement Sucker. forever. <laughs> all right. Thank you all for watching. This has been fun. Uh, and we'll see you in the next stream. Everyone enjoy the rest of the day. Enjoy your Super Bowl. We're taking tomorrow off. So enjoy your Sunday. We played this game today because a few people were like, don't play it on Super Bowl day because I can't be here. So we did it for you. Hope you enjoyed. And if you're watching this later, hit the like button. Thank you for watching. We apologize for everything we say. Okay? <laughs> everything that happened in the stream, we apologize. We apologize. Do not take any of it seriously. Um, <laughs> except for that, that one card that has the three attack, or the attack, and you have to hit all villains and it generates an extra attack. That was serious. No, it removes a, it removes a control from the Whatever it does, the card sucks. It's a situational garbage card. That's the only thing that matters in this whole stream. <laughs> I think Ultra Violetta left, so I'm definitely, I think so too. definitely using this moment. If not, they're gone now. I'm getting in the final word. That's all I'm doing here, being a dirty troll. Anyways, <laughs> thank you all for watching. We'll see you in the next stream. Bye-bye. <laughs>